Hello? Uh, hello? 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 Ha ha. Hala? Ha ha. Hala? Oh, hi, Mark. Hello? <coughs> What I meant to say was shit. What I meant to say was shit. What I meant to say was... My dudes, what's going on? How's it going today, chat? Beautiful day for some beautiful... I don't know! It's a Pixel Thursday today, baby! That's what I'm talking about! That's what we love to see! That's what we live for! Bada 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 bada! Uh, world six? World is the world six here? Huh? Huh? Welcome to the endless void. Oh, one sec. Ah. Uh huh? Uh, I bet you're not. I, I bet you, Craze, it's not going to, bro. But thank you, man. Thank you for the three months. Yo. Ray's thank you for the three months. We also have Mr. Willie coming out with the Ted Gifterino. Weasel with the 420, baby. You love to see it. Heads up. Red hat gone. Red hat gone. Thank you, dude. Thank you, thank you, dude. We also have, like I said, we have Mr. Willie coming out with the 10 Gifterinos. Yo, thank you, thank you, thank you, dude. And we also have Games Master with the three months. Thank you, man. Gold Gaming coming in with the primer. Thank you, guys more people to add to the new YouTube video for the people that have uh, subscribed to support the channel dude yo the shirt yo dude I've had this shirt dude this is this has been like my my alpha testing shirt for a while bro you know my dudes what's going on you know I I had to have that dude that's like our that's like our slogan shit to think that it's not our slogan is crazy talk all right but how you guys doing how goes the dream uh, sorry, I was not feeling very good yesterday. I ended up having a uh, molten volcano stomach, so I decided that I was going to uh, take the day off. Well, I didn't really take the day off. I worked on the video mostly, pretty, mu pretty much the whole entire time. Uh, I believe I'm at uh, five minutes out of nine minutes and 40 seconds, so I have about, I I'm over halfway done. So I should have about, I don't know, I should be, I should be done by like fucking Friday, I hope. Yo, juice box coming in. Poing. Well, it's actually poing, but I mean, I had a lovely Wednesday. How about you? You know, we're, we, you know, we, uh, well, to be fair, I just woke up. I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I did just wake up. Or maybe I've just been in a coma this whole entire time and uh, none of you guys are real. Maybe you're just a figment of my imagination. Maybe, maybe this is all just a... Schizophrenic, uh, situation. <laughs> We're gonna power through this week work session until you start playing Kingdom. I mean, I thought about playing Kingdom. It used to make my stomach so acidic that stomach lining would start eroding. Yeah, that's about that's the level that I get. Yeah, exactly. So you know exactly what I'm talking about. What is the next gaming stream? What do you mean? What do you mean next gaming stream? Okay, thanks, bro. Thanks, thanks for the hundred. Thanks for the hundred bits. Just put K. What do you mean? What do you mean next gaming stream? Oh, is it? Oh, is it because I like this? Oh, 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 the skill. I thought you were talking shit. I thought you were just like, you know, bro. Can we not have another two hours of just chatting, please? Like, can we? Can we? Can we fucking get it together? Can we have some. Can we have some. Can we have a gaming stream? <laughs> actually, actually, thought you were out here talking shit, dude. That's too funny. Uh. What part of my plan is still Wednesday, dude? Hey, man, there's still places that's probably Tuesday in the world. My life has ex been extreme stress. Uh, I bet. Pixel Thursday, I think you meant to say Bird Gut Day. Maybe one of these days, dude. Maybe. Do you know that G reference? I did not hit her. I did not owe. Oh, hi, Mark. I know the oh, hi, Mark par part. I don't know about I did not hurt, hit her. Yo, thank you for the hype train level four chat. Yo, thank you, guys. Hope you feel better. Yeah, I'm doing better. When are we gaming? Yeah, we might be gaming. 
Wait, this is a gaming stream? Yeah, bro, bro, okay, when World 6 comes out, dude, we're gonna be gaming so fucking hard, okay? Like, you don't understand how much gaming is going to happen. Wait, there's games on this stream? But sometimes. Idolize it's your paralysis demon to keep you in a coma. Yeah, imagine waking up and Eidolon never existed. I would literally just wake up and start making Eidolon. Two hours, when was that? We are four hour streams now, dude. Hey, we didn't we didn't just chat for four hours, dude. That's not true. What are you talking about? Uncle Daxter coming in with the seven months, dude. Thank you, brother. Thank you, thank you, dude. Watch you fail at getting a new nugget. Oh, that's what it is. It's from a bad movie called The Room. Remind me never to watch that. Yes, Choo Choo. Can you fail the TD after the 55 ways and five? Yes, ex yeah, Paka. You as soon as you hit the 55 ways and 5k damage, just leave. Yeah, there's no reason to stay any longer. People act so unnatural in that movie. You know who also act really unnatural in movies? Paranormal Activity. They're really, they're really unnatural. It's almost like it's a fucking ghost. Yeah, I've been here for the ram at the bottom of the screen the whole time. Yeah, well, I mean, of course, that's that's why. Oh, chat, Oso. So you guys know Ramsey, right? You know our mascot? You know our boy that rolls across the screen continuously? Well, he needs a he needs a family, chat. He needs a family. Yo, Adam, coming in for the nine months, dude. Thank you, brother. So I, I'm 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 gonna be cooking up three more Rams. Three more Rams, chat, are going to be cooked up, dude. So, there uh, isn't the family in the back. Well, well, that's one of them. So we already have one done, but we still need the other two. So we need to we need to make the other two. You know, we got we got Ramsey, which is rolling around the corner. The one sleeping is called Rem. Get it? Because 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 Rem sleep. His name's Rem because he's the he's the sleepy Ram. Get it? <laughs> <laughs> pretty cool and then and then we'll be uh boo shut the fuck up one green one blue what uh i was thinking i was thinking i was thinking one red personally i was thinking of like uh like a dude don't boo me i don't get it can you repeat it one more time bro it's never mind but yeah we need more we need more chat we need more all right that's what it's come down to don't forget to use asset three this time. Yeah, thanks, dude. Imagine you wake up in the past. The future was just a dream. It is just a dream. He needs a mistress. He doesn't need a mistress. Okay. If we give Ramsey a mistress, here's what's going to end up happening. Ramsey's not going to be relatable anymore because we need. It doesn't make any sense because it because if we don't get mistresses, then neither does Ramsey. More whams. Yeah, we more we need more debit data whams, chat. Red, green, and black wool Rams, dude. What? Well, I mean, it's not the same. Ramsey having a wife won't be relatable at all either. Exactly. Ramsey doesn't need a wife, okay? Ramsey needs to be the Sigma that he is. All right? We got to keep that Sigma mindset, all right? So the Island Ram is an alternative version of your Ram. Even G is taking multiverse roots for his Rambler. Would it not be great? Would it not be smart? Yo, Spooter! Yo, thank you for the primer, dude. Thank you, dude. Power Rangers Ram? Well, I I mean, it's not like they're gonna it's not like they're gonna merge together to be to make like Ramatron. You know what I'm saying? That's not gonna happen, dude. Ramsey needs about three to five wives. <laughs> There's Ramsey sitting in like this fucking Conan Conan position with like with like three wives all be like oh Ramsey it's like now we're starting to get into fucking furry fan lore bro let's not get to that level all right it's just a fucking ram okay he's not some kind of goddamn superhero here how about friend zone girl I think we all relate a friend zone? No, dude. I already saw the sub Caitlyn controversy, bro. I don't. I don't. We don't. We don't need to have any more friend zoning happening in ones. That's enough for one lifetime, bro. Why does a dude get one? I mean, Queen Dude, because because <laughs> because King Dude's a fucking Giga Chad, bro. That's why, bro. Ramsey doesn't give bonuses the level that King Dude does. Okay. Ramsey, Rambo, Sean, and Paul. Paul's an alien, Sally. 
did play Sifuji. I don't know what that is. What if Ramsey gets a sister? <sighs> but I mean, considering uh, that doesn't make any sense, because here's the thing. Only 1% of our chat, actually less than 1% of our chat has female in it. The rest of it's male. So I mean, going from that demographic, I don't think we need a female Ram in our, in our, in our family. I think I think it should be, I think it should be a sigma group personally. So did Ramsey also go out and buy milk? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Ramsey's dad R Ramsey's dad did go buy milk. What's Rem's relation to Ramsey? Uh uh lazy older brother. I was watching the ITTV review prep. I just saw a pair of boobs on my screen and I'm like, "Oh, right. That was uh Ah, oh, the right, right, right. What is that from? Oh, 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 that wasn't, that wasn't, that wasn't boobs. That was, uh, uh, the freaking uh, the, the Nikki cosplay or whatever it was. Music from Sl Castle Crash? Yeah, probably. For making family, I'd like a lost honker that just follows them around and just honks ever so often. Storage access from everywhere is pretty goaded. I mean, true, it is. Plot twist, King Dude is actually Queen Dude behind the mask, behind the queen. The mask is Kakashi. I don't know if it's I don't know if it's Kakashi. Oh, thanks, Dream Elements. Thanks for letting me know that I'm finally alive. Make a black ram. I don't know. May, maybe I should. Maybe you should. That is that is that is sexiest. G. <laughs> it is that's sexiest. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad you find rams to be the sexiest. It's kind of weird, but all right. Why so misogynistic, G? Oh, did you learn that? Did you learn that new word in the dictionary today? It was a bit. That's a big word confirmed. That's a three point word. Bro, bro. <laughs> Will you be playing Pal World when it's released? Actually, I was I was thinking about it. I'm not gonna lie. I've been I've been looking forward to Pal World for a very long time. So I might play Pal World when it releases. When it when does Pal World release, anyways? Squiddy in the house, dude. Yo, what's happening, bro? Who brought up a Ramenstein, dude? I don't even, what I don't even know who Ramenstein is. Yeah, Power World's a Pokemon with guns. Yeah, exactly. Since Rem, why not count Ram as every count to fall asleep? Yeah, I guess so. There's Ramsey, the bird, and ate the bee. Can't say he did. Giga Ram time, a Ger German metal band. Yeah, it's supposed to be this month, right? I never thought I would see the day Power World actually got released. Uh, yeah, I thought it was a meme for a while. I'm not going to lie. When I first saw the trailer, I'm like, there's no fucking way Power World's real. Yeah, it's real. It's real and it's fucking releasing very, very soon. I can't wait, dude. Yeah, seven days, chat. Next week. Next week it's supposed to release, dude. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be 100% honest, though, chat. I think it's going to be a fucking shit, an absolute shit show. 100% absolute shit show. I think Pal World is just going to be <laughs> just a bunch of bunch of bad, bro. I had to educate myself so I don't get bit influenced by misogynist streamers, dude. Yeah, true. Most commonly known for Oh right, Robinstein do host. Alright, yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Now I now everything makes sense. Thinking of ever going back to Hartwood. Um you know, I might play Heartwood maybe if if they release Dungeons and Dungeons is actually good. I don't know. The problem is, is it just wasn't fun. Like it was fun for a while, but then but then it just got monotonous and boring. Like if I want to play a monotonous and just a monotonous game that at least is somewhat fun, I'll just go play RuneScape. You know, is that a dead game? All right, it still holds a concurrent thousand viewers. The idea of being kicked around so damn long. I hope it's fun at least. Yeah, right. Pal World, World 6? Well, no, obviously World 6 would reign superior, but you think World 6 is going to come out in January? Lava said February. Is the name, I guess, Bubble Worth over Quick Slap after Quick Slap gets like 2,500? Um, well, it's damage. Damage is damage, right? And I mean, it's a multiplier bubble for the uh, mages, but I mean, obviously Quick Slap is... So, so the thing is, is Quick Slap scales way harder than name, I guess, or Big Meaty Claws, right? Because you're not scaling off M pure HP, you're scaling off movement speed. So, so the the uh, the scale the scale has a much higher of a multiplier, uh, just for the sole fact because you don't because back then you didn't get a lot of movement speed, right? So, but now since we get a disgusting amount of movement speed, it just cranks it to the nines, right? 
can be worse than multiplayer Pokemon. Yeah, Craftopia is still in early access. They make Pal World too. I mean, I like I like Craftopia. I thought Craftopia was amazing. Isn't it? Bro, I actually have the biggest brain idea. Rom, a nerdy ram, and rum, a drunk unemployed ram. Can't be more relatable than those two. Just a, just a ram with giant fucking glasses would be the cutest thing ever, dude. And he, and he always pushes up his glasses like this. Uh, actually, actually, that's not true. <laughs> Call him Rom, dude. I don't know about rum. All right, I, I don't know if we want to make a drunken pirate ram. RuneScape's better than Heartwood. Yeah, you goddamn right it is. Quick slap can be increased easier than HPMP because of speed pause, since there's a load of ways to boost uh, movement speed compared to HPMP. Yeah, but at the same time as well, is uh, uh, movement speed doesn't really get juiced out until Onyx statues. Once I found malnourished in Redbone and Craftopia, yeah, they, they, yeah, yeah, yeah. That rum never spills his drink, then. That ram name is chat, bro. Ram with a giant. No, I don't know about that. I don't know about that, Wolf. You're 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 digging down into the ran the wrong fandom here, dog. Trust, bro. Million dollar idea, dude. We got a pat in that. What? Just have behind me. Just just uh just just rum. Just walking back and forth on the table, like never spilling his drink, like he's walking down the fucking path, like Jack Sparrow. Cool ram wearing glasses, of headphones. Just yeah, just bop into the song, dude. Rim the DJ ram, dude. We're just chat. There's just we're just gonna look behind me, and there's just gonna be like forty different types of rams, and be like, oh, name every name every ram. Oh, that's Rom. That's Rum. That's Rim. <laughs> that's that's Ramsey. Just fucking bro. It's just gonna get to a point. It's like I ba I'm basically just a Pokemon trainer at that point. Blam, it's a blobby light wearing a ram costume. It's in a fucking imposter ram. It's not even a real ram. It's it's a fucking blobby light, dude. Oh my god. A watermelon named Rind. Yeah, it's just it's just a watermelon that's got like fucking marker, just permanent marker driven, written on his face. No, I don't have the pink bandana yet, unfortunately. I think I'm at like uh 450. That one Steve has a black sheep of the family, dude. Boobo, Boobo or DK Ram like wearing the plague mask do a helmet. Yeah, we had somebody that made that last time. It was it was it was not did not work out. We got we got to think simplistic, right? We got to think that we got to think very simplistic. Very 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 simplistic. How about a ram that pretends it's G in the back? Well, that can be Ram. That can be the nerdy one. Should have bought Asprite while it was on sale, dude. Start cooking already. Journey Ram. Ah, oh, hey, hey, Toby. That's, hey, that's big smart, dude. Journey Ram, bro. Rams in, Ram and Fire, bro. Gee, what should be the first thing you can do when I hit World 4? Get elite classes. Put, put all your characters in lab until you hit Killer Brightside, and then push to elite classes, and then once you get to your, once you get all your elite classes, you're going to take your Divine Knight, and you're going to push all the way to World 5. That's your, that's, your, that's what you should do. And obviously, obviously do the quest line for, for the, for the parsnip guy up top. Because you can't get through without it. Well, I mean, you can, there's a, there's a workaround, but don't. My dudes, what's going on? Hey, Donkey, how's you doing, bro? How you doing, man? What was the frog's name, by the way? Oh, uh, which one? For the party dungeon? Froggers? Or, or Kermit? Are you talking about Kermit? For the for the Iron Man? Yeah, it was fucking Kermit, dude. Baby Ram with the hype train glasses, dude. We do not need a baby ram. No, I no baby ram. Because then that then we have to explain where did the baby ram come from. And then and then I would have to explain that instead of the dad going out for the milk, the mom went out for milk. Alright. Why DK? Because DK takes the lowest amount of funding to push. And he has the, his, his respawn mechanic only requires one talent point to be at peak proficiency. So if you, if you're, if you're actively pushing, that's going to be the ideal. If you only AFK push, then elemental sorcerer is your best. Doing tower defense three since 2 PM, finally at the last on wave 190. Yeah. I don't know why you guys are pushing to 190. That's crazy. What's up, Colby? Welcome on in, dude. Going to have to make a few sprites to give us some ideas. I'll put them in the discord. Oh, for the, for the Rams. 
I mean, yeah, if you guys got ideas. If you guys got ideas and I like the Rams enough, I'll just send them over to fucking Schmookles. And then Schmookles will, will make them up, dude. And then who knows, they might be turned into merch. Why can't they just be orphans who band together? What is this, the fucking Powerpuff Girls? No, no, they're not. I, what, what, what is everybody just gonna be Batman? I'm Batman. They kidnapped him off topic. How long did it take to grind for Isla Skiller Trophy? Uh, three months. Three months for me, I think. Prank the trickster ramp. Dun dun bat ram. <laughs> Bo ram. <laughs> Franz is going to do 210 TD tomorrow. Yeah, that's because Franz, oh, that's all that Franz does is TD. Franz just smokes fucking bloods and does TD. <laughs> like, I would, I would expect the man who does that tw basically every stream to fucking be pushing high wave TD. Each 10 levels gives more bonus low. And the guide guy, bro. Yeah, right. Powerpuff Rams. Just got royal traps. Are those good for to go for max of critters? Yeah, they're good. Spider Ram. High wave super ram, dude. Hey, hey. Oh, Steam made it so you can hide certain games. So I'm hiding my idol games and play at idol skin. Oh, sweet. I can hide my H games. Nice. So chat can't see what I'm playing. I can't wait to play Honey Pop 2 without being judged Ugh. for for research purposes not for any other reasons other than that if you're not royal raps what do you recommend if you don't have egalitarian oh um you, even if you even if you have egalitarian raps um uh traps they don't matter right so you're gonna you're gonna do royal traps regardless because there's no special ui for egalitarian it just gives you more trapping power RG, time to upload the leaks in Discord using your other account. Yeah, true, dude. Hey, man, that game is fun. Honey Pop 2? Yeah, Honey Pop 2 is actually not bad. That's what's wrong of ramming to be talking about? Yeah, true, crazed. Well said. Well said. All right, I'll give you that. Yo, what up, Tomato? What's going on? But shit, we had some good stuff happening in the Discord, dude. Some good stuff since I've been away. Yeah, well, I mean, I've been away for like two days. Oh, so stat stick? Yeah, true. So let's get this, let's, uh, let's get this cooking here. Let me, let me, let me get this ready so we can go over some stuff here. That reminds me of a friend's birthday. I suggested another friend to buy him, gave him a, gave him a furry one, dude. What the fuck? Wait, I thought Lava, I thought Lava added more to the, to the, to the future, future content block. Did he take some away? I thought he took some away. Maybe, maybe he did. Maybe he didn't. As curse as possible. Well, chat, what we have here is we were right. They're not obols. Crazy to believe they're not obols. We knew it. You knew it. I knew it. We all knew it. Out here, general chat, thinking it was fucking obols. It's not obols. New sigils? No, this is supposed to be the new UI. New o o obol UI, bro. This confirms they're obols. If this is if this is confirming obols, lava, you fucking fallen off with your art style. Because if this is obols, fucking, you, this is the worst obols I've ever seen in my fucking life. Okay, you fell off. Of course, they are obols. Yeah, <laughs> you have fallen since you, bro. I've I've been fallen since World Five, bro. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. 25% done with my education. Finished my first semester of school. Give us free tech. So I got a Tektronic TLA 522 logic analyzer for free, dude. Well, I mean, it, was it really free, Squiddy, since you had to pay for school? Was it really free? Or did they just be like, here, we're going to be buying new tech next year or next semester. So here, take these ones because we don't want to dispose of them. So basically, did you just get hand-me-downs and you thought that you got them for free? Definitely not ovals. Look like the green one. Almost more like balls, dude. You said they were 100% ovals last week. I did not say that these were ovals. Joke's on you. I'm from Denmark. I get paid to go to school. I fucking... <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> fucking hell. I mean, well, that's a W. All right? That, 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 that's a W. Yeah, you know, you know, we take those. We take those. I mean, I guess, I guess, I guess, I take the L. All right. 
And it was something they bought from other schools that didn't need it. Ah, oh, yeah, okay. The Moda country cares about education. Hey, chat, I care about your guys' idol on education, all right? That's a little bit different, okay? Does, does, does free schooling teach you about idol on? No. That's why I'm here, all right? I'm your teacher, okay? See you after class. You want to get a better grade, you know what I'm saying? Uh, jokes on you, I'm from Ohio. That's why there's no vid for five months, bro. Dude, it's been like three weeks, okay? Besides, it's not all about YouTube, okay? It's also about it's also about Twitch content, all right? All right. So one thing I so the one thing I've been noticing as well is like when I when I when I when I I was so hyper focusing on like YouTube content that I wasn't really like thinking that streaming was like part of the job to be honest and it's just like well i mean to be honest i feel like i feel like if anything i should be paying attention more to streaming than i should be paying attention to youtube at least how i at least how i see it preschool it doesn't teach about how to min max our gains that's exactly right no videos for a year dude no there's a fucking video coming soon chat we get there dude so technically you haven't made a youtube video all year yeah true true dude true I saw your videos from four years ago. <laughs> you changed a lot. Yeah, they're pretty bad. They're pretty bad. YouTube's work like a constant advertisement for the stream. Yeah, I, 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 I realize that. I th thank you, Ugly Pole. I know. I'm aware. I, I mean, I mean, I, I would understand from people saying, "Oh, hey, I came in from your speed run." like 5 billion fucking times. I understand how that works, but also you got to realize that that was done on stream. So, without stream. You see that you now have two two videos over 100k views? I did see that. I'm fucking super pumped, dude. We finally had two videos at 100k, bro. I know games have ruined me, even considering Le uh, Leaf Blower Revolution, dude. Every idol game is the shit, except for except for the dog shit ones. Yeah, let's go with that. Let, let, let's let's pretend like that that's congrats man thank you dude thank you dude it's possible to unlock t7 plants or uh it, well it's possible it just takes forever and it's like is it really worth it yeah best idol game dude this is a point you deflect chat towards the the failing of past editors no actually i i think no it's it, the thing is is i think all the editors that i have have done fine they've done they've done totally totally what they need to do or whatever it's just um I think if anything as well, it also like kind of kind of goes to show like because I used to think that like my editing style was really, really dog shit, like really bad. And it felt like the amount of work that I put in and what I got out of it wasn't that good. But then I've been I've been watching a lot of other YouTube videos. My fucking editing style is fucking good. It's fire. It's fine. It's it's like it's it's total. It's totally good. I don't I, don't, I was I was I was shitting on myself for no fucking reason. I just had to make. I had to add a little bit of spit shine to it, and just keep on keep on working on the art, the, the editing style I have, and it's fucking good, bro. It's fucking good. You edit more than a lot of people. Yeah, I, I noticed that. I, I I actually really noticed that. A lot of a lot of them are like, um, bro. If you like your editing style, it's fine. Well, so if if I was if I was to. Uh, uh, calculate of what my editing style is or like what level my editing style is I would say I could probably edit for about a uh, 100k subscriber channel I would say I'm not I'm not quite I'm not quite at, at the at the milli but I would say I would say you could not tell the difference if I was editing for a 100k uh, subscriber on the tubers I think I think I have the possibility to get the check mark on YouTube my fellow siege breaker main I'm not siege breaker main what are you talking about so are we thinking of our buffs like cooking or new maybe new equips? I'm, th I'm thinking I'm thinking it's for sure buffs like cooking, a hundred percent. But I think I think it's also spiriting. I think it's spiriting, Chet. I think it's a it, it, it's it, I'm still I'm still saying that this is spiriting, a hundred and ten percent, guaranteed. This is not spiriting, or it's gonna call it's gonna be called something stupid, like slime rancher. But I, I here's the thing, I don't get how we get from this. To fucking this. Like, what? 
There are different rarities for the buff. Maybe it's RNG and we have to re-roll re re like purples or legendaries on each one of these bonuses. Looks like the function's similar to lab nodes damn near connection range. Don't say that. Decrays take that out of existence. Talent trees for the pets. Clash Royale perks. No more RNG, please. I like... Okay, I like a little bit of RNG. It's okay. It, like, it's okay not to like RNG, but like, I feel like every RPG needs a tad of R RNG no matter where you go. Could be called like evolution or something where if you evolve slimes become more fit for survival. Why don't we just call it... Let, let's just fucking split the middleman in half and let's just stop... stop Stop being like that and just call it fucking realm. All right, let's call it for what it is. Let's just say it's realm. Feed the crops to, sl to the slime, dude. Then Lava say World Six won't have RNG. Yeah, well, Lava also said this game wouldn't have fucking pay to win mechanics, and look what happened. Okay, so I mean, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. All right, you can't. It's, you can take his words for some things, and you can't for others. Okay, all I all I'm gonna say is you have to you have to wait to see. Okay, I am I am not. I am not saying yes or no to any of these until I actually see definitive proof. All right. Hey, yo, I'm six months old in this game. How would I know? Hey, I have a feeling World 6 won't have RNG, but we'll have an extreme grind. You know what? If, if RNG or extreme grind, either way, it doesn't really matter for me because I'll be there for it. He did say that lab is a troll, dude. Absolutely. Is it a farming bonus? Don't judge me. Just throwing things. Well, for one, I won't. I won't judge you. For two, I'll probably judge you. For three, the judging is in a caring way. I, think it, I guess in more of a parasocial context. I guess if that's how you want to put it. So I mean, Bloomy joins the fight. So how do we go from? I, okay, so I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be completely honest to your trip. I am very, very confused with this whole situation here, okay? So we got things like this, this, and this, right? All of these UIs, okay? Sp supposedly for this third fucking skill. And then all of a sudden we got this. Okay? We also got fucking this, dude. Like, okay, we have those two, and then we have these three. It, the, the, these 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 UIs don't make any sense. Let him cook, bro. Chill. But that's the whole point of this part of the stream. We we're supposed to theory craft this shit. But they, we're supposed to take the hints that it gives us to try to make a decent and what we think this is gonna be. But holy fuck, man, this doesn't make any goddamn sense. Unless these are category tabs. Okay. It's gonna be trekking. I think these might boost other skills. So I think there's I think there's gonna be like tabs that it's like these are slime monsters. So there's gonna be like magma slimes, uh uh water slimes, earth slimes, blah 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 blah. And then you go over to Bloomy, and the Bloomies are gonna have like sunshine bloomy, flower bloomy, like kind of like fucking Pikmin. So this is this is the main category. And then, and then they have all the subcategories within that said UI. How do slimes and bloomies fit into farming, sneaking, and spiriting? While well, this is technically part of spiriting. Uh, slimes, for instance, water slimes. Water slimes can automatically water your crops instead of you having to manually water your crops to make it AFK. Earth crops could till the soil. You know? You know, earth slimes till that soil or, or, you know, there's a, there's a sunshine bloomy that causes your crops to grow faster. You know what I'm saying? Because, because it, because he's making artificial sunlight. Yeah. Earth slime discovers new seeds. Fire slime can burn down the whole town. No, 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 no. The fire slime burns down your plants. So then fertilizes your crops. So for next planting, they are 25% stronger. Because that's a real thing. That's a real thing. So big brain, the big brain, the ashes of the previous plant's nutrients add a 25% bonus to your next plant's output. <sighs> big brain, dude. Oh, hey, you're finally streaming again. Where have you been? We're on tier list of the new World 6 leaks. Yeah, I've been working on World 6, bro. Sorry. 
Or fire slime could also burn bad weeds. Yeah, true, true. The the fire slimes could also burn weeds. Are we doing better, G? Yeah, I'm doing better. Everything changed when the fire slimes attacked. This is an avatar. All right. Don't you? Don't you? Wait. What if it's plants versus zombies in Eidolon? Then I have no reason to ever not play Eidolon ever again. I don't know on that one, G. Well, I mean, it's probably not even close to being true. But I mean, bro, we're swinging for the fences at this point, man. I'm I'm trying to hard swing here. All right. What do you guys think then? What? Tell me, looking at this shit, you're like, hmm, this looks weird. And then you get to this and expecting to be the same goddamn UI. And then this shit's like, oh, okay. Uh, hello? And I'm going to be honest with you, chat. I'm going to be honest with you. Lava is out here making idle skilling artwork. This is 100% idle skilling artwork. This is not idle on artwork. This is fucking idle skilling for sure. The bit count is way fucking more. Way more than idle on artwork. It's the bit count, bro. Look, look, look how look how the design is. Look at the design. So if we if we go, if we go like even something as small as this here, this is a great example. So if you take a look at some, so you see how like this is all made, like you take a look at the border, you see how it's like one by one ratio and it all has its own separate block and it looks very, very organized. Look, look at this. See, look at all this, look at all this connection right here. See how this is all connected. This is idle skilling artwork. This is idle on artwork. So, so he's, he's trying to, he's trying to merge the idle skilling UI into, into, into idle on. Because uh, idle skilling isn't a one-to-one -one ratio, but Eidolon is. I got that big fucking brain, bro. Upgrade of gaming, but the gameplay breeding. Yeah, some, it could be something like that. What about gaming combined with breeding? I don't think we do need that. Different color badges and skill trees are different roots. We saw the gold one. Yeah, I think I think we might be rolling up. Idle skill on, dude. I think you're right. The monsters are for planting and the other stuff is for tower. It could be. Could be a potential. Always thought art was simpler than Eidolon. Actually, no, believe it or not. Believe it or not, Night Fox, Idle Skilling's artwork is actually more complicated than Eidolon's artwork because you use way more bit count. The only things that you could argue that are different are the bosses. Uh, Troll, Efont, Amrock, and uh, Cheezor. All of those guys have a higher bit count than everything else in the game, but other than that, it sticks to a one-to-one -one ratio. My dude, been watching VODs for months, but the first time I catch you live, major help for the vids. Many thanks for your wisdom. Yo, welcome on in, Kenneth. Thank you, brother. A fucking VOD enjoyer. Love to see you, dude. That means a lower level stamp, uh, lower level slime will be animated, yeah? Yeah, I would assume so. I posted the Bloomy one outside the UI as well. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, oh, did he? Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, look at this. Yeah, see? Okay, this is an even better example. Yo, it's world for the three months, dude. Can you explain what you mean by higher bit count? Yo, thank you, dude. Okay, so if you take a look at the outline, all right? take Just take a look at it. You see how all of these are molded together? You see how it's like, it almost like he did a, he did a swoop draw rather than clicking each individual pixel like you see here? You see how this is like there's a clear indicator between the corners. There, there, it's it's a straight diagonal rather than it's just more of a curve. So this is the difference between a character model and a UI model. All right, does that make sense? Because you'll only see this type of style usually in idle skilling or in a UI. So he's he's going for more of the idle skilling design rather than the idle on design. It's confu it's confusing if you don't it's confusing if you don't pay attention to it a lot but I mean this has been this has been my job for a f like a while now so I mean you you tend to pick up on these things and not to mention I lived in three I've done idle skilling like three times unfortunately because of the Iron Man and shit so you definitely you definitely pick up on this stuff for sure but like even even something like this like okay for instance 
Let's take a look at this line, okay? You see how they're diagonal, diagonal, all the way down like this. Very looks very blocky, right? Looks super, super blocky. But then you go into the same side here and look how curved this is. Look how smooth the curve is because of the extra pixels. You know what I mean? So this is this is like idle skilling art style. You got that got art gigabrain, man. I see a bunch of blocks. I'm actually not terrible at pixel art, believe it or not. Your job as Lava to make these stuff? Yeah. Lava trolling old people telling us as he's doing World 6, but instead of making a new idle skilling update? I sure hope not. PTSD from idle skilling? Me too. Perler uh, bead art from my ex and, and a friend can't even make out what they are? Well, I mean... That's that's to be fair. It, it's some some people have an eye for it. Some people don't. It's just it's it's just it's just is what it is, right? It's the same way as like if you look at a like for instance like roofing. Like I could I could just look at a roof and tell you what's wrong with it. But if you tell somebody else, it's just like well, it just looks like a roof. But it's like it it take it takes the eye to work towards it, right? Because I can see I could see in the winter time that that valley will create a hoop of ice will, will actually shoot the water back up into your into your soffit and cause your it cause cause uh, leaking inside the house right but that's because i've been around the block so i know about it. it's the same with like art uh, pixel art since i'm such a pixel art enthusiast i have also done pixel art so then i i, I know how to i know the understanding of the difference right you know what i mean bro but my three tab is gonna last 30 years. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> three tab, bro? I'm, I'm surprised you even know what a fucking three tab is, dude. That's that's actually kind of funny, dude. <laughs> I think the same example could be used for music so people can hear every instrument at the same time as where someone can hear untrained art cannot. Yeah, actually, that's so true. You know how many times I've put like certain music in and I've like faded in certain certain other music to make it like all one smooth transition and you guys don't notice the fucking difference and that's another great example what if you have to farm colors to end up using those colors to draw or color the slime or bloomy like what having a pixel art inside of pixel art we already saw how it worked out with poing that didn't work out too good yo sasnaya thank you for the follow dude welcome on in and then we use those slimes and bloomies we color to battle. Bro, I don't I don't know about that. I don't know about that because here's the thing, Wolf, okay? Here's the thing. If there's any time where somebody can do their own coloring, they're always going to draw a dick, okay? No matter which way you look about it, one way or another, somebody's going to draw a dick, all right? You can't have that in the game. Work a roofing also a lot of people refuse to change the damn three tab to it. Yeah, exactly, bro. hundred hundred percent. Those stones are the same color as bloomy though. I mean you're not wrong. There's a term for it. What's the term, huh? But am I wrong? Am I wrong that if you give anybody any artistic freedom in any part of a game, their first conclusion is I'm gonna draw a dick. I remember custom image flags on our cage, and there was dicks. And also H pictures. The term for it. There's a term for it. It's called TTP, dude. Customization always leads to shit. It really does, bro. It really does. It really, really, really does. The Adolf symbol, unfortunately. Are you talking, bro? You 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 do realize that Adolf adopted that symbol, but it's actually been in the world for years and years to come, right? You do realize it was it was part of a language, right? It wasn't his symbol. He stole it and then used it as his own. TTP. What is TTP? What is what is TTP, chat? Maybe it won't be artistic freedom or pre major image, just we color. That's sexist. <laughs> we try. Yeah, true, though. How can I hide a dick in this? Yeah, it's exactly exactly how we think it. Oh, time to pee. That's, that's TTP? That's TTP, chat? It's time to paint us? Bro, th then every game should have like Eidolon TTP. Ruined that symbol forever. Yeah, sure fucking did. Sure did. Now every time you see it, you can't use it anywhere. Know your meme? TTP, dude. I don't I don't want to click on that because I, I'm afraid of, I'm afraid it's gonna I'll click on it, Squid, but I'm afraid it's just gonna be a penis. Oh hey, look, it's a penis. 
All right, here we go, chat. <clears throat> TTP, aka, or sorry, Time to Penis, abbreviated to TTP, is a video game developed metric and slang term for the time it takes for a player to generate a penis shaped object via any available means. <laughs> Coined by the sport development team and popularized by GDC 2009 panel, the term has been an inspiration for humorous posts online since. During the development of 2008 simulation real-time strategy, video game sport developers working at Maxis came up the metric to measure the amount of time in which a player was able to create a penis using the A-game tools. A fun little antidote that came to mind when seeing a title image of this blog post. A friend of mine who worked at EA Maxis told me a coin term over the years when working on Spore. Time to penis, or TTP for short, this basically is the amount of time it takes from a release product before a pay player is able to create or distribute a representation of penis inside your game. Clear in game like Spore LBP, this time is nearly instant. I guess the rule is, if you give them something to build with, it's only a matter of time until they make a dick with it. <laughs> <laughs> fucking based holy shit that's so based bro it's so true dude it's so true like you <laughs> you can you can literally literally make a dick easy bro but i just want to show the term is real i law doesn't rank well it's, it's funny how the how the developer of spore made the ttp term isn't everything a penis if you see it that way? Yeah, because we're gamers, dude. Idle on gaming guarded TTP, bro. PP speed run. The moment you have access to the inventory, you can make a rudimentary one. Yeah, anytime you can make a penis, shit. Oh, uh, so CS2 has a very low TTP? Probably. Mo most likely. Rule 34? Well, it's not rule 34, right? Because it's because it, they're it's, it's just they're just they're just making a wiener. It's not like it's 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 not like it's like detailed. You know, it's not like it's not like it's doing anything with it. It's just a it's just a erect wiener on a on a on a on a on a <laughs> on anywhere. It's usually done and it looks like it's done in MS Paint because people aren't very creative. They're funny when they make TTP, but they're not creative. It's like a dog pissing somewhere to make sure the area is is, but it causes a single dog. But yeah, true, true, true. You're not wrong. It's basically marking territory. Everything is a penis if you're brave enough. Yeah, I mean, true. One of the first things I do in a shooter, shoot the floor to see if I can make a pee pee. Oh yeah, on the walls with the fucking holes. I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to sit here and be like, I'm, I haven't done it yet. I mean, we literally, didn't we play like literally perfect tower not too, like literally a couple weeks ago and I made a dick. I thought Punit Square, but I could be wrong, dude. The fact that it's a metric, we've been ruined by the internet. Is it, are we ruined by the inter internet or have we been more cultured by the internet, right? Because it's not like we're out here saying gamer words, okay? We're more or less out here just being, we're just drawing dicks, okay? You know? You know, hey, you know, think about this. Have you guys ever seen Deadliest Warrior? Remember, remember the, uh, what, what, the, the Zam, Z Zimbabwe guys? What are they called? The, the Z Zamboni Warriors? Whatever they 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 literally had a weapon, one of their best decapitating weapons in 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 their whole ancestry, had a big cock on it, had a big cock and balls on it, dude. So so I mean, what do you mean? It's cultured. It's called being cultured, okay? The ways before they came net drawing peens on the wall, dude. Yeah, what what, what is it called? Uh, deadliest warrior. Uh uh. What were they called? Uh, Zonde Warrior. Zonde Warrior. That's what it's called. Uh, weapons. Uh, what is it called? Uh, am I cultured by that weapon? Uh, weapons and armor. I think it was called... Yeah, here it is, chat. Here it is. I found it. What do you mean, dude? We're so cultured. Fucking Zonde Warrior had a thing called a Kapinga. Look at that. It has a dick on it. Bro, this shit is way before the internet, dude. Internet didn't ruin us. It was the fucking Zonde Warriors with their Kapingas, bro. Hey, yo. Magic and Kilt, where's the dick? Yo, if you don't see the dick, bro, you crazy, dude. <laughs> it was... 
So the so the reason so the reason why they had a dick on it is to show how mighty of a warrior they were, chat. Because if you knew back in the day, the might of the warrior was the size of your dick. All right. So that's why it's TTP on the internet because, bro, you gotta you gotta show the might of the warrior. All right. Because I don't know about you, but if you're going to fight somebody in a giant castle that on the tip of the castle is a giant dick, I'd be scared to fight that guy. That guy seems scary. That guy seems like he'll crank 90s on you, bro. About to call my shit Kumpinga from now. Hey, hey, girl, you want to see my Kumpinga? You know, I got a pretty big Kumpinga. They'd be like, what's that? He'd be like, Kumpinga. <laughs> <laughs> So, is it really or is what I see ruined by the internet? That's not ruined by the internet. Petition for this to be the Warrior 6 Warrior. Bro. Yeah, hey, can we get the Kapinga as a World 6 Warrior weapon? I need my TTP, bro. And, and Lava's over here saying, I don't like making penis jokes. Everybody likes making penis jokes, bro. Don't even act like. Everybody makes Kapinga jokes, dude. All right. That's a thumb at the bottom right. Yeah, just like Lava's fucking weapon, dude. I was gonna say, you don't wear pants to hold your balls. You're gonna have, <laughs> it touches your knees. That's why you, that's why you have uh, the, the, one of the hose retractors, dude. And, you know, you just have to crank it up and it, you know, all it, uh, you know, rattles was up back up, dude. It's like a fire hose. Kapinga, you, <laughs> if you get what I'm putting down, you're like, kind of weird, dude. The chemical looks like a penis, bro. I don't know about that. Is that your AOE damage? Yeah, yeah damn right, it's bro. They were using their cock. This is a rope, dude. Here, grab on. I, I don't want to grab onto your Kapinga. Just fucking grab it if you want to live. Oh, God. <laughs> That's fucking corrupt, dude. That's so corrupt. Anyways, back on the back away from the TTP so I don't get completely demonetized for YouTube. Why do fans evolve to have men wearing pants and women wearing skirts when they make more sense the other way around? Well, I mean, it. I mean, to try to tell that to the Scottish men, all right? <laughs> Scotland forever! What do you fucking mean? People, men still wear skirts all the time. It's called, they're just called fucking kilts. I grab with hands, we can buy with your own <laughs> kapinga, dude. <laughs> Yeah, it's like I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think that's, a, I don't think that's a it's wrong take, bro. It's, it's kilts are still a thing. If kilts weren't a thing, then I would agree. But I mean, hey, man, I'll wear a kilt. It's fine. Besides, yeah, but it's not common. Yeah, because uh, because society doesn't want our kapingas uh, flipping flopping in the wind. Okay, because that could that could cause a lot of issues. That could cause a lot of unnecessarities. Let's say, I got a journeyman. Hell yeah, dude. Is there a way I can post my IE for you to review it? It'll be toolbox, but not IE anymore. Uh, Donkey, I don't know what that means, let alone, you know what? Only thing I know in Scottish, bro? You think I know what Scottish means, bro? Now I gotta, now I have to Google translate this shit, because I know what the fuck that means. <laughs> so it's Scottish Gaelic. It says English. Clananan, come here and get you. <laughs> you will get meat. <laughs> you want some meat? I feel like we say it aloud. It casts a spell on it. <laughs> Where's the TTP on Coded Exiles? Yeah, but literally as soon as you log in, dude. Dog had a stroke with typing, dude. Yeah, I don't know if that means what you think it means, dog. I don't know, man. Hear the TTS? Clan Nan Nan, come here and you will get meat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay. Okay. I mean, that's fine, I guess. You gotta make it all weird about it, dude. The Scottish one. I Google Scottish war cry. Scotland forever. It's more like war chit chatting, dude. Chad, don't get us cursed, dude. The other one, click the first link and search for non English phrases. I'm not going to start clicking links. Okay. You know what happened last time I clicked links? Things got kind of, got kind of, got kind of a, a, a little wrong. A little, little bad scenario, okay? A little scenario that we don't want to end up again. You know what I mean? 
Yeah, we're gonna run into a random Kapinga, chat. We don't want to run into a Kapinga. Now, once we just, why don't we just start saying Kapinga all the time, and then and then people are gonna be like, "What the fuck is Kapinga?" And be like, "Bro, you don't know what a Kapinga is." Someone says Clannanan while we're fighting till death. I'm just slap the shit out of them, dude. I'd be like, hey, uh, so someone said that while we're fighting to death, they'd be like, uh, ring ring, hello? Oh yeah, Harry Potter called, they, they want their spell back? Kapinga. Bro. I, I'm still lost, though. I'm, you know, back that we were like, oh yeah, Griffy, you know, cool and all, you can tell the difference between a UI artwork from that looks like idle skilling and Eidolon, you know, there's definitely a different art style, but I mean, what the fuck does this have to do with anything? Kapinga's a cereal brand, bro. Don't worry about it. There's no fucking way Kapinga's a cereal brand. There's no fucking way Kapinga's a cereal brand. No, it's fucking not. Kapinga's the new Riz. Hey, girl, you want to take a look at the Kapinga? You want to you wanna Netflix in Kapinga? You know what I'm saying? Eh, eh. I want Kapinga cereal now, so you want, so you, so you, so you want literally, you want literal metal shards in your cereal. I don't know about that one, dude. <laughs> Kalana Nan is the new Riz, dude. Man, I don't know about that. Why we eat Kapingas, dude? Um, no, dude. Kapinga's the weapon. Kapinga isn't the dick, chat. It's a weapon. I'm gonna make a new ram idea. All I hear is Kapinga. Do not make a ram with a giant wiener, please. I mean, we can tell people who don't know what Kapinga is, it's cereal. So people are just going to walk around and be like, Hey bro, have you heard of Kapinga cereal? It's great! How do we get idle skilling UI from drawing dicks? Um, a TTP. TTP. Dude, easy new ram with a Kapinga, bro. We don't need it. You will already eat iron with your cereal. What's a tiny bit more? Well, I mean, there's a difference from the, from the actual mineral iron and then the fucking rock iron. We do some Kukuro, bro, no. No, fuck Kukuro, bro. I'd rather take Kapinga right now than the Rona, the sucks, dude. <laughs> bro, you shouldn't have Rona, dude. You shouldn't have the Rona, bro. Have you ever thought about it just getting better? Have you ever thought of just mind over matter and say, and just tell yourself that you're not sick? Have you ever, have you ever thought about that? That might, that might help. That might help. Who is Kokobo? You mean Kukuro? Kukuro is a uh, stream game that you can play with 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 chat. You know what we do need to do though, chat? We need to play the new uh, the new um, call to the uh, call to the lamb call to the lamb uh, DLC. I love to say, but I wake up earlier. Sounds good, bro. You say Kukuro, dude. That's a Warframe, my dude. Kulavero? Yeah, I mean, look at the writing, bro. What are you talking about? I mean, Warframe goes hard, but... Call to the Lamb, but we'll call it Call to the Ram, Chip. Only only Rams allowed. Anybody that isn't a Ram will instantly get sacrificed to the deities. Hey, those people who say I'm not sick to convince themselves they are sick while their nose has have, have the rainbow colors, dude? Um... Yeah, I mean, I mean, that's, that's, that's called coping. I mean, if, 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 if that wasn't true, then the copium tank would never exist. Self-aware people wouldn't exist. People taking accountability for their own fucking well-being doesn't exist. There's a reason why the, 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 the cold, the common cold took, took out so many people back in the day, bro. Only rams, dude. Only rams? Chat. Chat, we're not... Chat, we're not going to that level. Smashy coming in with Yo, thank you, brother. Thank you for the T1 for the nine months. We have a baby. Let's call it Smashy Bit. It's called it Smash Bit. Smash Bros. Yo, you know what Warframe is, but it's not a pixel game. Bro, are you okay? Just because I just because on stream I play Basically, 99% of the time I play pixel art games does not mean that I don't know what the fuck other video games are other than pixel uh, other than pixel art games. Bro, I'm like the most cultured fucking gamer, dude. What do you mean? 
I played the shit out of Warframe. Play Evolve, it's the hottest game of 2005. Yeah, Evolve goes hard, dude. I, I'm down for Ram of the Cult, dude. How? I thought you can't see other games. Of course you can. You probably, probably aren't even MR30. Sit down. You know what, dude? You know what? No, not even fucking close. See how much of a grind MR30 is, dude? You know what Roblox is? No, I have no idea. Have you ever heard of World of Warcraft? Ten-year vet, baby. That's the way it is. I've played WoW for over ten years. Of course I know what fucking WoW is. Yeah, you know what Bird Gut is? No. I'm stoked for the new Prince of Persia. I'm not. I, I like the Prince of Persia's. I'm not excited for the new ones. Too many pixels for G. It's MR33. It's not that bad. I'm MR33. Yeah, but what are you an idol on? Exactly. L ratio. All right. If you would have spent less time in Warframe and more time on Eidolon, you you would you would be you'd be you'd be up there. Do you know what Tomb Raider is or Call of Duty? Of course. There's not bro. I bro. Tomb Raider. Not only is it the newer Tomb Raider is usually meant for all benchmarks for for graphics cards and and computers in 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 general, but I mean also the old Tomb Raider dude. Those triangles though, baby. Them triangles? <laughs> Sheesh. What's a Tomb Raider, dude? Yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> Come on, he's a dude. <laughs> Gay dude's no lore class. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I feel like best Tomb Raider is triangles, dude. Yeah, any ETA for IETB reviews? Uh, think of like, I don't know, I want to say next week. Next week or the week before, as I said that last time. I bet you haven't even beat the first level of Celeste. No, I beat the first level of Celeste. But I, I don't own Celeste. I played it one time at my buddy's house. Now, see, Duck Souls is a real game that's been made. Yeah, I don't know if I've ever heard of that one, dude. Old PlayStation Dreamcast games, dude. Still, Tomba's one of my all-time favorite games. You can warm up with mine. <laughs> Definitely one of the best games of all time was Ape Escape, though, shit. All right. I have you know that there was no better game this game was peak gaming. Literally peak fucking gaming, bro. This game was so fucking fire. Alright. Alright. If you know Roguelands, I don't think I know Roguelands. Alright, for the PS1, dude. Looks like Croc. Yeah, because it's a PlayStation 1 game. Every game looks like Croc when it's in PS fucking 1, bro. I think the size of the earth is enough for us. Need more size? Question is mine all day. <clears throat> uh, it's not that we need more size coffee it's that we need more food supply if the population gets any bigger and then we have to go to completely synthetic food then uh, then we're gonna we're gonna come into a food shortage never heard of this game's fire would you ever try death must die absolutely it's a great game any prep advice for world sex yeah make sure you have cattle crook defeated oh uh, do you know billy hatcher can't say I do just told my account was beyond savings so that's why I asked about IE wait what what Wait, 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 Okay, hold on, hold on. I'm not going to review account. I just want to see if this is true. Uh, what is your, what is your first character's name? That is quite the claim. That is absolutely quite the claim, dude. If you're going to, if you're going to out here claim that your, your account's unsavable, I need to see this. I need to see this. Cobb's Elfin. Okay, give me a sec. Uh, can, can somebody with VIP send me a shareable IE link, please? It's probably 10 Beast Master. Yeah, it's probably T -Bay. I don't I don't remember what the what the shareable link is. Because I, I, I unless I have to go through and f fucking find it. Uh, did some random dude fucking message me and be like, hey, look at my, oh, here it is. Found it. Some random dude. Okay, we're gonna have that. Okay, we're gonna take that. Take that. Oh, wait, fuck, that's toolbox. Shit! That's not IE, god damn it! You fool. You have my ultimate trap card. I'm actually, uh... 
Where is it? Where is it? I'll just find somebody that sent it to me before. God damn it. God damn it. Where is she? Where is she? Bro, I have too many DMs. I lost my other DMs. Fuck. Did you make your IE public? Can't see it. IE back on the menu? No, I just want to see what how badly he fucked up. Or could someone send me a fucking message of how to see it? I don't remember. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I fixed it. I figured it out. Never mind. I'm stupid. Never mind. I figured it out. Don't worry about me, chat. I'm I'm dumb. I'm I've uh I yeah. I figured it out. I just didn't remember. Well, that was a waste of time. He didn't even... You found it? No, fucking... First character, Blood Berserker, second DK, third ES. Yeah, that doesn't help if I can't fucking log in. Would you... Did, have you... Have you sent... Have you... Have you made it fucking... Public? Like... I uh, guarantee next thing you're going to say is I don't know how to do that. All right. Give me a sec. I like how you say IE review back on the table. You're not even fucking prepared, dude. Imagine. Fucking imagine. Let me go through all that struggle just to afterwards say, oh, give me a sec. What the fuck? What the fuck, dude? Get with the program. God. Is this Yoshi's Island, bro? Now he's mad? Yeah, I'm so angry, bro. Type TTIE, type to IE review, this new thing. You angered him, dude? I'm so, yeah, me, you know me, dude. I'm so angry, bro. Yeah, everybody panic, Chet. Everybody panic. I just want to see. I want to see if, if somebody's out here being like, yo, his account's borked, just to realize that his account's not borked. He just, he's just, he's just an idiot. Whoever told him that his account was borked. Oh, you got to be fucking serious, dude. Yeah, of course, of course, of course. Enter the rage gate. Can I send link? No, you can't send link. Just tell me your first character's name and I can see it that way. Now I'm wondering how they thought your account was borked. Yeah, wait, hold up. How can they think your account's borked if you can't even sh if you did if you didn't have it as a public profile? What the fuck? How would they Bro, this is a total bait and switch. Bro, did you actually just try to bait me into looking at your IE because you didn't even have it as a public profile? That's a big brain move. That is a big brain move. It's a big brain move. Baton, master, bro, bro got one guy caught. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna lie. How do I, how do I do it? You're a fucking idiot. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, chess was the worst raid fight. Wow. Oh, Karazhan did. <laughs> uh, bro, I can't believe you just tried to bait and switch me, dude. I'm not even gonna look at your account now. L ratio, fucking nerd, dude. BM or Siegebreaker on Gmush Kilroy? BM always. BM, BM always. So, chat, I'm scared. Look at the lava, dude. I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually... You know what I'm looking for? Just to change the scenery, bro. That's all I want. I just want a change of scenery. You know, even if even if World 6 looks a lot like World 1, I'm fine with that. I'm totally cool with that. That's fine. <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of tables, chess pattern, I might not be. I'm so sorry, Griffey. No, you're not. No, you're fucking not. You're full of shit. I bet nobody told you your account was borked. You just said your account was borked, so I would look at it. And the hope that I would look at it. It was a, it was a plan. Don't you say sorry. Own up to what you did. Take accountability for your actions. Take responsibility. Be a normal human fucking being. Looks like a water fountain. I have 2k ready. I'm gonna beat your ass with chess, Griffy. Bro, I have, you know, I'm 2600, okay? I face Magnus on fucking Tuesday, all right? All right? Take responsibility.
Yo, Al Bimer with the primer, dude. Yo, thank you, dude. Thank you, bro. Everyone says chess, but it might be checkers route, to be honest. Scared amazing chess. Hope there's PvP, dude. There should not be chess in this game. Hot take, chat. Hot take. There should not be chess in Eidolon. Imagine playing chess with chat, dude. Just do like when I did someone called boring, bro. What are the chess skills? Animal cards fight each other. That fountain has a wiener, bro. <laughs> Stupid, dude. 2600, you only fight with my wee wee. How would do, baby boo? Yo, what's up, Tez? What's going on? Can't believe World 6 boss is the game of checkers, dude. What if it's TFT, though? Okay, hold up. Okay, wait, 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 wait. If it's an auto chess battler, bro, I'll be playing this shit 24 7, all right? Okay, if it's TFT, that shit's based. All right? If it's auto chess, yo, I'll play it. Check it if the casual high, how it goes, it goes, dude. Auto battler would go hard. I don't know how Lava would be able to make an auto battler if he's expecting it to come out in January, okay? <laughs> like, yeah, let's make a whole new fucking game mechanic. I mean, if he's gonna do that, just copy. Just literally copy everything from fucking League or Dota. Literally be stuck there and quit the rest of the game, dude. How would chaotic and nightmare modes work with that? I it wouldn't. Auto battle with breed pets, dude. Why does he why does he have a the real question is what is the reason for the chessboard? Is he Bro, there ain't no way he's adding PvP to the game. There's ain't no fucking way that he's there ain't no way he's adding PvP to the game. It can't. It can't be. It can't be. How's your gains looking? Not been in, in, on for two months? Oh, like I'm pretty much max, bro. I'm just basically farming out nuggets and better cogs at this point. Why do we think that it's chess though? Hmm. Why do we think that it's chess? You know what? I'm gonna let you cook, Theo. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you cook. It might be a decoration which gives bonus, dude. Think the stands a rune looking thingy? No. Oh, it could be rune checkers. You know, it would be a pixel drawing table or something. You know what it could be, Chet? You know what it could be? It could be. Possibly. Maybe. He just put those checkers in there until he's ready to animate the water. Or it could be Rochambeau. Could be Rochambeau. It's excited table for Chinese checkers, dude. My mom. I bet it's not even a gaming mechanic, it's just a bonus. It's definitely a chessboard. Might zoom more a little Kapinga, dude. You gotta take a look at the Kapinga, bro. Oh, by the way, hey Lava, I know, I know you don't play your game at all, but for the love of fucking God, can you not wear a void helmet? Like, please? Like, there's no reason for you to have a void helmet. You're you're the fucking game dev, okay? That was so like World Three. Void helmet are sick. No, it's it's not that sick. It's not that sick for a developer, dude. It's too tall for a chessboard. I think it right works a progress fountain. Yeah, that's what I'm. I'm thinking it's more of a progress fountain. Because if that it, it's here, see chat. Here's the thing that we haven't looked on. It's a premified hap. It's a feature of the game. You'll find later on. Don't you don't you tell me about game mechanics. Lava, I bet you know, I bet I know more about the game than you do, Lava. Bro, I got the Amrock pure, I got the Amrock primified helmet since like fucking the start of World 4. What do you mean talking shit? Hi, Lava. How's it going, buddy? So, so, so Lava, it's 100% a auto chess battler, right? Minus one hot dog hat, man, fuck. Griffey's skitzing out, yelling at himself. Weird, not gonna lie. We need this is this is our PvP game, auto battler. How about a nice game of chess, dude? Everybody say hi to Lava. You you know World C, C chat. Here's the thing, you know World Six is coming soon because Lava started to show up in chat again. That that's how you really know. All right, that's 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 the big indicator right there. Sorry, Lavis count second Mario attacked himself. Yeah, it's just being a schizo, dude. Don't worry about it. Confirm PvP. 
What's happening? I'm late. What's up, RK? Is the new armor going to build off cattle crack? I don't know, dude. I don't know, bro. Do I look like the developer to you? You're not even enough through Endgame World 5 yet? That's okay, dude, because uh, that that's what I'm here for. That's, you know, because when World 6 releases, I heard each time Griffey says World 6, Lava pushes back a day, huge bird get dilemma, dude. Um, okay, World 6, World 6, World 6, World 6, World 6. Looks like an expensive chess table. Okay, here here's the thing, okay? You want to you see this big brain? You want you want to see this big brain? It's not a chess table. You know why it's not a chess table or a checker table? Look at the head of the top of the head of the character. Now look at the size of the chessboard. What are you going to be playing fucking chess with your face? You going to be playing chess with your face, chat? I don't think so. It looks more like a fountain than it does like a checkerboard. And Theo's trying to Theo, bro, nah, nah, bro, you, you you're cooking weird, bro. Do I look like a dev to you? That's a big question for sure. You haven't ever seen Lab in the same room? Coincidence? I think not. You for real? Chess trophy from gaming? You've never seen HP, bro? Bizarre missing fire? That's what I'm thinking, dude. The wishing pond? Those pictures were the buffs? Ooh, oh, woo, oh, hey, hey, kind of cooking. It's like a wishing, a wishing fountain. But I mean, wouldn't what isn't that isn't that different though? Bird found equals bonuses. Maybe it's a spot that needs to be filled with water through coloring. It's a shrooms for they are. Uh, it's because uh, Alice in Wonderland, dude. You eat the eat that shit, and then and then you grow smaller, or grow bigger. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna slap your quick slap to level zero, dude. Yeah, good tr good luck. Reminds me of the cartoon with the bird. Bird good. Sorry, the profile. I mean, I'm not looking at it. Easy reply with the face with those uh, nubsense characters don't have hands. Hello? Yeah, I'm still trying, dude. He lost that privilege. <laughs> he lost that privilege. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe when we do toolbox reviews, he might have another chance. Stan, we have stands in World 6. Possibly. Idol on a goblet chest blobs. I don't know what it could possibly be, Chet. I'm actually stumped by this. I think I think it might be the auto auto chess battler. All right, it's a new PVP system, a brand new PVP system. It's coming in. There's going to be leaderboards. There's going to be pay to win mechanics. Okay, everything's going to get crazy. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be insane. And you know we're going to be at the top of the leaderboard. Okay, all right. You know it. I know it. We all know it. It is what it is. It's going to be huge. Ain't no way. 110% chance it's going to happen. That's not cope, dude. More rarer pets, dude. Yep. More chess pieces on V-Man skills. A lot of things about chess, dude. I don't know about you. NPC bird found interact with the quest to unlock 100% convinced caveman brain. Just look into alchemy. It says oddly enough. I mean, the closest thing I could think is like, it's going to be like a fountain. Because here's the thing. This shit doesn't, this shit does not add up to this shit. All right, let's 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 be completely honest. Is this, it, this might be completely different from everything else. This might not be even a third. Uh, you can either do dread dreadlow or palm trees, A F A F K. But I mean, yeah, I don't know, man. I, I it's, it can't be a chessboard. It it's too big. It's too big to be a chessboard, because nobody's gonna play chess with their fucking face. All right. It, you, you're literally you need a stepping stool to play chess it can't be a chess I think he literally only put those white squares there for strictly positioning to make sure that it was centered I think that I think that's the whole reason why that's there is so it's so he so he had centering for the fountain it's spiriting you probably use it on other skills or the creature goes where the chest texture is same area, other pedestal. How many skills are you going to have in World 6 total? Do we know? I think it's three. It's usually three per world. He will be the top of the leaderboard for sure. Oh, probably. I mean, the mailbox is big as the character. <clears throat> I mean, true. Imagine if it's only cosmetic and we're all wrong. And we put, There's no way Lava would just take a picture of, of this and then use it as a future content blog and have it just as a cosmetic, dude. There's a, it ain't no way. Chats use mushroom. Dreadly, Dreadlio correctly for once? Sorry, I'll change it. You step up on the mushrooms. Can't wait to see how wrong everyone is about this thing. 100% at NPC, they'll be locked. Birds with precision poop deposits, dude. It's obviously a Kapinga chat. The icon under the post is a fountain, Griff. The icon under the post is a fountain? 
Okay, you okay, you can't okay, dude, you can't just say no, that doesn't that doesn't that doesn't work. You can't just be like, oh hey, since he reacted as a fountain. That's like saying, oh, people blush is the bloomy, so it's obviously a frog. No, that's 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 that's, that's, that's brain dead reasoning. Okay? That's that's like that's like saying, oh, since since this is a golden heart, this has to be a golden heart. Like what what kind of fucking shit are we saying here, dude? And that that's that doesn't make any fucking sense. It's the maestro talent top of the leaderboard unless there's a nugget like mechanic. Yeah, probably. If this if this is a PvP chess battle or chat, you know what I can just say? You know what I'll say? Endless content. Endless content. Okay. Look at it upside down, it kinda looks like an owl. Yeah, I don't know about that, Chief. Yeah, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, I lost it. I want 1v1 poing. I don't. I don't. Just sounds like leg central, bro. Sounds like heavy leg central. From Harry Potter for spiriting, dude. It's a damn pensiva? What the fuck is... The fuck is pensiva? No, bro, you're- nah, bro. Nah, dude. Nah, that ain't fucking close. That's nowhere even fucking close, dog. That's not it. That, that's not even fucking close. That's not even- that's not even fucking even close. That's not very close, dude. What? No, it's not? That's like saying a shovel is almost the same as a rake. It's no, no, it's not. It's very different. It is. No, it's no chat. It's not. No, it's fucking not. A shovel is a rake. Bro, listen, why can't you put the head in water activate spirit bonus, dude? Shovel is more like a hammer. You could shovel with a rake, but you can't rake with a shovel. The shovel is the same as a hoe, though. Check idle chat. They're the same same picture. What do you mean, check idle chat? I swear to God, if I'm checking idle chat and you're going to say something fucking stupid. Well, I answered my question. What am I seeing? Shovel rake enough holes. K oh, Cobb sent proof. Wait, okay, hold up, hold up. Let me, let me read this. So, 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 hold up. So, this guy said, I don't even know where to start. This is, this is for Cobb's account, by the way. I don't even know where to start. Easier to point out what's good instead of roasting the bad. The good can't find anything seriously. The bad and bad news a lot. Literally open any tab to work on. You're in world five with seven. Okay, I have, I have to look at this account. I have to look at this card. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna show the image because then I'm putting put the person on blast. I'm not gonna put the person on blast, Jet. That's that's just that's just toxic. That's toxic, man. Oh, oh, he just gave me the wrong name. Okay, all right, but I love it, dude. Here, let me let me let me take a look here. Let me let me see how bad this truly is. That there, there ain't no way that somebody's gonna be going that hard on a homie and not not be able to to help out. Is this the guy from earlier? It is. It is the guy from earlier. Okay, let's let's take a quick look here for a sec. I'm not gonna do a whole account of re review. I just want to see what's going on here. I want to see why they're talking shit so bad. It can't be that bad, right? Um. Okay. Blood Berserker, Divine Knight, Elemental Sorcerer, One BM, One Bubo, 
One V-Man, one Siegebreaker, one Hunter, one Barbarian, and one Beginner. Okay, what, what's... so you just... you've just... neglected characters. Okay. Neglecting of characters, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. The skills, I mean, you need to get your skilling up, that's pretty normal. I mean, at least get iron tools. I mean, it looks like you just haven't paid attention to a few people. You don't have one equipped. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean, you have ten. So you have two warriors. You have three warriors. Two archers. One V-man. One, two mages. I mean, I don't... Okay, well... I mean... Okay, so you're missing a shitload of stamps. You ain't using cards set for World 5, dude. I mean, that's no big deal. It's got a little bit of coin action there. You need to, you need to collect your Coliseum tickets. Anvil. Okay, that's not bad. I mean, he's at least he's somewhat paying attention to alchemy. I mean, it's... Oh. Yeah, you need... Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, that's a little rough. Oh, classic hard focusing sigils, dude. Classic. I think it's more like they need work on everything rather than needing to be flamed by someone helping, dude. Honestly, you want my hot take on this? I think the guy that flamed you is kind of a little bitch. Just saying. Because this count's not even that bad. It's it's not. It's really not. He he was complaining about nothing. It's just it's just you haven't done a lot of things. You just need to go through and get the basic necessities. You know, it's not like your account your account isn't screwed. It's crazy to me. He said your he says your account is far from help uh, far from any help, dude. No, what the fuck? Not even close. Your account's fine. That this is a dude. This is easily fixable. I've believe it or not, believe it or not, I've seen worse accounts. I've seen way worse accounts than this. This is this is this is not even that bad. Not even that bad at all, bro. I mean, sec. But the thing is, it's a level one beginner, bro. He can make this to whatever he wants. Remember Wolf? Yeah, Wolf's alchemy was worse than this. Not only that, fucking wolf stamps were worse than this. Three archers is meta build? No, it's not. The last three characters are brand new. Yeah, man. I I I I I I think I mean I think it's fine. I think what you need to do. Here here's my biggest tip out of everything. Take a step back from world five. I just don't I just just take a step back. Just go through each each thing. Start off with stamps. Start collecting every single stamp that you haven't unlocked yet. Start getting that going. Once you get that going, level up your defense stamps, your accuracy stamps. Those are the two things you need to make sure that you get those going. Next thing, just keep on unlocking bubbles. Keep on working on your FMJ and your accuracy. And start working on, you know, start getting your, like you already have your multiplier bubbles at a decent level. Just just keep on getting until you get like an average of like 50. 50 on your alchemy bubbles, easy every every day make sure to do your vials every single day just make sure to keep on doing your vials that's it's easy take your fucking characters off sigils this believe it or not this is this is a beginner trap this is this is a beginner trap for for anybody literally people just hard focus on sigils and they're like oh my god sigils are what i need to do sigils are so important they're not they're, you should take your characters off sigils, work on other things. It's not worth it. You're not getting... You You should not be touching sigils until you're basically done the rest of alchemy. I found in my trap myself. Yeah, a lot of people do. Construction? I mean, yeah, sure. You kind of like hyper-focused your, your, um, your rankings, but there's there's a thing in the Discord for your for, for endless cycles for ranking salts. So just go go take a look inside uh, inside the, the Discord. Salt Lick? I mean, you can't really fuck up on Salt Lick, to be honest. You just level up. 3D Printer? Like, yeah, your 3D Printer's a little bit weak, but I mean, oh well. 
that that will help when you start working on your alchemy stuff and you start actually working on everybody's skilling your death notes fine don't worry about it your shrines i mean your shrines are level 10 or fucking level 7 like the fact that you even have primordial shrine is totally fine buildings there's nothing wrong with your buildings obviously you're going to need but you even have poisonic elder so souls aren't going to be an issue for you because you're able to push at least decent td even with a level six uh poisonic elder uh you shouldn't you shouldn't even be touching atom collider you're not there yet cooking cooking is i mean it's cooking is cooking it's like okay so here's what i'm seeing okay the guy that says your count's unsavable first of all he's a he's an elitist Okay, he, he, he probably either A, just didn't want to help with this account because it was a, a lot of work. Okay, I can understand from that set that it, it was a, it, this is a lot of work. You have a lot of work to do. But I mean, in, in, in retrospect here, the only things you just skipped a lot of shit. You just rushed to the end and now you have to play catch up. I mean, there's there's that's that's basically it. I don't. I, I feel like I feel like people just throw out words for no reason because people that say that this is unsavable, I could save this account in like two weeks. I could flip this account completely around. In literally two weeks time, I would be able to get everything all set up to be totally proficient, to totally work out. If you the the main the main indicator of what's really going to tell you if the count is unsavable, like some dunce is going to say that, is if you have more than three elite classes. That's the only time where your account is ever borked. Because the thing is, is if you have, if you have like four Beastmasters, four Blood Berserkers, four DKs, four V-Mans, yeah, then your account's actually fucked up. But this is not fucked up, dude. This is fine. I don't know. I don't know. Why, I don't know why people talk shit. I don't know. I don't know, dude. I I did it to reach world five in six weeks. Yeah, I have three archers. Am I an idiot for this? No, you're fine. Having three archers is no big deal. Have, you got our list. As I said, three elite classes. I said more. I said elite classes, right? Three elite classes is bad. So like three blood berserkers, three DKs, like that will bork your account in the future. But I mean, like, yeah, sure, you have two beast masters, but I mean. What you should be doing, okay, is you can go to the limited time shop. You can save up gems to buy a class swap token because he's only a hunter, okay? He's only a hunter. And then you swap it to Bowman. And then there you go. It's fixed. Easy. Swap that shit. That's all you got to do. And then, and then probably, uh, I mean, you could either make this into another warrior, another elemental sorcerer for your, for your second squire. Or your second elemental, or your second elemental sorcerer. I mean, that's I mean, easy peasy, easy peasy, dude. Screwed because all mine are elite classes. You just have to wait for the limited time shop for more to come out, which I'm sure Lava will probably release in one of these limited time shops. But yeah, no, this is this is this is not borked. I, any, any person saying that was borked is 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 dumb. Why should I swap to Bowman? Because two two hunters is fucking dog shit. Two hunters is terrible. Two archers and one one be, a beast uh beast yeah there's nothing there's nothing wrong with that yeah if you have two I have two archers there's nothing wrong with having two siege breakers there there's absolutely nothing wrong with that it's just it depends on which it it depends on what you're losing out on right because if you're if you're like I I made the my class rundown was specifically for this two siege is only good if you're one of those people that play consistently a lot okay because then you're going to start rallying two minute claims for level 13 vials. All right. That, that's, 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 that's the difference, right? When it, either that you're going to be running two blood berserkers, two DKs for, for the build rate and for the ladles. But the thing is, is like what lasts longer pushing, pushing bars for the two minute claims or, or getting, uh, getting max plates probably in the long term max plates realistically i will think in the long term blood berserkers will last longer than siege breakers will just for the sole fact that getting those vials to level 13 once they're level 13 there's not really a reason to have any reason to have three three archers but i mean it used to be old meta because the the archers used to have the highest kill per hour in the game but for G much kills, but now that's not the case because Elemental Sorcerer is much stronger. And also, you're losing out on a fuck ton of prints if you're using uh, three archers. 
It'll, yeah, it'll be, so but yeah, it's, once we get a eleventh character, this will all not matter in the end, right? This is this is the other thing we gotta realize. In the long term, eleventh character comes out, it all won't matter because you'll have three archers. Uh, sorry, you'll have you'll have uh, two siege breakers, two blood berserkers, two DKs, and then one and then one uh, one one BM. Wait, AFK G mush kills is more on ES? Yes, because of his mana, his life talent that gives us more kill, uh, more uh, multi kill per tier. We never add another blood berserker because of Shao bug. That's such a small. But the thing is, is like once you're at that point, you're such a that's such a small thing though, right? It doesn't take fucking any time to get your super Shao's done, especially when you can candy the majority of it. It's it's really not that bad. I think I think people. I think people overfixate how bad this blood berserker bug is, but in reality, it's not bad at all. It's actually quite fucking easy. Moon all the shrines to world six probably would play right. Besides, once you figure out which character is bugged, it's super easy. Chow equinox, chow boops. Okay, bro, you are literally talking about some of the most sweatiest end game fucking super chows. Okay. There's only only the only the top of the top actually chow that shit. Like, like 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 seriously, bro. Like I don't even chow that shit because that shit's too sweaty for me. What are we talking about? If 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 your reasoning for not it's not worth it because of the super chow bug and then your reasoning is because of equinox and boops, that's such an extreme. You can't you can't you can't make the extreme as the rule. Like that 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 that's that's fucking crazy talk. Let's worry about creating a second. Uh, how long it's been redoing or B BB main like me. It's only because they have nothing to do. Chow, chow poop skeletons, dude. I mean, that's that's just that's just such a that's like that's like saying I don't want to do super chows because I have to kill green mushrooms at King Dute. It's just like nobody's going to fucking do that or I have to kill the mimic at Bandit Bob's map. That, that, that's that's the that's the type of ideology you're going with this. That's crazy talk to me, dude. That's absolutely fucking crazy talk. If just because there's a blood berserker bug going on doesn't mean it can't be easily fixed by just, I don't know, killing green mushroom spores, okay? You kill green mushroom spores that you haven't done yet, either one of them counts and one of them doesn't. If you kill it the first one, it doesn't count, move on to your second one. If it counts, there you go. You're on your second blood berserker, then you go away with it, easy peasy. You're already committing the time to super chowing them, but majority of people have haven't. Yeah, and I mean, Let's be honest here. If you have an account that has super chows already done, your account's already juiced. So how long is it going to take you to get your super chows done again? Not very long. Not very long at all if you've already have all your super chows done because your your account's already so mecha juiced that you can literally do it in a day. And not to mention if you're even at that point as well, you probably have a quite the stockpile of candy. Grant's got the green stack number 214. Yeah. At least a few minutes. Yeah, you have a huge stockpile of candy. This is such a this is such a small problem that people make it so astronomically. The only reason why people make it more of a problem than it is is because it's because they're talking about it when they're not even there yet. They're like, oh, I don't want to do the super chow bug, but they, but they haven't even they haven't even attempted super chows yet. They've done their chows and zows, which have nothing to do with super chow. 100 kid kills on it in the matter of hour or less now. Found thing look like Olympic fire to me. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's like the this this the super chow stuff is 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 literally so later in the game. It's crazy. I think people just over over fixate on it, and it's not even that big of a deal. I'm out of loop. What is the bug exactly? So if if you have two blood berserkers, if you have two blood berserkers, if you're if you're on mobile, it will only count for the first blood berserker. Like, like you have to do on your first Blood Berserker, it won't count up for your second. If you've done it on Steam, it's only the second Blood Berserker. But if you've touched mobile and you have logged into Steam once, then it's your second Blood Berserker. It's a little bit confusing. But I mean, it's literally not that big of a deal to check. Just be like, okay, so I haven't done my Sewage Chows yet. I checked Green Mushrooms. Did it count for that one? No. Did it count for my second one? Yes. Okay, then it's on my second one. Now I do my super chows on my second one. Wow, bug bug fixed. There's a workaround a bug. Oh my god. It's not like it's not like it stops you from progressing. After 10 months of playing, I barely got all the chows. I mean, I don't want to do them again and I already did them. Here's what here's what I think, okay? <clears throat> what's 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 you got to you got to think about what's what's more important? Double the amount of ladles that you get? 
for for what an hour worth of work for 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 an hour hour worth in time candies to get your super chest for for double Lado count and not to mention insane cooking speed but i mean more construction yeah you're probably running two dk's regardless you're probably you're probably running two dk's to two uh two blood berserkers Yay, walk around the bug instead of fixing it? Yeah, well, guess what, Fibster? When you have one developer, this is the type of shit we gotta figure out, dude. You know, let, let's let's explain the problems of AAA companies that have bugs that we have to walk around that have multiple devs. Explain that reasoning. He can't fucking fix it when he's too, too busy working on other content so people don't leave. Use a talent reset on my boobo poison cloud suddenly missed tremor words. Why did I happen? I max agility and everything important. I don't know. I'd have, I'd have to look at it. Oh, so double fishing samples? Yeah. And triple A games, you have to walk around bugs? Yeah. Two DKs, two ES, since I did my elite before the meta change? Yeah, I mean, that's fine. I did the same. Absolutely. I, 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 did, I did the exact fucking same. So, I mean, there's there's no issue there. I, I'm, I'm in the same level, the same boat you are. But if I was to make a choice, I would go two, I would go two Blood Berserkers. I guess I have the same issue with hands on two Maestros since World 3? Exactly. I mean, th I mean there's... Yeah, yeah, okay, that's... But it. But the thing is, is when, you, when it comes to a single developer, is that game-breaking? Is that changing the game to the point that it's unplayable? No? Then it can happen with a quality-of-life bug fix. There's lots of bugs in the game that need to be fixed. It's a solo dev, Fib, okay? That's the thing that you got to realize. And it's, and it's such a small, minute thing. Post Office has a weird line through it, makes it transparent. Okay. When Walker will come soon, you only have one Siege Breaker. Same with Deathbringer. It will all change, right? Like right now, it doesn't really matter what you go. If you go two Siege Breakers, if you go two Blood Berserkers, if obviously two DKs are important because construction will always be there. But I mean, in, in the end, it all depends on what you want to do. If you if you feel like you want to take one route rather than take the other route, go for it. Don't don't ever, anybody tell you otherwise. The only thing I'm saying is don't ever go more than 3 elite classes. As soon as you go 3 elite classes, well that's when that's when you just you just bork yourself. I'm new to V-Man and I do speedrun to rope on World 2 crab cakes but don't go down, so I can't continue. Why? Do you have auto mode on, Oxy? change my game and move my main to a newly created maestro yeah but the thing is is that's such a that's this literally a problem for like less than one percent of the people that made two v-mans so it's so it's not an important bug to fix fib griff when is the ie review coming again it's not we're going we're swapping over to toolbox as long as you don't have three elites just a preference optimization no no it's yeah three of the same elite classes even without auto mod on just 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 teleport if that if that if that doesn't work just teleport that's all you that's all you got to do just go to map yeah but it's now it's the same issue with two blood berserkers yeah absolutely sure but like like i said again if it's not game breaking it's not a priority because you have to have time management as a solo developer he's a solo developer he can't be developing new content and fixing bugs at the same time. Because it's not as easy as in, I type in, oh, that's the problem with the code, and fix it. No, he has to go down, try different things, see what possibly fixes the bug, and if maybe, just maybe, it doesn't break other things. It's not as easy as it just going in and fixing it. Not to mention how much fucking spaghetti code's in there. How long do you need a maestro for level 100, 150? Feels like it taking forever. It takes a hot minute. You know, Tess, thanks for the advice. Yeah, just, just, just I mean, if you're doing the speed run, uh, anyways, you should be, you should be popping, you should be popping to the map. The fact you know that proves you're a lava. It's like no, it's because I just take a second to think. You know, I just, I just take a second and put myself in the developer's shoes and be like, oh hey, I could fix this, but how long would that take? Am I working on something else? Yes. So I, is it a priority? No. Things that bug might take as long as doing a new feature the bug is in. Yeah. Gotta dig through all that spaghetti is right, dude. If you only don't didn't have to 
uh, keep checking the TTP, we'd have World 6 by now. Yeah, true. Also, Lavic Code game is MS Paint, basically, so it's bound to have some bugs unless updated in a couple of years. Yeah, Lavic could hire Inter to help with the code. Yeah, but he doesn't, right? Because, I mean, if, if I was in Lavish shoes, dude, I'm going to be honest with you, I wouldn't trust most people. I don't trust most people, let alone having them to trust to not fuck up my game that I've spent multiple years fucking making. It's hard. It, it is. You got you to gotta realize, chat, that as, as a developer, he's also a person, right? He's not some kind of demigod. All right. He's not he's not like this guy that's, you know, just superior to everyone else because he has a successful game. I, I feel like people I feel like people have too much high expectations on people that hire an intern to cause more problems than solves. That's exactly my point. Actually, I I even bring that argument the other day. I'm like, so if you hire a new person to come help with stuff, how many months of training do you have to go through of fuck ups and mess ups till he actually gets to a point where you're starting to save time? Because in the end, you actually will just end up wasting time having to train the new guy. And once if you spend all this time training the new guy, just to have that guy to have the wrong ideology and have conflicting interests compared to what you are, even though you're technically the boss, right? Because, because the thing is, is you're dealing with the art industry and everybody in the art industry feels like their ideology is right and everybody else is wrong. Do you trust me? <laughs> I don't, I mean, <laughs> there's a, there's a certain level of trust I go with you guys. There's a reason why you can't post links in chat. And, and not to mention you're also losing out on money. Oh, and you're stuck on the chessboard, right? No, no. Just keep grinding. World six drops too much. Oh, so that's a waste of money. Exactly. So I mean, if you, if you, it, the thing is, is if you really just take a second just to think about it, a lot of sense will make sense. You know, trust me, source, dude. It's just, it's just the, it's just the way it's the same as like a content creator chat. It's like, it's the same with like my past, past editors. It's like, I've went through eight, I've gone through eight editors. Okay. That, that either decide they didn't want to do it anymore. Decide they, they didn't understand how it works. So they, or they decide it's too much work. And not to mention, I had to train every, basically every single one of them. Not only that, I also had to pay every single one of them. And I'm, I, and I still went through eight of them. So that, how much time was wasted waiting on a video to be edited just to let you know that it wasn't done, that it didn't get done. So all that time, me waiting, got wasted. It's the same ideology. Hire an intern to do one or two things, either tedious, monotonous tasks a monkey could do or activate cultivate growth and other meaningful contributions to the project. It's, it's still the same thing. It's still the same problem that we're running into. It's time and money. And how much time and money is worth investing? Because here's the thing, Chet. Say, say if Lava hypothetically did, an, did, did hire an intern to do monotonous sit, okay? What is the percent chance of them fucking something up? Because you're saying monotonous tasks a monkey could do. Well, you guess what? Even monkeys throw poop and fuck up. So, once if they fuck up, how much time investment have we lost? Hiring people when I've worked with people big video trailers? No, I don't, I don't, think, I don't think it is uh, like that at all, Lava. I think maybe I think I think maybe your general discord has that ideology, but I feel like a lot of the IBA doesn't. I feel like a lot of us understand that it's hard hiring people. It's it, it but it but it's different when you do like big video trailers and music because you're outsourcing different stuff. It's the same when you had help doing your iOS. Um but when it, but when it comes to, you know, the the infrastructure of the game, it's it's much more of a touchy subject. And I think a lot a lot of the IBA, if not all the IBA understand that. This is more of a, a theory crafting situation rather than a than a than a, a right or wrong debate, you know? Those are the kinds of tasks, yes. But I mean pfft. But I mean, hey Lava, if you're looking for uh hiring a PR person, you know, <laughs> I could I could hand in my resume, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> You know, you know, like, <laughs> hey, there's some good employees. Do we need a world six soon? I might die boredom, bro. Bro, we're getting bro, world six is literally right around the corner, dude. Does that mean we'll get merged, dude? Yeah, true, true, bro, true. Griff, you can't hire yourself. Gee, why hire you when you can do free marketing advertising? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's true. I already do it for free. It's, it's, it's I do volunteer work. I do volunteer work. Second account in the meantime. I'm not okay. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a hundred percent honest. I don't I'm not a big fan of doing second accounts. Okay. I don't like doing second accounts for the sole reason that every time I do with a second account, 
I have to, I have to, uh, I have to, uh, I have to like realize how much I miss my main account. Real questions. What are you getting the Griffy bit creator code, dude? That's a good question. Well, you still need whale run. Yes, I still need to do a whale run. Absolutely. And I will do that. I will do that eventually, eventually here. Every, everything will start, everything will start coming into, uh, to fruition in, uh, I mean, we're, we're getting, but the thing is, it's like, here's the thing. I can't jump on anything right now because since world two is right around the corner, right? It's like a month away. If I try to set up anything and it goes past that month time, that's a problem. You know, you know, for instance, um, say if we do a, for instance, a maestro speed run and that takes me uh, two weeks right once if lava releases world six within two weeks then, then then i have to drop that whole speed run and that's a failed attempt right you know what i mean so it's it's like as much as i want to do other stuff or like the whale run or whatever um it's it's just something that can't be done right away you quit money league what is it what what does that mean what's a griffy griffy is a world six enemy that drops griffy brits dude one of these days i'll get my own npc chat one of these days just you wait just you wait. I'll be here for too long for me not to get an NPC. Or a fucking hat, bro. Where's my hat, damn it? Chat, we have to get a million subscribers on YouTube so I get my own fucking hat in this goddamn game. I farmed a mirror then got bored, dude. Yeah, so if you guys have not subscribed to the main channel, go ahead and subscribe to the main channel so I can get a million subscribers so I can be like, Lava, you have to make me an NPC hat now. You don't have a choice. I got there, bro. But I mean, once the second channel gets gets it i get to i get to make the hat dude <laughs> when the second channel you know you know it's crazy i have i i i feel like once we do all the stuff that we need to do for like the second channel i bet you anything that the second channel will surpass the first channel how much does one million bot sub cost one million you're probably looking at about 60 grand i would say give or take for for one million sub count yeah i would say about 60 grand to get that done but I mean, it won't, it won't matter. One. Next thing will be speedrun world six. Lava just lurking while he codes. Believe it or not, Lava's actually a Griffy bit enjoyer. Believe it or not. Believe it or not, dude. It's world six will be uh, the first world I'll be up to date in. That's what you love to see, dude. I mean, hey, if, if you guys can get, that should be your guys' main, main thing catching up is just getting, at least if you can get normal Catacruck killed, and at least get to dip into the new skills, even if you can't push World 6. Even if you can't push World 6, at least doing the World 6 skills is going to be more important because that will just hyperscale you, right? It's the same as World 5. World 5 hyperscaled stats, World 6 will uh, skilling will hyperscale your stats, everything will hyperscale your stats. Designing the thing in the chest fountain, Wait, what, well, okay, wait, 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 hold up, hold, hold the sec, hold the second here. Okay, chess fountain? Bro, you can't just be out here saying chess fountain. Bro, that's, oh my god, so it's a chess, and like, how does that even make sense? Yeah, I'll DM Griffy what I'm doing right now. Yo, and I won't show chat. I won't show chat just to piss him off, dude. I know it was also good at art, dude. This is why you don't have your own hat. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's sick. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Bro. Bro. Oh. Oh. Should I, should I show chat? Should I show chat? We all know you're just faking, G. Am I just faking though, chat? Am I just faking? Show? Oh yeah, what's in it for me? Huh? What's in it for me, chat? <laughs> All right. Just because you guys are part of the itty bitty army being here for a little bit of sneak peek. 
20 gifted subs i mean i was gonna show i was gonna show anyways but i mean if you want a 20 gifted i mean i won't say no so you see in the glasses if we show we know dude ayo yeah here i'll show here we go chat it is chess it's a work in progress so be be aware be aware it is a work in progress chat but we apparently do have chess 27 total career wins we have fucking chess it doesn't look like it's normal chess though it doesn't look like it's normal chess it looks like it's a total different level of chess it looks like you have to build up your runes in order to get better chess pieces well the fuck that's hilarious dude you know what? I'm down for it, bro. I'm down for it. 40 chess. I knew it was chess, dude. Five nights is definitely not regular chess. Um, if I could if I could put one thing, can we can we can we make it a little bit lower so it doesn't look like we're fucking midgets, bro? I mean, sorry. Sorry, little people. It's not chess. I'm just co-opting chess because it's more familiar to humans, which is my demographic. Oh, so is it like oh, so so it's uh uh it's kind of like, uh, for instance, the the like the FPS chess game, right? It looks like it's chess, but it's not chess because it's because it's, it's a first person shooter. So it's 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 showing a relatable topic, but with different mechanics. Love the humans, dude. Need to learn? No, no. It's so it's not going to be chess, Jet. It's not going to be chess. A knight is worth five, and a pawn is one. So five plus two equals is the twenty-seven wins. Yeah, it could be. RPG chess, hashtag team human, Harry Potter, wizard chess. Yeah, yeah, I would say more or less kind of like Harry Potter and wizard chess, maybe. So risk? No, it's nothing like risk. Risk is taking over continents. RPG chess? I would think that it's uh, the some kind of, uh, so basically agility. I'm thinking it's more or less some kind of uh, scale, uh, probably something that's going to give you chess pieces that are more overpowered throughout time. Fully expect World 7 to be gods and World 8 bosses to lava? Yeah, probably. <clears throat> but I mean, I mean, so that's, that's pretty cool, chat. That's pretty cool. The fact that we kind of have like a sort of more or less a uh, a kind of like chess sort of style would be you know you know I'm down for that. But where do the slimes and stuff come to play? Well, that's that's the thing. It's a work in progress, right? So I, that's kind of wondering too. It's like where do slimes come into play? But I I would think maybe that the slimes and the bloomies come into play for like the gardens, right? So it's like this is. So basically, what I'm seeing here is we get another mini game. We get we we get another mini game is what I'm hearing from this. Hear me out. The more pieces you get, they level up the different pieces, and you have to choose the pieces as pets. Uh, I think we might be cooking a little too hard there, but I definitely could see this being being definitely like a like a mini game. So. It's gonna get to a point, bro, where we're gonna have like a thousand, a thousand career wins. Imagine being a gr dude. You know it'd be hilarious, Lava, if after a set amount of wins, you you get you get the Grandmaster name tag, the the fucking the fucking chess name tag for Grandmaster, bro, or a fucking or a fucking trophy after enough career wins. You're basically Magnus at that point. Can we ride on the horse though? It's it's not it's it's not a grip master title. Able to upgrade with gem shop? Please let me. <laughs> can I can I swipe this? Yeah, we're gonna get my Magnus Carlson title, dude. Put us again, stockfish, bro. Yeah, true, dude. Nah, this 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 looks cool, man. This is just uh this is just getting me more and more excited, champ. We got literally a month away, dude. Literally a month away, and that's that's what I'm stoked for. I mean, what it really comes down to, is it more of a month away?
or day away, dude. It could be a day away. Possibly. So, I mean, there you go, chat. You have a Griffy bit, Griffy bit only stream sneak peek of what's happening. It's probably going to be posted in the future content blog tomorrow, but I mean, at least we get early access, chat. Early access. See, it has perks. It has perks of making guides. Yes, chat, I make guides. I know. Shocker. Exclusive sneak peek. Be surprised if the slightest came out tomorrow, dude. Oh, it, it's going to come out in the future content blog tomorrow. Let's be honest here. I don't, I don't think I don't think Lava ever has showed me something that doesn't get showed out earlier. Don't you mean you used to make guides? What do you mean? You don't make guides, you make tier lists, don't lie to me. We will be making another tier list. We will we will make more tier lists. Don't you worry about it. Someone's gonna pick Hikaru or Magnus as their nickname after this, dude. Half baked content drops tomorrow. Is this Bethesda dude? <laughs> hey man, there's a reason why it's called future content blog, okay? That's why it's not called definitive content blog. Tears tier list? Oh, obviously the moon from Majora's Mask has S tier tiers, okay? All right, you know it, I know it, we all know it, okay? It's important. That's what you got to know about this stuff, bro. When is Iron Man coming back? We have a couple more episodes that I need to message White about to get done, but other than that, we're we're basically done with the Iron Man. I just miss videos, so you upgrade those runes with the pawns you capture. I don't know how this is going to work, chat. How do you think it's going to work? I prefer Rift Tears. That's fair. I think... I, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm pretty I'm pretty stumped. I'm, I'm pretty stumped on this whole thing. Spending runes to get pawns? You think so? Yeah, man, I don't know. I don't know. This is pretty. It's a pretty, pretty confusing to be honest. Maybe have twenty. Maybe all world six skills get runes. Could be. Could be potential possibility. Got to put total career loss too. That's bad because most people will have less, less, more losses than wins. Yo, Jeff Sarty, coming in with the one month. That, thank you, brother. Thank you for the T1, dude. Pretty sure it's going to be like Shogi, where you can take over other pieces. Just remember, chat, that it's not going to be like chess, okay? Specifically said, it's that's just the aesthetic. The aesthetic is to chess, so everybody's relatable, but it's probably not going to be anything like chess. Gems? PvP? There's I No, this is not looking like PvP. Maybe somewhat like similar to Hearthstone-ish mixed with chess. It might be something around there. Finally got to the time to watch stream? Hell yeah, brother. Didn't he disappear like every other editor? Um, no, he's still around. Maybe some kind of game where you have to complete a board by using up pawns and knights? Possibility, dude. All I know is any any mini game, dude. Here here's You want you want to hear the type of copium I'm at right now? As long as it's not gaming <laughs> or cogs. As long as it's just something different, I'm okay with it. All right? That's the only things that I ask for. As long as it's just different from cog farming and fucking gaming. Where mobs go and fight, come back for whim. Lemma's already tell us indirect means the pawns in his game. Yeah. Every regional chess game. God, chess solitaire. Wait, there's no missing a tab for gaming? Yeah, we are missing a tab for gaming. That's, we, I know. I know, and and it has and it has like a and it has like a like a like a what is it? The little paintbrush with the little with the little palette, which means it's just every, somebody's gonna draw a dick. That's all that means. It's just gonna be a TTP chat. TTP as soon as first day is that new mechanic releases TTP. The chess paper just used a placeholder like a statue is three points, a pawn is one point. Yeah, it probably could be a point system. It's gonna be solitaire. Gaming failed level nineteen yesterday. Back to level fifteen. Yikes. That sucks, dude. That's big bad. I feel bad for you. I, that's a big, big, big bad. Still two boxes unlock the imports for gaming. Oh, I'm dumb. The chess pieces above count to 27. Yeah, so it's like it's like Roman numerals, right? So once once you have five pawns, it turns into one knight. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 27. So I'm taking a guess that the, the 10, well, obviously he probably hasn't done 10 yet, but I'm 
pretty sure once all those fill up, this is probably the max that's going to fill up. So then it's going to go, 10 is probably going to be like the, the rook. It's either going to be a rook or a bishop. And then 20 probably will be like a, a king or a queen. Is, is, is what I'm assuming is going to be. Ramen noodles. Ramen noodles. Yes, yes, exactly. Ramen noodles. You're 100% correct on that. The pawns also look... Nah, I mean, I don't know about that, dude. Maybe maybe look like maybe they look like a kapinga, but not 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 like what are you thinking, dude? Is it normal chess? No, it's 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 uh it, it's completely just the aesthetic. It's you're gonna have a whole different system behind it. So people don't need to learn chess to understand this. But chat, you know what this means though? This is gonna be a guide. This means I can make a guide to tell people of how this game works. <sighs> Why is the head on the pawn so massive? Kopinga related, if you make it, dude. I think when it when it comes down to World 6, I'm going to be putting out guides a little bit faster, but they're going to be a little less edited. Right? Because I've been putting out guides that have been heavily edited. I'm going to be putting I'm going to be putting a little less edits just so I can get them out faster. Um for for World 6 guides. Statue has a light down its neck, dude. Yeah, I don't know about that one, boss. Chicago head like that you should visit it up if you make it we playing chess today we're not playing chess you make guides chess guide win dude personally hyper world 6 because I I'll be able to play day one which I haven't been able because it started pretty late I mean hey Kirby's either big brains or just knows took me a minute to realize it was points big brain big brain dude uh, no it's it's not it's it, it's not big brain it's just it's just I played this game for too long I need to go touch grass I mean, I've been I've been around I think I think I've been I think since I've been playing this game for too long I kind of have an idea of how how lava fucking cooks when it comes to gaming because it's not like I have to figure out multiple developers I have to figure out one developer so I kind of understand how how he's already fucking making this shit so I mean to 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 put the two and two together that that's Roman numerals I mean I, I mean that's par for the course at this point there's grass in world six, therefore it is a grass world. Remember the silver thing is redraw, so maybe we redraw our pieces if we get bad luck. Oh, so you're thinking oh, so Wolf, you're cooking like it might be a potential card battler. So it's like card 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 chess? Is that what we're thinking? Is that what we're cooking with? That could be that could be that could be something that absolutely cooked. You grass then? Yeah, that's kind of fire. But the only problem I have here, this is this is this is the only issue that I have here, okay? Is this apparently correlates with this, which is obvious. I mean, that's fine. But this has to correlate with this, which has to correlate with this, which has to correlate with this, which has to correlate with this, 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 and this. Because we know that these three runes have to correlate with these three things. We know the, the bloomies and the slimes are part of world three, uh, or sorry, part of the third skilling, which is this skill. So that means that since these have these stones in here, that that means these all have to correlate together. So if all these have to correlate together, this is the confusing part that I'm at. I bet you gray points for winds and general and level up color orbs with taking pieces. But yeah, potentially. Maybe slime and bloomy are the cards. Yeah. There could be some sort of art mechanic with spiriting. It could be that these these things are used as buffs. You know, like for instance, if you use a if you use a bloomy, I can confirm that all of these things are highly correlated just so you aren't grasping at nothing. Okay, so you confirm that all of these have to all of these coincide with each other. They coexist. They have to. They're all are they all part of world 3 skill? They just skills produce currency that are used in other skills. Why well, I, I feel I feel like all the worlds these are all three skill or or these are all th skill three. Oh, so these are all, okay. So so it's just been confirmed that these are all the same skill. All right, all right. So I'm not grasping at nothing. Okay, so it's confirmed. So um, I'm gonna be honest with you. This skill seems a little ambitious, don't you think? You want to talk about you want to talk about your other skills being highly ambitious. This skill seems the most ambitious. Like you got you got chess, you got people that are out here thinking they're fucking ovals, but they weren't because it doesn't look like an oval. 
And you got out here looking like you got idol skilling artwork with with fucking idol on artwork. You know, you you you're going some crazy. Get ready for the 15 minute skill guide. Yeah. Hey chat, let's explain. Okay, but but Lava, we're thinking it's spiriting. Are you willing to give us the name of said skill, or are you just gonna hold it as a secret? If you're holding as a secret, that's fine. But I, 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 if you're willing to give the name, unless you haven't figured out the name, Slime and Bloopy are spirits. You send them to battle against chess pieces, get currency to level up, keep it secret. Lava, don't, don't know. Don't you edge me like that? Don't, don't, don't listen to chat, bro. They enjoy edging me. Okay, that's all they do. That's all they do in their life. Secret, secret. Do it, you won't, dude. I'm thinking spiriting, chat. Dangle in the dream, spirit garden. I think it's spiriting. I, I, I'm, I'm still cooking on spiriting. This message was removed by a moderator. Yeah, all right, all right, all right, dude. Okay, bro. Okay, okay, dude. Yeah, yeah. All right, bro. Okay, all right. Okay, I see how it is. It's, it's spiriting. <laughs> it's confirmed. It's spiriting, Chet. If, if if he if he's not even if he's gonna say he's not gonna say yes or no he's deflecting Chad he's trying to avoid the question so that means he is a a fantastic politician and b it's spiriting all right all right this man this man should run for president lava flame two 2025 all right I can confirm it's not spiriting all right I'm wrong. No further comment. Fuck. All right, I cooked too hard. That's fine. Ruined. Lost spirit realm, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's realm chat. All right, if it's not spiriting, it's realm. You know what? I know it. We all know it. All right, it's realm. All right. So you like, like if it's not realm, why is this idol skilling artwork, huh? Why is this idol skilling artwork then? What do you mean spirit valley world? No spiriting skill? Yeah, that's kind of that's kind of weird, don't you think? Why would you have a? Why would you have a? Spirited Valley with no spiriting skill. Or maybe it's just chess. Gotta cook something new then? Yeah, what could be possibly? I think it's training. You unlock little dudes to pump their attack and HP through the color shards. AO. Uh, why am I VIP? Oh, it's probably because you want a Marby race. Probably want a marble race, Dragon. More or less is what I'm, what I'm taking into consideration. Could be training. Could be, could, be, could be training. Is it Pokemoning? No, that's a lawsuit. You can't do that. He will get he, that. That's actually that will get a cease and desist so fast. Crusade, don't you fucking dare! Don't you dare say crusade, dude. I'm gonna be honest with you. Crusade was so mundane and monotonous farming. <laughs> like there was nothing worse than RNG of those fucking mutators, dude. <laughs> Holy fuck! I hated the mutators. I mean, space world with no space skills. So I mean, true. Cooking totally a space thing. Yeah, dude. Nintendo Disney are the quickest to cease and desist. I like how the beginning of the stream you thought someone was roasting you for two hours just chatting stream. Now we've been just chatting for well over two hours. Don't you roast me, Demos? It's because we have so much to talk about. Bro, what do you mean? We got we we're we're so close to world three skill, dude. I gotta figure it out. Because not to mention, I just got told I was wrong. And not to mention, we also had to look at that other guy's account because somebody said their account was fucking borked, bro. They don't gotta know. I'm not roasted. Just love the irony. It is pure irony. You're absolutely right. I figured it's called summoning. It's summoning. That's what it is. It's summoning, chat. It's summoning. No, wait. But that, what does summoning have to do with chess? Is it? Is it? Hmm. It just mentally thinks world three skill. What do you mean world three G? The third skill. Third skill. All right. You summon chess pieces. Duh. World three get another skill. No, it has enough skills, actually. Yeah, we buy slimes to play chess. I know what it is. I know what it is, chat. Gambling. It's a gambling. Gambling skill. You have to gamble. All right? You have to put a bet down. You have a currency known as the Grey Runes, or the Jade. You have a currency for the Jade that you have to put down and have a set payment for that said chess game and if you win that chess game then it doubles your jade and then you spend it at the jade emporium and then you use and you use the jade to buy more bonuses 
and buy more slimes and buy everything. Boom. Gambling. It's a, ga it, it, it's a gambling skill. Gamba skill. Gamba skill. Slime hidden RPG inside of Eilon. Every every RPG game has slides. Yeah, it's called Idle Slime RPG. Your more treasure hunts would be fire, dude. More treasure hunts would be cool. For Russian roulette and Eilon. Yikes. <laughs> I don't know about... I don't know about that. I think it's a mini game. I mean, I think I might be cooking too hard, bro. But I, I, it might be ranching. It might be ranching, Chet. Because if you had farming, ranching, and sneaking, I'm gonna be honest with you, sneaking is sneaking is totally just such a weird skill to have. Is that is is that just called being a rogue, or like a ninja, or even a shinobi? Uh, is a sneaking skill. We're, we're sneaking. All right. It's a scuba diving, obviously. Yo, Dave the Diver coming to Eidolon. Dave the Diver x Eidolon, bro. Plants versus zombies, samurai. No, chat, we're going to go to Waterworld in World 7, where then that's where he's going to implement an energy system because you're oxygen. So you have to go back to town, so you can't just active overnight in World 7. Eidolon roll at high level, but like snail, but there's a chance to delete your account on fail. I'd still do it. That'd be that'd be the best bets ever, dude. So I'm gonna be super famous. Sneaky unlocks of the ninja clans. Lab is obviously a huge fan of no game, no life summoning, dude. I love the idea of this skill, but it's so confusing. Well, that's that's what I mean. Here's the thing, chat. It can be as confusing as possible. That's why I'm here. All right. That's why I'm here to take something so completely, eitherly complicated and be like, bigger number equal better person. There you go. I explain the mechanic. It's if you do A to B to C. Yes, yeah, so we can just chat about it, dude. Alchemy guy. Yeah, oh, yeah. That's why G's cooking. Yeah, that's why I have to cook so much, all right? That's why I gotta, that's why I gotta cook. So then when it actually happens, I'm like, okay, I'm wrong. That's why 80% 80 of the base players is neglecting alchemy. It's because 80% of the base players don't watch Griffy Bit. Or my YouTube. Or my Griffy Bit TV channel, which is the second channel for... There's some IE reviews on there in the VOD channel. She is also going to be the nice but sometimes aggressive teacher that understands us. Yeah, I'm not I'm not the teacher you guys want. I'm the teacher that you guys need. There's a difference, all right? You know, Batman isn't the nicest guy in the world, but I mean he still gets it he gets the job done, you know? Last two bubbles of each color are really hard to get. Oh yeah, for sure. They're not meant to be easy. I mean, I have them locked, but I mean it's like like a one percent chance. But if you if you run Bubo and you cranium cook it, it's very, very quick. You'll, you'll, you'll get it in no time whatsoever. You just gotta cook, dude. That's all you gotta do. Just gotta cook. G's, G is like how my astronomy teacher was, dude. Batman threw my brand new car and insurance won't cover it. Don't be like him, dude. Yeah, exactly. I got the mage one and the archer one. Huge. I think, I think, I think, uh, I mean, I mean, you know what? I'm excited. Even, even if, I'm gonna be honest with you, even if, even if lava cooks super hard and it flops, I'm still going to be an enjoyer of it because it's just something new. I think I think we've just been cooking in World 5 for a little too long that I'm ready for something new at this point. I need something new at this point. I just I just haven't been cooking enough. I'm going to be scared, dude. It's okay. I'll be there with you. I'm not good at chess. It's not chess. It's not chess. When you make it a vlog with lava, a vlog a video log one of these days, chat, one of these days, I'll have an interview with Lava. One of these days. It's not chem looping. I'm okay with it. I mean, there's nothing, there's nothing wrong with chem looping. It's just, there's nothing wrong with farming cogs or doing, or doing gaming. It's just the problem with doing cogs and doing gaming is that that's all we've done for like two months now. And it's just, it's just, it's, it's, it, we cook, we cooking too hard. I'll be hyped if there's no gotcha or hard pay to win in World 6. Well, I mean, there's going to be, there's definitely going to be improvements to each mechanic for the gem shop. That's par for the course. And I mean, there's also going to be uh, new gods coming out that are probably going to end up helping World 6 from World 5. Uh, there's going to be new shiny pets that are going to help World 6. There's going to be the fractal island that's going to help World 6. Uh, there's going to be, I don't, probably there's going to be at least a little bit of RNG. There's nothing wrong with a little bit of RNG in games. Like, literally RNG everywhere. Like, name me an RPG where there's no RNG. Ground my hands into nubs, dude. Tired of carpal tunnel skills. 
Idolize active in the background, still grinding, or it needs to be in front to be active gains. Uh, it, it can be wherever, what? You just can't minimize it, Coffee. As soon as you minimize it, that's when it, that's when it just goes into AFK gains. But if you have it in the background windows, it, it still runs. Oh, so we're going to get the cattle crook bonus. Yeah, exactly. We're also going to get the cattle crook bonus. So dude's going to be even more potent. Um, there's, there's, and like, there's literally not a RuneScape. RuneScape even has, what are you, what are you talking about? RuneScape probably unironically has more RNG than anybody else. Like, hello? F like, fucking fire making and cooking? Like, what? That's, 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 <laughs> cooking is literally RNG. <laughs> you have a chance to burn your meal. That's, that's RNG. No, it's okay. It's not okay when it's pay to win 100% chance of free to place point zero zero. I don't think that's ever been a thing. I think, well, you could you could argue ancient artifacts, but he didn't do it for eldritch artifacts. So I mean, I mean, it. I don't. Eidolon has never been that way. You can you can play Eidolon free to play 100% other than auto loot, but that's just free to play plus. But there's never been a point in time where there has never nothing has ever been content locked to a paid mechanic. Oh, so the badger bonus? Yeah, true. New sigils? Uh, no, uh, oh yeah, new sigils as well. I said just kidding, dude. No, I don't know. I take everything serious. That's my point. Keeps it cool, nice. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't think I don't think it's, it's this new skill chess. Well, it's so so Lava's confirmed that all of these things together correlate with each other. Okay, so there's there's all these correlations. So we don't know so we're thinking that chess is just part of the mini game. Yeah, new shiny bonuses too, yeah, absolutely. Cough, dude, cough. Yeah, I can agree. I can agree to that, absolutely. But, but dude doesn't stop the content from playing. Dude just stops. Just dude just makes your life more efficient. But it doesn't. It's not locking you to content. What I'm what I'm talking about is like content locking. Is you can't enter you can't enter World Six until you pay for the DLC pack. That's twenty bucks. Right. That's what I'm talking about by content locking. Or you, you, yeah, you can play with, yeah, you can play it all without, exactly. As soon as, if there was content locking, that would be a problem. Yeah, if it was a paywall. There's no, there's no quote unquote paywall. But, but there is, but there is pay to win mechanics. You know, that, that's, so there's, there's a, there's a clear, clear difference of indicator, right? <sighs> but I mean, and I, you know, it's it all depends on. If it, here's here's how I say it. The game the game can be pay to win, as long as the game all the content is free. All right, that's what it really comes down to. If you can still do every skill, you can enjoy every part of the game, and you can do everything without without limitations, uh, within said game. Uh, then the then the game can be as pay to win as it wants, because it because here's the thing. Okay, as the years go on, it doesn't matter what how you look at it. If you're playing a free to play game, there's going to be there's going to be a cosmetic cash shop. Even if they say there's going to be no pay to win mechanics. Look at Taurus Land. Taurus Land was like, we're not going pay to win. And then literally like fucking 3 months later, it has a cash shop that gives you power. It's just like, okay, well, there you go. So I mean, free free to play just is par for the course for those those types of mechanics and why do you have those types of mechanics chat it's simple it makes fucking money someone say trove yeah trove is another great example world nine is content paywall buy from ip love developing a game yeah can trade my five plus multis i mean of course of course there's some other games that you can argue that aren't pay to win like you know path of exile that's a great example i mean it's you know you're just buying stash or or league of legends where you just buy you know um you just buy skins but there's a lot but at the same time there's a lot of alternative ways of how they make money right they're not they're not making it simply by cash shop items or skin sales even though they make a fuck ton of money from skin sales osrs yes that's another well i mean that I disagree because you have to pay for a membership, Demos. I don't know about you, but the free. But here, here's a great example of a paywall experience. OSRS. You need to pay a membership to unlock all the content within the game. If you're not paying for membership and you're free to play, it's it's you don't get the same experience as a pay to play player, because because it locks out content, specific content only allowed for free to play players. You are literally not allowed to go into a specific realm. 
because because you're because you have to pay a monthly but that's okay there's nothing wrong with that but people can consider that pay to win but but there but that's just par for the course it's a free to play game and it's one of the best games to ever be made runescape is by far the cream of the crop when it comes to uh it's like basically the never ending rpg Uh, POE technically forces you to pay twenty dollars in stashes. That's but the, uh, Saishu, That's the same as saying like uh, the Eidolon forces you to buy auto loot, right? It's like you can get away with it, but yeah, it's 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 pretty much a requirement. OG League was light pay to win. You either grind points to buy runes or rune pages to RP. Well, no, that's so. There's a difference between calling something pay to win and calling something quality of life. Okay, if you can pay money to buy rune pages, that's different. That's a, that's a quality of life. That doesn't change the game. That doesn't give you power. That just allows you to have a have more choices. Missing army. AQ used to pay. To, I'm almost positive AQ is still pay to win. AQ is still pay to win. And Moglin Master is still in the game. Chrono Master is in the game. You have to buy calendars to get certain classes. You have to buy membership. You have to buy guardianship in order to fully enjoy Avenger Quest's worlds. Avenger Quest is pay to win as fuck. It always has been. <laughs> Shit, $20 for a game, good big, mega value. Exactly. That's how we, you know, that's how we see it. You could buy runes outright also though. Then okay, yeah, then that's a little pay to win. Now you had to buy runes to grind for them. Yeah, I mean, but that's the same. It's like you can you can do that in Eidolon as well. It's like you either grind for them or or you can you can buy them, right? It's the same it's the same ideology. Pay to win and pay to fast. I mean, if there, in the end, if there's anything that gives you power in a game, it's pay to win, single player or multiplayer, regardless. Now, now, is, does it have a definitive difference whether if it's pay to win is worse in a game or not? Yes, and that's if it has PvP. If there's a leaderboard and PvP, that is always going to be an issue. And we're not calculating third party leaderboards. We are calculating if the game itself supports a leaderboard and or PvP. You have to suck Artrix to enjoy the game, dude. I actually, I love Avenger Quest Worlds. I don't know what you're talking about. Wizard 101, literally have to pay money for spells that are good in PvP. Yeah, exactly. By the way, I got both, 20 POE and all loot. Yeah, and, and you have a great time. I'm going to make dinner, haven't found Pixel Thursday. You should consider Factory Town Idol. Just have 1.0 release. I might try Dot Age. I'm going to be honest. I want to I give I want to give Dot Age a try today. Because uh, Dot, Age, Dot Age seemed a lot of like anarchy and fun, to be honest. So we 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 I we might give it a try. We're going to I think we're going to get into some idol on stuff here pretty quick. I don't I don't want to I don't want to dip too hard into the the whole the whole pay to win stuff mechanics because we we kind of go through that at least I would say at least once a week. I mean, I think we'd all agree here at least once a week this happens. It's fun played it as well. Yeah, so we we might we might take a look, but I I think I think now that we've had a lot of our questions answered with this one uh, I mean, all this stuff looks pretty awesome, dude. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be straight up. Like, I, I, I'm really excited. The disparage talk once a week. I, I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you, dude. I'm gonna be 100% honest with you. The, the, the more and more we talk about this, the, the less and less, uh, bad it is because it, it seems it's called paying the developer. Yeah, it's called paying your dues, gent. It's just the same as taxes. You gotta pay your tax. You gotta pay your developers. Now all there is to do is to wait, Sag, and let it cook, man. Just hate when devs make bloated grinds on purpose to make pay to skip seem worth. Well, I mean, true. I can agree with that. Absolutely. I can, I can agree bloated grinds for sure. You're 100% right on that. But at the same time, although it's a bloated grind, if, if, if it stops you from content, then it's a bloated grind. But if it's a, like, here, take this for instance, okay? Just take, just take this. Uh, let's take gaming skill as a, as a, as an example. Okay. You could consider that a bloated skill, but does it stop you from any sort of content or progression? No, because there will be upgrades later on. But is it a bloated grind because the community made it a bloated grind? Absolutely. So sometimes it's not always the developer's fault that makes a bloated grind set. Sometimes it's just the players themselves that make it a bloated grind set. Just look at, just look at uh, COGS as well, for example. People will keep on farming cogs and keep on getting those slow and slow amounts of percentages. If it's bloat through content is added over time, it's okay in my opinion. But if it's bloated from the beginning, that's predatory. True. I mean, that's fine. That's a that's a that's a that's a reasonable argument. Absolutely. But at the same time, it also depends on what game genre you're playing, right? If you're playing an idle game, everything's bloated. 
That's that's I mean even the even the damage numbers are bloated. That's that's an idle game. That's par for the course. Idle games means bloat. I mean that's all there is to it. Bigger number equal better person. But the but the cog the cog example is you know it's like. It's it's it, it, uh, the way I say is players make it bloated is because you don't need sixty five percent every bonus build rate cog, you don't need XP percent over a hundred percent, a hundred percent cogs on your cog board, and there's like seventy two cogs, right? That that is the player's choice to to make that decision, and that's the player's choice to make that skill itself seem way more bloated than it actually needs to be. So sometimes it's not always the developer's fault that makes a system seem bloated. It's actually the gamer's fault for making that said skill bloated. You see what I mean? See kind of the understanding that I'm getting across there? Because you don't need 10 million nugget level. Like, you don't need to have 10 million nuggets, okay? Nobody needs a 10 million nugget when, when the new mechanic of gaming comes out. Everybody's going to be caught up, okay? I guarantee it. I guarantee you'll get every bonus or whatever, and you don't need that big of a nugget. It's just if, if how fast you want to get there. But they've made it seem super bloated that way be, 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 because they keep on keep on farming the nugget and the nugget and the nugget over and over and over and over again, right? So it's, 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 it's another prime example of the developer not making it bloated. It's the player making it bloated. Nugget size matters? Yeah, it's because the players made it matter. That's the thing. Was it expecting a philosophical conversation about an idol game? Bro, I'm just out here with base takes. Sometimes, a lot of the time, I play devil's advocate as well. Because I, I could jump on the train and be like, yeah, fuck this, yeah, fuck that, yeah, everything sucks. But at the same time, I, I actually enjoy playing devil's advocate. Because it, it, it allows me it allows me to take a, take, take a second and put my shoes in another person's, or take my take myself and put them in another person's shoes and to see how their thought process could possibly be. And then that's how you become super and utterly based is because you're not basing a bias on what you're saying. Gee, how do you increase flag rate? Because it's been months. I still haven't unlocked a new, new slot. Um, well, there's cogs. There's cogs that give you flag rate. Enjoy the adventure. Absolutely. Can we talk about Kapingas again? Yeah. Summoning and use the summons on the chessboard, which gets you more runes to summon, etc. Buff to different aspects of the game with those runes. Yeah, probably. Yeah, yeah, true. Take your shoes and put them in another person, dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, bro. I, I, I was cooking raw eggs, dude. I, I was, I was cooking mad raw eggs. But yeah, chat. I, I think we've cooked long enough on this. I need to do my weeklies and stuff before we, uh, we try out another game. Uh, we play Pixel Thursday. So let's, let's get that tackled. Let's get that out of the way, and then we will. I think we're gonna try Dot Age today, chat. How much is Dot Age, anyways? Uh, Dot Age is, it's not terrible. It's like $23. It's not, not, not terrible, dude. It's a little expensive, but that's all right. Update the, the weekly battle command. Oh yeah, true. But isn't, isn't the weekly battle only for four skulls? Or did, did they, did they get that fixed? Is it, is it able to do more than four skulls now? XP cause feels like forever to unlock a new cog slot. Yeah, I mean that's yeah, four still. Is it? What is got no uh dot age? It's a it's a it's a base sort of like a base builder rogue uh, roguelike where basically catastrophe after catastrophe happens and you have to try to survive it. It's it's anarchy. And it's overwhelmingly positive and it's pixel art. Two level shrines for Econox, save all the chemists still get Econox. Get us get us to the G. Yeah, we could probably we could probably see if we could figure it out. Uh this is for four skull only. Okay. Well, I mean we'll get our four skull first and then we'll redo it and see what we can get in afterwards here. So let's uh let's try cooking here. Two 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 three 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 one three two two three two. Okay. So let's see. Two 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 Three 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 one three two two three two. Okay, so we got the four for sure. That's fine. I'm down with that. Okay, now let's actually try it. Um Okay, so we'll do attack. Oh shit, yeah, it's already rewinds. 
buff. 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 Burn their skin. Dealt twice. Okay, we're going to do that. Try that out. And we're going to do this. This rewinds. And then we're going to try to do maybe... Bosses under half health. Do this twice. We can't do that again because we already used a buff. And then we... If nine attacks, okay, we can't do that because it hasn't been nine attacks. I think, have we done the rewind buff? Well, we don't have a choice. Okay, and then. Still four skulls. That's kind of hard, dude. That's kind of, that's kind of fucking hard, man. Man, this, this better not be the first fucking boss that I don't get five skull on. Is Divine Sparky worth it? Divine Sparky? So what, the, what is Divine Sparky, bro? You have to get 10-digit crab cake to 5-skull that one? 10-digit crab cake? What do you mean 10-digit crab cake? You mean like kills-wise? Really? Oh, Divinity Sparks? Yeah, I mean, they're alright. She finally felt like a mortal in Eidolon? I actually, yeah, I actually feel like a mortal in Eidolon. That's crazy. Fucking mortal? That just means there's more bonuses. Alright, so now we officially have our multipliers to 950 each. That means they're all at their all at their 2.9 bonus. Uh, 10 digits would be 10 billion crab cakes. It would, I'm pretty sure. I believe that, yeah, that's correct. And I think the next we're going to do is we're going to level up Carpenter. What, uh, what level do I need for Carpenter? Uh, let's go to, we need to go into the internet, the interwebs chat, the interwebs. Nine fifty, is it nine fifty? Yeah, let me check. Yeah, it is nine fifty. The one billion ten digit, or am I tripping? I don't know. You might be tripping. I I haven't done the math for it. Yeah, it's nine fifty for an extra point one percent. This is ninety five percent potency. This is like hitting max. Discord bonus the bonus for this week were are all crab cake kills, cooking, and one off mining. Oh. So once you hit 95% on a bubble, is there really a point of leveling up the bubble anymore? I don't really think so, right? I feel like 95% is kind of like the maximum cook overdrive. I don't really need any. Once it's higher, you should probably just work on something else because the bonuses you're getting are just so minuscule. Probably go linear at like 85%. Well, I'm getting all the, like, the super important ones to 95%. Like, the multiplier, I get to 95%, right? Like, since I already did Quick Slap to 5,000, I mean, I would feel like it's kind of overkill to have Quick Slap anymore. 97% is Maximus. I don't think, I don't think it's even worth it for another extra 2%, because what is it? An extra fucking 2,000 for 2%? I don't, I don't, I don't think that's, I don't think that's something I want to push for. I think 95% on just the major bubbles is the more important ones. Like, I'm pretty sure this... Uh, what is what is even Hardy Diggy at 95%? 1900? Oh, so I'm almost there. I'm almost at 95% potency for Hardy Diggy. But people are going to get this shit to 4,000 anyways. They're going to try to get it up as high as possible for just the smallest of micro gains. All right. So we got that done. Okay, chat, here we go. First gamba. Uh, nine attempts, one nothing trophy. Here we go. Today's the day, chat. Today's the day that we get it. Feeling good about it. Feeling clean about it. Feeling strong about it. 
This is the way the cookie crumbles, man. It's the way she's gotta go. I believe in the heart of the cards. KG, listen here for a sec. What's up? If you don't get the if you don't get the nothing trophy, yeah, what up? There goes most of my box that G gets it today. I'm for sure getting it today. You owe me a spin on the bonus, bonus, bonus wheel. If I don't get the trophy wheel, no, absolutely not. Absolutely not, bro. What the fuck? It's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Bro, imagine me agreeing to a losing battle. That's that's like that's like agreeing to get ripped off. That's, like, that's such a stupid game. Like, you know, I, I'm I'm all for the gambling, dude. I, I, like, I, I like the gambling. Like, don't get me wrong. But, like, I know when it's a dumb fucking gambling, bro. <laughs> like. That's like, that's like. Bro, that's like trying to beat the devil in a, in a, in a fiddle competition. If I lose, I have to give my firstborn son, bro. It's like, obviously, I'm going to, I'm going to lose, bro. All right. That fucking devil went down to Georgia, dude. Okay, counter deal. How you? That does, That's not how. That's not how that works. You don't make a deal, and then and then I don't make a deal. So then you counter deal. Do you even understand what the point? Do you understand the definition of a fucking counter counter deal is? I would be doing the counter deal because you made the initial deal. But Johnny did win the fiddle competition. I yeah, but I ain't Johnny. I ain't Johnny though. That's the problem. If you get the trophy, then the bonus wheel comes out, dude. Bonus, bonus, bonus. It's okay. We'll figure out things to screw over my account for the bonus wheel coming in World 6. Don't worry. All that stuff. We're going to be bringing back all that stuff, chat. All that stuff is going to be brought back. Don't you worry. Don't you worry your little head out. By the way, G, I have three Blood Berserkers, two, two Squires. Guess what error did I get my account? My fourth warrior samples half amount of the other peeps. You have three Blood Berserkers, though. That's that's the that's the major issue that I'm having with what you just said. Why the f why do you have five warriors, Coffee? Why why do you have five warriors? I'm worried. I'm very worried. Oh, by the way, I started farming dreadly apart. I finally decided to farm Dreadlio boats. Well, I wouldn't say it's ruined. Well, it's it's kind of borked, but I I hope I mean at least it's at least it's better than nothing, I guess. Cooking go birded. Yes, so does fucking impulse, dude. Impulse went even burr. Dreadlio, dude? You making fun of my Dreadlio? Just like you're gonna make fun of my level 21 snail? Fuck. We learned nothing. We don't need to learn anything, bro. Ten Beastmasters meta. Only if you only if you dislike yourself, bro. Only if you can't stand yourself. Alright, next one. Oh, look at all that sailing procs, baby. One of these days, Jeff, we're gonna be all maxed out and juiced out of our minds. Did you boost the odds for a level 20 snail? I did a little bit, yeah. Not enough, though. Tim Bubo for the alchemy loadout. Yeah, true. True, that's a lot of cranium cooking. Still nothing, trophy? It doesn't exist. Also, what's up with the one boat? What do you mean, the one boat? What you talking about, one boat? Uh, excuse me. More certainly. You mean the one boat going super fast? Or are all the boats stacked up? It look like you have one. Yeah, because okay, so all the boats are stacked. He's cruising. Yeah, because all of them are minimum two hours, right? So they're all the same time, so they move at the same speed. Eight more levels. I just need freaking... Six more levels now, and that's my next Dreadlio boat. 
I decided that I need to I need to get Dreadlio boats done, bro. Dreadlio boats are important. Because for that potential time, that one potential that Lava's gonna be like, hey, I'm adding new mechanics. Hey, Zam. Wow, Zam. Imagine Zam. Not gonna happen till mid world six. Yeah, probably. So I got lots of time. I got oodles of time, bro. I think I understand why my comment was wrong. The attacks are based off spec character count, so a specific character of mine needs more crab kills to, to up the damage choice. Ah. Uh, that makes sense. That makes big sense. Right? I'm still stuck on my sailing. You know, you know what I'm excited for, chat? The one thing that I'm excited for the most? Rift upgrades. New rift stuff. That's what I'm excited for. I want to see how hard rift scales. I hope rift scales super disgustingly. Because that's the that's the one thing that Lava can go full gung-ho on is, is fucking Rift. He can hyperscale that to new ends, bro. And I'm 100% okay with that. Make it super hard. Make it so Quick Slap is basically negligible unless it's like level 16,000, bro. Maybe I'm cooking too hard. How goes the Nikki grind, Zam? This is just kind of a damage check. That's what I like about it. Terribly. Okay, so I, I might as well just not dare you ask how goes the Eidolon grind, because it's probably the same. Star sign doubler, double infinity star signs. Only the ones you have selected. So it still goes by the three. Man, I'm sleeping so hard on Eidolon. You're sleeping... I'm almost done world five. Well, as long as you're f good for world six, I mean... I mean, I wouldn't consider that sleeping, dude. I would consider that playing Eidolon at your own pace. That's what I would consider. I don't think there. I don't think there's any right way to play Eidolon. Well, there is, but I mean, I wouldn't say there's a right way. I would say there's an efficient way. Call me bad, bro. Hi, pickle. Do rip bonus. King Duke gets ten times the bonus. <laughs> my pace is sleeping dude oh you so you're just having to open that shit up took me two months to get to the end of world five from scratch i mean that's pretty good two months is definitely speed running is mob respawn active in rift uh i don't think i don't know if mob respawn affects rift or not i'm uncertain i think it might personally i'm nearly done with onyx statues idle skilling trophy well Paying tier, tier, playing tears of the kingdom. You do you. Yeah, exactly, dude. I am farming mobs, bro. I said Eidolon, not fucking Maple Story, dog. It's clearly two different things. And Maple Story, all you do is grind mobs. The right way to play Adam is not have fun. Trust me, I tried. It was no longer a game, dude. To you, it's a game. To us, it's investment. You right? Just got an ES to one k million damage today. Now try farming, printing materials for level thirteen vials. Get it, dude. Well, actually, what you should be. Well, what you should be doing is uh, you should uh, use your B-man to take monster prints, but. But I mean, definitely, definitely do you, boo. Future content blog, sneak peeks. Lava got some super hype stuff coming up. It really does. Finish my obsidian statues and gain 80% movement speed. All my characters starting to feel like there's a left to do is God ranks gaming and sailing. I guarantee you I could probably find like at least five or six things for you to work on. I I even still to this day am working on specific things that I'm not really done when it comes to God ranks gaming and sailing. Like I could I could be doing those things, but I am working on those things. But there's definitely a lot more to it. Are you are you close to where I'm at, Jabir? Cause if you are, then yeah, I can understand. If not, then you probably still have a lot more to do. It's just it's just mostly time gated. How much money would it take to buy enough gems to be world six ready? Um, zero. To be completely honest, you could be world you could be world six ready with zero with zero dollars. Straight up, 
No, no joke. No scam. World 6 is January 22nd because it's my birthday. Trust. Yeah, all right. True. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, but I got to play then? Well, yeah. There's a lot more to do just all the time. Get a point. I'll be active. Siege break. Get that achievement. Boobing to oblivion most days. So beneficial to whale this game, though. It is and it isn't. I, I would say, did, do I benefit past anybody else? No. What would I am I one of the bigger whales? No. Am I am I stronger than most people? No. There's people that have passed me that play this game practically free to play. Yes. You just received pierogies? No, it's chicken teriyaki. I think I just might buy the one, two, three, four. Okay, Dread Leo boat's done. It's okay. Not to be okay. True. Well, later game, you kind of farm the gems you need, but at that point, it takes a bit. Yeah, for sure. Then most people, absolutely yes. No, I disagree. I, I really disagree. I could probably get to the same level that I am at right now with just auto loot. Are you the strongest? Absolutely not. I am not even fucking close. But I could, I could get to... I, I I could get to about this the same same sort of level. Upgrade speed to make last island in cap time. Yeah, I mean we're mostly just focusing on dread low boats at the moment. Auto loot is green on siege. I mean free. I mean yeah, it's free. I guess if you if you take a look at it that way for sure. You got refinery? Oh shit, did I? Okay, thanks. Definitely cooking with the speed though. Uh, are you guys all in cattle crook gear or should you I I kept some in magma. Which skills are coming in world six? So we have farming, pickle. Uh farming, sneaking, and like this sort of uh celestial chess fucking bobby be beep boop up i don't i don't know dude i'm i'm so lost of what it is it's something farming arcane waters bro we're not farming fucking potatoes dude i hate chess it's not chess though it, it's yeah it, it's it's i've been playing this game a lot over the last two weeks or so i'm in world four i joined some random guild that starts level 15 should i drop them and join a higher level guild nobody in the guild probably it's pretty cool pretty good to be honest very creative yeah it is you remember arcane waters dude i was contemplating playing it the other day all right that's 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 how much i know about arcane waters okay i was like man we should we should take a look at arcane waters and then i took a uh, then i took a look at his play count i'm like literally nobody plays literally there is literally i think the maximum they have is like 10 players like i even took a look at their discord they have they have community game night where they play fucking Minecraft, not Arcane Waters. They play Minecraft. Okay, imagine getting L ratioed that fucking hard, dude. Imagine spending ten years on a game just to flop within two months. Like, bro, I I don't know about you, but if that happened to me, that's how I start addictions. Okay, this is this is this is when I become an alcoholic in game. All right, because 10 years of my life going into something like that just become irrelevant in like two months, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm about I'm about to ask why, bro. And then Lava add fourth alchemy liquid. Yo, but Minecraft's critically acclaimed game, Eidolon after world eight. Yeah, but at least we get eight worlds, right? At least this game has been popping and alive for like two years. Not, not fucking two months. That's like at least how many more months? 22 more months, bro? A lot of months. Remember Dawn Crab? I miss Dawn Crab. Doing that now. The day before it flops in less than three days. This is how you're going to look back on your YouTube channel. Vintage story is the bomb. Oh, yeah. Especially, I mean, here's the thing. If Eidolon does die, I mean, pfft. I got to take my everybody with you. Maple story win. So then, so then when we're streaming, we'd be like, remember, you guys remember Eidolon? Bro, what a game Eidolon was. Man, Eidolon, I used to love playing Eidolon, bro. All the time. Resmi reminiscing about the good old days. 
Griffy, quick question. What is it worth on ending loot search? Is it only for players who have AFK longer than amounts of time? Players with King Dude also use it. Um, so I've actually never been 100% sure of when to use unending loot search. I personally don't use it if I'm trying to get artifacts. But if I but if I if I'm trying to to just get materials, then I then I don't use it. But I don't know if that's ass backwards or what. The good old SR days. Yeah, true. And use it until I was done with artifacts. Yeah. It's kinda how I said. You can play Idolon inside of Minecraft. Is that where Smile's been? Yeah, that's where Smile's been. Chad, I need to eat my food. Bro, SR had a Christmas miracle. It's a live game, bro. No, it's not. It's alive if you're French, okay? I'm a Genesee Bocibuku, Zelazam. I fucking, I don't know about you, but I don't know fucking French to save my goddamn life. If somebody had a gun pointed in my head and be like, speak, speak French, I would, I would be like, well, I'm fucked. Escache la toilette. You know, that's this. Yeah. And, and you know, what's the best part, dude. You know what? You want to know what the best part about SR's uh, Christmas miracle is their, their, their servers still can't handle those types of people, bro. Still can't fucking handle those types of people. And, and you want to talk about Christmas Miracle? There was no growth. I took a look at all those streamers that have been in there for so long. They got no growth from the French coming in. Whatsoever. Like Hooks, Angel, all the rest of them. They got no benefit from them coming in. Whatsoever. I only know how to say, can I use the restroom in French? Don't ask me how, dude. Yeah, we're never getting the trophy, G. No, we're never getting the fucking trophy, dude. Go to sleep now. Can't tell I play. Tell, tell you, I, I'm going to, I'm going to, I, there might be t t potential possibility, maybe, if only a 50-50 uh, irregular, maybe, possibility that there will be playing bird gut. Oh! By the way, did you guys hear? By the way, I I have to eat. But did you did you guys hear? There's gonna be no more Matt Pat. Game theory is retiring, bro. Game theory is retiring. Thank God, dude. Hot take. Game theory is gonna die because there's no Matt Pat. Matt Pat made game theory still on live streams creating mine for oh yeah he's, he's still he's still got a few more videos to do but he has announced his retirement tell me i have to break my sleep schedule for even more for a chance dude yep tom scott more though eh. but he's done being the face of game theory yeah march 9th is the last upload it's not going to die, but lose a lot of views. It's not going to be even close to the same that it's been before. It's really helpful and down to earth. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it, it's like, but you know what that also means, chat. You know, you know what that also means. It's quite simple, really. It means more views for your boy. Woo! Let's go! Ba, 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 ba. All these all these big time all these big time content creators quitting, that just means there's time there's more places for the little guys. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, dude? Bro, you've been working out, damn. No, it doesn't. Sure it does. You don't know that. Okay, Chad, I gotta eat my food. 2024. Shut up. Did you hear about all AI armor stuff? AI Griffy, please, dude? Eidolon theories? That's just a theory. An Eidolon theory. Thanks for watching. Okay. So, chat, we have to watch our favorite YouTuber ever did. Favorite YouTuber. Okay. You may know him as uh, HD Graphics. And uh, I have to eat my food. So, this is 
top 10 best high graphics MMORPG games for mobile 2024. And this is the day chat that Eidolon is going to be on here. Four is the best year for a mobile in the game industry, especially for MMORPG game and RPG game genre. AKA this alternative type of game is always created by the most popular games developers. Oh wait, before we start, before we before we watch best chat, you need you need to you need to see you need to see the food. Look at that chicken teriyaki, baby. Chicken teriyaki for to dinner today. Mm -mm -mm. Good stuff. Hog and Dawg's final boss. Zelda reskin. Insta destroyed it. Mm -hmm. Good stuff. All right, let's get back. Let's get back to the react. Trash? You're just trash because you wish you had some, dude. I'm going to make myself a little bit smaller. There you go. Always represent with a high quality gameplay and graphic. No wonder the fans always come to play the best RPG or MMORPG on mobile. No, they come for Moreover, you, dog. Some of the game made by Unreal Engine. Spicy or trash? MMO, I can't eat spice. Cross platform MMO. Please help this video get 200 <laughs> likes. Thanks. Top 10 Best High Graphic MMORPG Games for Mobile 2024 Best RPG Games for Android iOS 2024 Dark Griffey or Thirsty Griffey, dude? I'm terrible. You can support this channel I don't like... I, I, my Crohn's doesn't base. let me have spicy food. The Starlight. The Starlight. So many Unreal Engine 5... <laughs> there ain't no fucking way this is a mobile game. Ain't no fucking way this is a mobile game, bro. No shot. No shot. Five MMORPG games coming up in 2024. That's playable nice in assets, bro. with poor Android, nice. iOS, PC, and console. Bro. Just imagine we can do it. This in developer knows what he's in doing. Account that sound really interesting. The game publisher is quite familiar on mobile game industry and has a lot of experience, which has come to us by Korean. Finally, he revealed the actual remember, game dude. become the star like MMORPG game. The second video trailer saw us how the in game Take footage camera, looks bro. like. It totally impressed me by the visual and how sharp the graphics are. The combat mechanism oh, has fast combat in attacking speed and is quite flashy in skill bro. effect. Just to inform you, the game's Bro. developer behind this game was made a popular game on PC like Terra Online and Cabal, which is really a veteran of so fucking shameless. RPGs. No wonder the character's Crosses appearance yeah. seems like Terra at all. We have seen two different characters of Magicians and Gunner. I'm pretty sure we will get more classes footage later. The Starlight. Where is the big juiced out steroid using barbarian? All right, where's our unachievable gains, bro? It's the best MMORPG Unreal Engine 5 MMORPG no idea what it is. games 2024 for mobile and cross-platform. So basically, this is all you have to think, Cub. Uh, think of a volcano? Now place that in somebody's stomach. Night Crows. That's, that's basically Crohn's. Night Crows. I replayed this game and I was shocked seeing how many players are active playing these new games. Now this looks like a mobile game, baby. This looks like a mobile game. Giga Chad Barbarian with the third legs. Yeah, bro. As MMORPGs while they game were the in the city. Actually, I love how At least it's not some free rendered trash like that last so game. It will affect players to become loyal to this game. This is a new MMORPG that was made by Unreal Engine 5. No Who the fuck is going to be loyal to this game? Name me one person. Name me the reason why somebody would play this game over playing fucking BDO online. All right? I wonder the point of view is really great even in the long distance. We can clearly see the panorama. I, I, will, I will give it credit where credit's due. That render distance for a mobile game is fucking wild, dude. That's actually wild. But you can clearly see that there's paid currency right here with the fucking big diamonds at the top. Being architecture, Nightcross let the players pick male and female Yeah, that's crazy render distance. Job that we have to option classes. This MMORPG has auto features of main quests and also for combat. The combat mechanism Probably. seems quite clunky in action, but the ragdoll PC is really Play good, just to explore. especially when we land the hit or when the enemy knock down. Seriously, this game is- Okay. This is the one thing that I've always loved, bro. Fucking clan capes are the sickest shit, dude. I love clan capes. Oh my god, clan capes just always hit right for me. I don't know why, 
but this is you can instantly tell that these are all clan capes they go so hard like look at that little mushroom dude some games are two gigabytes but they require 20 gigabytes of downloads after them yeah true they suck in rs3 though yeah because they give like no real beneficial bonus one of the best open but this goes hard I, I love clan capes clan capes are to barge something like represent your guild instead of just a name your journey at the moment this game is only available in a specific region hopefully to be to be fair basically everything in runescape is pretty ugly as fuck Cross will launch globally rs3 in or osrs the best mmor you know it's a korean game when there's a fucking corgi mount god damn it why is there always a fucking corgi mount literally every game it's either a corgi mount or a corgi companion we even have a corgi fucking companion goddamn idol on RPG 2024 cross-platform games for Android, iOS, and PC. Yeah, chap. This is only three gigs, plus twenty gigs of shaders. Abyss Knight. Abyss Knight. I think this is the best RPG. This was game looks like a fucking flashbang. Especially the music boss. Wait, wait, wait! You did not battle. say inspired by a Souls game. You're gonna tell me that loot's gonna drop like that and not call it Asian Diablo? Knight. I think this is the best RPG was inspired by Soul Game as special by a Souls game. Bro, you're so out of left field. The music boss battle and how the boss battle looks like. The combat <laughs> mechanism is Jack, Jack, can you dodge? Yes, Souls like. Fuck off. Really epic. Even the boss monster will not showing us the danger area skill which we need to practice his skill perfectly to dodge. I it. actually unironically really like the art style. You know what? You know what this reminds me of, like the art style. It's uh, what was that one MMO RPG fighting game where you had to use like Drunken Fist, Tiger Palm? It was like uh, Absolver. Fuck, dude, Absolver. What a good game. A lot of people hated Absolver. I was obsessed with Absolver. I fucking love that game. It reminds me of this art style. Some of the extra skill will trigger after we create a combo and the button will appear shortly that we need uh, to tap name of name of this game was uh Abyss Knights. And unleash the combo. I really love that it has a Yo, yo, finger review? I loved Arc Age till they wrecked the economy. I loved Arc Age until they fucking had a fucking late game start. Late game was trash. Fake fingers, dude. Yeah, it's just a green screen. A very good graphic. It seems like a roguelike anime style. We also need to pass through the obstacle and jump to reach the other spot. Hopefully where's the, they where's will the create UI? Co-op multiplayer mode, especially in fact. Yo, the nice pull, bro. Monster. Absolutely, it's pretty tough. Yo, I'm yo, look at this Digimon looking ass, dude. Pretty sure Abyss Nike will become into a triple A action hack and slash. Does he know what the definition of a triple A is? I don't, I don't think I don't think he knows the definition of triple A is. Paid late hand model, dude, for sure. This game RPG. This game the looks this this game is just Korean Diablo. Which the skill will Why is Gwendolyn in here, dude? We just need to maintain <laughs> the cooldown skill time. I think the developer should add the parry system or counter system to create a balance action in combat between the enemy's strength. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't like any of the SAO games. I think all of them were kinda kinda Kind of garbo. And our characters. Abyss Knight. To be fair, people said Absolver was garbo, so. I did the holder. Games for Android, iOS. Eater's Fire, MMORPG. I don't know. What kind of game is this, chat? Just based off the title. I think it might be an MMORPG, but I can't quite put my finger on it. Hot take. I think games should stop putting the game genre in their name. It's like, it's like putting, it's like, it was like if I put Griffy Bit TTV in my name, it's just like, okay, we get it. You're, 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 you're a fucking game. But like, just, just take, just, just take out the fucking, take out this part. Just call it Etterspire. Don't call it Etterspire MMORPG. SOA Award Underworld Anime, I think Nightmare watching that, dude. I liked SAO Anime. Etterspire. Oh. Uh... Take out idle, call it Eidolon? Yeah, but Eidolon's an MMORPG. It just has idle idol mechanics. So it's it's not it's not necessarily. Even worse playing two genres. Title like idle MMO. I mean, yeah, I mean I don't I don't necessarily agree with Eidolon the idle MMO. But I mean 
if it, if it, 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 I would, I would just want to uh, personally. Here's what I personally think: bring back Legends of Eidolon, okay? Definitely, definitely, Legends of Eidolon is way better than Eidolon the Idol MMO. Hot take. So I think you need to have a distinction. What if they make one that's an FPS? Then then don't call it, don't call it Edder. That's stupid. Then then you call it Edder Spider FPS or Edder Spider MMO RPG. People already have a hard time reading. Legends of On, dude. The heck is that? Yeah, SAO is great. Underworld season was horrible. I liked all SAO, regardless of what it was. You know, solo leveling has a mobile game coming out in 2024. Huge. MMORPG. I would recommend you to play this game as the most played MMORPG game 2024 on mobile. Which That's cap. Will fit on any devices level. That's so cap. So you all will love to play it anytime with a Bro, lower... this looks like fucking Sherwood Dungeons if it was less poly. Oh, by the way, chat. How much you want to bet that this guy at level 8, okay, this this guy's fucking level 8, dude, with this full gear, how much do you think that cost him? I'm thinking, I'm thinking at least 40 bucks. And there's gonna, uh, how much you want to bet there's like this special purple pack that for $40 will give you all this, plus, but wait chat, there's more, plus a pet companion. It's probably only 40 bucks. It's it, There's no way in fuck it's 500 bones. PO level microtransactions, 480. At least $1 billion is the pet of Corgi. <laughs> $5 loot box, not the pet companion. Yeah, true. Third times battery life. Seriously, I was shocked. That's $20 wings right there. For sure, big old $20 wings. His mom's credit card maxed out at twenty dollar wings. He didn't. He didn't want his mom find out, so you can buy the whole pack. Chance he only had enough for the wings. Playing this game, how light this game is. Don't forget the five dollars to unlock all your bag space. You yeah, true. And you have to. And not to mention, you also have to connect your account to Tencent. Of MMORPG, no auto play. MMORPG, no auto combat. And MMORPG. No Boo! No auto combat. What are we playing games like we have all the free time in the world? No auto mission, so everything should be done, man. It sucks. I get more weapons from boss than gear, bro. Like, what? Okay, chief. If you're getting, at least you're getting loot drops. Like, imagine, imagine not complaining about loot drops, dog. Normally, from the game's review, many players agree with me. If this MMORPG is no pay to win game, we can freely green new equipment through drop no items, pay to even though it has a features to tell us the best okay. spot for grinding. Sure. Make sure you find sure. the no enemy that has yep, sure. 10 levels sure. than yep. yours to give a drop it. items. Just like Diablo Moro, anyway, right? I really love that the costume looks pretty insane, especially with the wings and how the armor will show the shiny effect when you reach a higher gear level. Every piece of the equipment that you you are wearing will adjust the character's appearance as well the stronger you are the cooler your gear will look i like how basic fundamentals are are praised for being good features am i am i crazy for that so i'm saying it's it's like such a feat in gaming when they're like oh if you equipped an item it shows on your character whoa it's like yeah that was fucking great back in what 2003 but it's like what what the what the fuck man it's like this is it's like flash games have better shit than this come on let's get it to, let's fucking get it together here it, that shouldn't be a definitive feature Atlas Fire is one of the most played MMORPG games under with iOS 2024 2020's Blade gaming X g terrible Odyssey. Blade X Odyssey this is holy shit This game looks fucking pay to fucking win, Chief. The reason why I always told my subscriber to be patient waiting for the best RPG games on mobile. This game is the best example to let you all know how Lost the game Dark, is through dude. so many process and finally released on mobile with the- My phone is on fire thinking about this. My phone is on fire thinking. Imagine playing Elden Ring, your character's appearance would change with your armor, and then they added a DLC pack that made it so it changed with your armor, like it's some kind of, like, innovative feature. But dude, this is, it bro, my phone. High quality oh, by the way, chat, this isn't his gameplay. See how it's zoomed Ruffy. in? 
Blade X Odyssey now is available in English, and I would say this is the best action RPG. Whenever he has a shit, whenever he has a shit zoomed in, of many famous action it's, games a, back it's, then. it's it's shown that, that, that it's not his gameplay. The hero only while in the lobby, so we need to adjust your favorite hero just before entering. I mean, the game looks cool by building up the character's strength. But, when but the, the phone the is definitely on fire. Then we can switch the hero the baby's combat. burning. The, gameplay the is wife really divorced you. Skill effect. It's, it's all over. Letting the hero do a counter attack if we can predict the enemy's attack before he lands to us in the right time. Would I play it? Avoid the incoming attack. Is I mean, probably. Remember but this is, the right so th this is this is a great indicator of this is a blue stacks game. Okay, this, this is 100% a fucking blue stacks game. You just have you just have clear indicators of what is a phone what is an actual phone game and what is a what is a blue stacks game. Wait for a real game. Says it's not that great. Bro, Spash. If he shows a game that's not and he says it's not that great, bro. A, it wouldn't be on the video. And two, we would have like a whole Dr. Stone arc where everybody turns into fucking stone. Because of the world, bro. World got petrified, okay? We gotta because if he says a game is good, dude, then we we need to reset we need to reset our world about thirty seven hundred years. Hack slash is boring shortly after. Yeah, I mean true. Has a show Ring of Fire Prometheus yet? No. Every game can't be the best new. Sure can. To your it can. It can if it's satire. Skill. The regular skill can be caused by waiting for the cooldown, such a satisfying new RPG game. This is the best new game RPG for Android iOS High Graphic 2024. And how much you want to bet that all of these character models stay like this until you pay real money to get different cosmetic skins? Down, such a satisfying new RPG game. It's all how much you want to bet that you have to pay cosmetics to even change this. This is oh, and look at down here, chat. Shard system, zero out of fifty, zero out of fifty. So just to just to get the new characters, you need a you need to you need to do the shard system. The best new game RPG for Android iOS High Graphic 2024. Oh wait, wait, chat. See this? Look at this. You see these gems and these coins at the top here. Oh, gems and coins. It almost looks like they use the same fucking system. Oh, crazy. Did you look at that? It's almost like mobile games do the same fucking system One over and over has again. High graphic 2024. Amazing. Unending down. Uh, it's, it, it's, uh, it's unending dawn, but that's okay. With $50 to have ability roll. Down. Yeah. This new RPG game should get more attention because yes, the game's quality is really satisfying, especially with the sword-based game. This is the most Genshin fucking bro. This is the most shameless Genshin clone I've ever fucking seen. Holy shit, that is so fucking. That's just Genshin, bro. Even the dashes, like I know, I know, it's just because the art style. You're like, oh, everything's Genshin Impact, but this is actually just Genshin Impact. Like even with the weapon, even with the dashing. Even with the art style, it's all Genshin Impact. I will keep telling my subscriber if this game will exist. In fact, it's really worth playing later. The gameplay will easily oh. remind me of the legendary action game, which Dark Soul or Soul Light game, but in anime style. If you notice the way our character does, okay, a okay, the combat's actually not the bad. The of the sword is quite similar, like a Sekiro. Try to hold up, hold up, let it cook. That was kind of sick. Deal a bigger damage by counter attack, which I'm really happy about in this game. It's basically Keyquin at this point. Get yourself ready to try some or Kichi, whatever like the fucking name the is, lightning bitch. Hang into some objects. The combat mechanism is man. That skirt is fucking it's just fast, do it, just perfect, just doing its service, level. just literally Dooting perfect image every single time. For us on surviving from the aggressive boss in coming attack. This character has every more trust in the skirt than I have do in society, bro. Because this RPG was made by Unreal Engine Five. An ending down is a solo or single. I don't. I'm gonna be honest with you. If people, if people are gonna be like, "Oh, this is made by Unreal Engine Five, so it should be good," no, I, I fucking hard disagree. I feel like Unreal Engine Five should not be the selling point. 
Because that, it, the game's made in that engine doesn't mean that it fucking, the game's instantly going to be good because it's Unreal Engine 5. It's like, I bet you I could make a dog shit game in Unreal Engine 5. And, but, but I'd be like, it's the selling point, chat. Sun, selling point is Unreal Engine 5. Buy it now. Really, he has to play the game he's referencing? Yeah, Sekiro. Imagine, imagine comparing a fucking beautiful game like Sekiro to a fucking mobile game, dude. More ash, more passion. True. Player RPG game like it's literally Genshin. Shadows of so Mordor. Yeah, but it's anime. Player because it's yeah, not a wolf. game with the MMO genre. And then it's different down is the best RPG. High graphic for we're gonna finish this video and then we're gonna get back to grinding. PC. Odin it's... Valhalla Rising. Great frame rate. Odin Valhalla Rising. This game is absolutely magnificent. But remember, before you play it, you must be Yo, that fuck, bro. Even that fucking render distance insane. Okay, here's the thing. Okay, I'm just gonna be the first one to say it. Phones aren't ready for these types of graphics. They haven't been for years, and they won't be for years. Okay. Oh look, gems and coins. Literally, wait. Is this the exact same UI? It's literally the exact same fucking UI. At the top here, it's the same fucking thing. I don't, I don't, I don't think, I, so here's the thing too, chat, okay? I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this out here, okay? If you have to have a, your character level with, if you have Wi-Fi or not, the time and how much battery you have left, this game shouldn't be mobile, okay? Because the, the game is completely self-aware that every minute it's using 1% of your battery. It's completely self-aware, and it knows all about it. So it's constantly telling you, you only have X amount of plays. You know, it, why Why don't you just might as well have the temperature of your phone and also have your fan speed? Because at the same time, it's basically like it's a fucking BIOS, okay? Like, holy shit. We don't need this. It's also killing your phone's CPU. It's too much. It's too much. I shouldn't have to buy an Asus ROG to play a fucking game. Okay, like, I personally think do a more artistical art design for a mobile game and reduce how much it needs because this is crazy, dude. Because here's the thing, you go for high 3D graphics, but you're limited because it's a mobile fucking device. Like literally 60% of the player base can't play games like this on their phone. Or not even like 80% of people can't play this on their phone. And if they do, their phone heats up and it's just not worth playing. Like, like there's, I don't understand why people do this because there's absolutely little to no market for it. It's crazy to me. It's absolutely crazy that people would think that this has a market. And this is realistically, this is going to get like 300 downloads and like three people will play it. Dude, I'm making games for Steam Decks and put them on Apple Store and Android Store instead. Yeah, it's like, holy fuck, if you're going to make a game... But it, the thing is, is the reason why they do that is because they can't keep up with the fucking actual, like, Steam or PC gaming. Like, there's, there would there would be more of a market to put this on Steam and just update the graphics rather than putting on mobile and reduce the graphics. Because most people won't even be able to play this game. Most people will download this game, play it for 5-10 minutes, realize that it's fucking taking up way too much percentage of their phone, and uninstall it because it's 25 gigs. Yeah, it looks like it literally looks like a pixelated mess. And, and it's like I've seen so many games like this. And it's just they're not ready. We're not ready for this type of thing. To play it, you must be ready to see the game source is pretty huge for a mobile game. It's yeah, it's 25 gigs. 20 plus GB. But I guarantee you will never regret downloading it and getting in. Counter, counter, counter argument. I guarantee you'll regret fucking downloading this. I 100% think you'd regret downloading this. Gary, Gary, fucking tee it, bro. Love quickly to see how amazing the landscape is. It has a beautiful green land with. Okay, landscape does not mean that the game is not empty. You can have all the landscape in the world because guess what? A engines can just give you procedurally generated fucking worlds. It doesn't mean that the game is gonna be fucking just straight empty. 
a pretty wide and waiver assets to download the combat mechanism seems like That's a true. classical mmo because our characters will stand still in one spot which we cannot move the characters while attacking at the same time every skill and it's tap target a different amount of mana overall you all can relax playing it because of magic getting three shot by fucking walrus bro battle. the game will take place in the viking era or medieval era where we can see how the people in no man's sky at launch yeah but no man came back here's the difference between this and no man's sky this will never have a redemption arc like no man's sky will 110 percent. no no fucking chance and you'd think starfield would take a book out of no man's sky nope no sure didn't let's go let's go all jump on a moon jet let's uh let's go uh, explore a moon because we we play games for the realism yeah, I love I love jumping on an endless spacious moon with nothing on it. Oh, so how do you single target me with a three minute ad block? Are you hourly clicking revenge, dude? You know me. Starfield devs are backing it all the way. As well. this is yeah, it's just the like the Blizzard devs. Don't you have phones? RPGs because the UI is really fit on mobile. That may so you're telling me that you're fucking up lambs with long ears like is it just me or did they have to make like the cutest looking animal to beat the shit out of you know what i mean it's like this is why this is why a lot of mmorpgs do do slimes okay this is why this is why they do boars okay because boars aren't fucking cute you're literally basically killing bambi like bro like i know i know it's i know it's like a lamb but like holy fuck dude like could you have made it any cuter and then and it's like, let's go slay these goats? That's fucked up. Makes the screen Lambie, seem dude. so clear and enjoyable to play. Yeah, it's like, why why are we not mass murdering this 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 fucking boar, but we, we have Lambie over here? Best high graphic MMORPG 2020. Goats are tasty though? Mobile. Yeah, absolutely. But here's the thing. We're he's not using this for cooking food. He's using this for XP. That's way worse, okay? Way worse than anything else. Luna Saga. Go, Jerky. Luna Saga. This is one of the cutest MMORPGs in 2024. Finally. Actually a good take. Yeah, it's pretty adorable. You're absolutely right. Okay, I will agree with you for once in your lifetime that this is actually somewhat of a good-looking game. Now, let's go back to the elephant in the room. What do we have here, chat? We have VIP zero. We have buff times one. We have peace. We have gala mystery pack, pet tomorrow, and first top up. And guess what, chat? If you first top up, you get a mount. Oh, and hey, what's that? This at the top? Oh, this is your overall battle power. Let's count how many pay to win things there are in this game. Or just to let you know, it's- Oh, lucky Easter egg. There's your gacha system. Oh, party pack. Oh, there's also a gacha system. New sequel of Luna series, which we always play on PC before, but now the game has been released. On there's the there's the immersion breaking reindeer outfit with the with the fucking horse, man. Oh, look at that. How much did that cost you? A whopping sixty nine ninety nine, chat. And guess what? If you did it with your first top up, you get an extra free three thousand gems that it has the cost value of five dollars on mobile platforms i'm pretty sure this kind of game would still have a lot of marker players goals mostly from the pill bro this game is going to be filled with fucking bots you know it i know it we all know it pins will really enjoy the casual mmorpg like this the game was released in the united states with an english version got six thousand percent value yeah true for any players out of the us who can enjoy it through apk on google if on the ping connect oh Guess what, chat? It's oh so fucking region locked. Action is pretty stable and will make your gaming experience smooth. The gameplay is we will select between two races of. You know what? I respect the AOE farming. Okay. You know what? AOE farming going hard. Elf and human in a different jobs like warrior, mage, and rogue. You. The characters. Personally, I, I, I personally I think really you should meaty. leave the fucking but turtles alone. A variety but... of skin as well. In and how much you want to bet the mini golem? Is the free to play pet? I guarantee you, you get you get at least six things in the mail, and one of them is the free to play mini golem. Only doing yeah, two hundred seventy five k power and only doing one hundred eighty two damage. Talk about bloat. 
In combat, we can get Join for the 3k draws. Of various amount in exploring the Luna's world. The whole gameplay is fully in auto and also we can reach a higher... Okay. Okay, hold on a moment. You were literally just a little tiny character. Now you're the fucking Maiden Grim Reaper. Like, what what, what happened? What the, what the fuck happened? You just transform? A level in a flash. Best game new MMORPG for mobile 2024. All right. Crystal of Atlan. All right. Slay goats and reap their souls. Crystal of Atlan. This game should release faster in global version. Yo, let's go. Players have tried That's what we need. Great swords. I totally agree how amazing the game mechanism is. Honestly, the combat battle is truly magnificent. I will say yeah, one of the best action sure. game on mobile right now. Well, you said we rogue annoys me. Ah, it's, it's a language barrier. In an it's okay. Dynamic combat. Even on the ground, we can combine so looks like background from Gold with Friends did. 149.99 pack for that one. Really that makes yeah, I got set of five those edgy lovers. Yeah, true and real, dude. A higher damage amount by holding down the button and I mean, the enemy. I mean, you got to realize he's 273k power doing 366 damage just because he transformed Valdro. You've transformed. Sure, your eyes are fast enough to see the flash. Golf with friends and met the last game. Yeah, yeah, I know. Shortly to improve your hero strength in significant. While in combat, we will be supported by a NPC as our. See, see, chat. This is the exact reason why I decided to have a mascot as a pet ram, because literally every game in fucking existence always has, no matter what, a companion. Okay. Any successful thing whatsoever always has a companion. And that's the reason why Ramsey was born, for the sole reason of being a mascot. In combat, we will be Visual pollution is not good gameplay? Yeah, tell that to the, the people that play this game. All four of them. Players is when we visit the plaza and we Storm that is approaching, dude. The players since yeah, true. On the screen to make your experience Wait, what's COA? Wait, what? What's COA? I want the fetch. Bro, fat shame Ramsey, what the fuck? Totally not the buster sword? Yeah, it's totally not clone. Don't you want your GF as your companion to success? No. No. Cash on arrival. Uter, best new Remember RPG exact proportions right now? Games I mean, if, if, I, if I relate my girlfriend to a little tiny companion that is my mascot that has nothing other than to promote and create a sort of uh, reason to like my uh, content, uh, I probably would not want my GF to be that companion. Because cause Ramsey will never leave me. My stomach is fucking huge, dude. <laughs> I'm literally an anime character. True Microsoft Word paperclip best mascot. Actually true. Literally the same town as another one of Tencent's games we reviewed. Oh yeah, it actually is, dude. Oh! How much you want to bet that's uh that's uh that's a fucking this is the game that you need to uh register on that other website just to get in. 24 for mobile. I think Ramsey was Ma for that, dude. Mobile. Yeah, he was. Yo! Ma Binogi. This game is really underrated. Not many people notice if this game will be exist. Wait. Wait. Mabinogi Mobile? Unironically? Unironically. I might be excited for this. Even some players who are waiting for it have forgotten. The same as Blade X, which took more than three years making it happen globally. This game is probably developing right Bro, I fucking loved Mabinogi back in the day. If it, if it's if it's truly the predecessor, the the new the new one of the new Mabinogi dude. No, because the game's developer behind this project is Nexon, which he has created a lot. It's it, Nexon, even Nexon's making, this is the new Mabinogi jet. ...of MMORPG games on mobile. This is the only actual gameplay footage of Mabinogi. Look how pixelated this looks when you pause it. Well, yeah, that's because it's, because I paused it. World 6, Mabinogi World, all island sets and skills, Breath of Wild clone, let's go. ...mobile that is available right now. From this video, I will assume it has an anime art style MMORPG genre... Oh no shit, that's what Mabinogi was. Right ...together with a massive player. There are some classes that have sewn like mage with fire element, archer with her bow, warrior with single-handed sword and... Bro, this is the most AI description of what an RPG is. <laughs> archer with their bow... A mage with fire skills? What's next? 
a warrior with a sword and shield. Paladin with a sword and shield on his... Sorry. Paladin with a sword and shield. Maybe just use Void Changer and chat BT? Yeah, probably. This is not... I swear it's not pretty much. Hand. The gameplay is set in a medieval era at all. Best upcoming... Ha! Huh. An RPG set in a medieval era. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Reminds me of other RPGs, Chet. MMO RPG games for mobile 2024. Giga idea, bro. Granado as Oh yeah, sweet. I can't wait to get a bonus of a region locked fucking game. Spada mobile. Bonus Granado Espada Mobile. This game is What a fucking Chad. Holy shit, dude. This is this was the type of guy that your girl tells you not to worry about, Jet. All right, he's the guy you gotta be worried about. It's really good to be a bonus list on this video because. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what this? You know what this art style? Re you know what this art style reminds me of, though? Tree of Savior. This is this is actually reminds me of Tree of Savior. This game was originally played on PC and now they create a mobile version. Right oh, now, it's a mobile port. Does not represent the actual gameplay footage, but from the Play Store screenshot, we can totally see how the graphic enhancement and upgrade gameplay? into a higher quality visual, just like the mobile game right now. Bro, I like how I like how he's talking like it's a good game, but we haven't even seen the gameplay for it. It's like, bro, it's like we can't just show a trailer. Like, where the fuck's the gameplay? Taylor, yeah, yeah, probably, probably. Chance someone else knows Tree of Savior? Uh, yeah, dude. I mean, I, I feel like there's actually a couple of us that know Tree of Savior. Well, uh, there's actually quite a few of us that were Ragnarok controllers. Just to let you know, on PC version, Granado Espada has a classic MMO graphic, and also in the trial. Yes, chat, classic MMO graphic. But I don't know what the graphic is. Has five job selections. Are you the Grenado Espada player? Please. Oh, bro, way to engulf fire. About your experience on P oh, oh, you see that? Wait, wait, is this a scam? There ain't no way, bro. This is a hard scam, dog. Bro, how come that artwork looks completely different? What, what the fuck is this game called? What is this game called? Yeah, I bet you it looks nothing like the Granat. Okay, hold up. Let me let me type this. Gran NATO, like Shark NATO, Espada. Okay, thank you. All right. Just, just for all intents and purposes, just to be safe here, I want to, I want to make sure that uh, I'm not uh, looking into something that I want to. We're being safe here. Hi, Wally. Okay. All right. All right, that's fine. I think we're okay with this chip. So this, I don't know about you, but this looks nothing at all like the trailer. Not even fucking close. I think you spelled the title wrong. Granado Espada? Pretty, no, I think I spelled it right. If you're going to sus websites. Yeah, true, dude, true. I don't know about you, chat, but this this looks this looks does not look very good. Like that fucking graphics, bro. These graphics are fucking garbino. Let's let's show you something. What, what this game reminds me of? Oh, what's it? I used to play an old game like this. Was it was it Night Online? I think, or or it was it was either, it might have been Night or uh, Night or Arc Age. Night Online, maybe. No, it wasn't quite night. Yeah, night was a little worse. Oh yeah, I think I think it might have been Arc Age. Eilon Gaines and Pixel Thursday Pogsers. Then instead nah while I mean while I mean that's that's I mean there's a reason why I did that because I farmed chat interaction that way, just like I just farmed you, Wally. Get farmed, son. So I mean, yeah, I guess those were cool, I guess. All right, let's get back. Let's get back into Island, dude. 
Let's get this shit done so we can play some, play some, play some games. Granado Espada was a nice game. Yeah, I mean, it was okay, I guess. I actually enjoyed Granada Espada. Oh, so the, oh, so that was a thing, like, just, it was just many years ago. All right, bet. I did not realize. Oh, man, there's a green mushrooms map. Yikes. Lame ass, dude. Wally's the one person that actually reads the stream. Yeah, because he, because he's a legend, dude. Only, only legends read. All right. PC MMO has been out for several years. I'm not going to lie. I'm actually kind of excited if uh, Mabinagi has a new mobile port. I might actually play it. PC. Also, one of my guildmates, Greenstack Voodoo Fish. Greenstack Voodoo Fish. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I'm trying to think if that's fucking possible. Is that is that possible? It's a hundred. It's a hundred percent possible. Is it? Yeah. Okay. That's pretty. That's pretty impressive. That. You explain what is top right in World Two. What do you mean? What do you mean top right in World Two? You mean the map, Captain? And we got a new P.O. box with World 6. We'll probably get three new post office with World 6, my dude. No question in my mind. Hopefully we don't get another Marriott crate. Fuck the Marriott crate, bro. I don't want to do another one of those again. God, what a horrible, horrible grind that was. Current song name? I don't know, dude. Fucking Street Party by Tim Haywood. Besides Arcade. Oh, that's the weekly boss battle. It's where you have to do, uh, you have to click choices to get you, try to get five skulls. Is it just me, or is the shadow on my UI broken as shit? You guys see the UI right now? <laughs> is, the, is, the, is the action bar for this UI fucked? Look at the shadows. Look how, look how, <laughs> look how far gap they get to, bro. That's fucking... <laughs> I fucking love this game, dude. You know what? I love this game and all its fucking bugs. It gives it fucking character, dude. Because you just like look at it, you're just like fucking classic lava, dude. What a fucking classic lava move. <laughs> to fuck up something so simple as a UI. <laughs> uh, brings me joy. Uh, Griff, you remember me? Do you remember the real question is Squire? Do you remember me? I remember you. Lava did it just to fuck with you. Try to watch some ads, but and they wouldn't load. Oh, uh, what time are you following? April 29th, uh, 2022. Bro, that was... I mean, your name does look familiar, but I mean... That was a long time ago, bro. Re re refresh my memory. What did you do to make you self-rememberable? Because that's, that's asking for a lot. I said I loved you. That doesn't make you that 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 I'm gonna be honest with you. This does not make you rememberable at all. I, I the bro is more. I mean, pretty much all of chat says they've loved me either one way or another. He has to fight him off. Yeah, true, dude. Divine night time, baby. Well, I never said that. You would if you could. F you know love. Parasocial love quest failed, dude. Damn it. That was such a far run. I have to run all the way back. I never said that. Yes, you did. You're just coping. Everybody said it to me at least once. They're just coping. Told you. It's a love-hate relationship. I have and I hate you because you won't make more tier lists. I never said I wouldn't make more tier lists. I just said I'm not making tier lists right now. 
Claim spices. Yeah. Been waiting for years for an IBA. We'll never say it, dude. Well, it, you would have gotten in there faster if you didn't leave the Discord five in. This sounds like an L fucking ratio to me. I hop on my boobo. There's only hate there, no love going on, dude. No, there's, there's maybe, maybe a little bit. Depends. Have you made a tier list tier list? Of what? Tier list of all my tier lists? Well, it's easy S tier. My gem shop tier list is an S tier tier list, alright? You know it. I know it. We all know it. Still need to do yellow alchemy tier list? What the fuck are you talking about? We already did yellow bubble. All the tier lists for all the bubbles are done. What are you talking about? Literally every tier list. I've done so many tier lists, it's disgusting. I've done like six tier lists all right five tier lists yeah five tier lists today griffin has zero dread low and it shamed me it's okay sigil tier list you didn't do yellow yes i did skull fight for warrior uh you're gonna want to use divine knight griffin warframe stream when when i get a sponsor to do it we had to show proof of yellow it's already there bro i heard you do an end game bubble tier list too uh, if chat liked it enough, or if people liked it enough, not enough people liked my, uh, my bubble tier list anyways, to, uh, to have me do another one. Not a fuse. I think, I think they haven't, I think they haven't even broke 20k yet, to be honest. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure there's only one that's broke. I mean, not impossible. I mean, a lot of people get, uh, sponsorship opportunities from Warframe. Dude, watching you play Wayframe would be crazy you not know, being an MR30. Bro, imagine watching somebody getting paid to play Warframe and while you're busy there farming to yourself trying to farm MR30. All right. It's called passive income, bro. All right. Um, What do we need? What am I looking at? Oh, yeah. YouTube. Yeah, I think, I think last time I checked, I think I was like MR fucking... 16 or some shit. Yeah, I think it was somewhere around there. MR16. MR12 after playing eight years. Yeah, I mean, I'm definitely a filthy casual when it comes to that game for sure. All right, so the... Yeah, so we have... Let's see here. So the yellow bubble tier list is at 15... Purple is at 15, green is at 15, orange is at 22. Yeah, there's nowhere near. Nowhere near enough views for that. To me, to be thinking, because that was, you gotta realize those thumb, those, uh, those tier lists were a lot of work. A lot of fucking work to do. So it's just not worth the time. A level five card's worth it. Absolutely, every card is worth it. I rather I rather make just normal guides that'll give me like fucking way more views than doing a tier list. Personally. If you ever want to be flexing on hard and then get memed by Steve, he's MR twenty two with thirty nine minutes of playtime. I'm good. Is Forge XP worth it? No. Absolutely not. What is this crazy blasphemy talk? I mean, we get a guide for hourly clicks. Bro, there is a guide for hourly clicks, man. It's called a like, YouTube short. It's called a like, YouTube short, dog. I should probably do more, eh? Should do... I, re I really, when I said I was going to be a filthy casual on YouTube shorts, I was not lying. The fuck is an hourly clicks, dude? Well, maybe you should... Maybe you should fucking watch my shorts, bro. Maybe you should watch my shorts, Phantom. Maybe you'd know. Oh, they think you are as a bug. I think it's intentionally like that. If you think that these shadows slowly going off by 10 pixels a pop is intentional, you've obviously never made a video game. That is, that is, I have, I have done enough drop shadows and thumbnails for my fucking life to know that that is wrong. Drop shadows aren't out here like that, bro. That is intentionally fucked. Or not, that is not intentionally fucked up. I'm just here for you. I don't know. Until I start playing a game that you don't like. And then you're out of here. IT goatee world three grind short, please. IT goatee world three. I see nothing wrong here. Lav is another artistic level. 
you could almost say he's on the spectrum of art artistics. <laughs> only great quality shadows. Yeah, only great quality shadows here. Loads up league viewers, drops to three. Yeah, actually, dude. That's so true. It's so true. Let's load up league. Instantly drops to three viewers. I... No, no, not art. No, I say being artistic. Not not what your guys are thinking. Jesus. Am I trying... What am I trying to get canceled? I don't want to get canceled. Say, Barbarian, should I level up at shopping for extra levels despite not being specialized skills? Yeah, you want, you want to get all tools because those are just extra, extra uh, stat sticks. I'm more acoustic, dude. Artistic with a Western accent. Spam Fortnite for the Zoomer viewers. Fortnite, Fortnite, Fortnite. Start flossing, bro. So I'm taking a gr I'm taking a guess, Squire, that you've taken a long break from Eidolon. Because it's been it's been what pretty much pretty much two years. I have taken a long break. Yeah, I mean, if it's been over two years and you're and you're asking about uh, Barbarian. Let's me know you've been taking a big old break. Are you coming back for World Six? Hell yeah, man! Hell yeah, dude! Love to hear it. Trying to get through World Four right now. Oh, so you're trying to get elite classes? Sick. Games change a bit since World Four launch. Yeah, game. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> It's uh, it's actually an idle game now. Well, no, it's, it's sorry. It's actually an incremental AFK game now. I should say. The bonuses are disgusting. Power creep has been nuts. I I would say what the power creep was like, two thousand percent. I bet you the power creep isn't gonna be as big as World 5's power creep, because you gotta realize. World 4, average, like an end game bubble level was average of 140. Now it's like 5,000. All right. There ain't no way that World 6, not to mention, you also got stuff like Rift, which gave you a Clip Skulls, which is a damage multiplier. Not to mention the, the, the damage scaling of fucking uh, Quick Slap. Not to mention the Equinox matching Skims damage multiplier. Not to mention Elemental Sorcerer's damage multiplier. <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> there is it is going to be so hard to even like get a high, higher scaling than that dude all I need is world 6 and quality of life giga juicer buffs yeah true dude wait until you see boobo and ES dude yeah true man big time 100, 100 billion percent or 10 million times increase in damage. Yeah, exactly. If World 6 lets me lock slots and chests, I'll be happy. Yeah, true. Auto sort chests. Auto sort inventory when, please. That'd be nice. I'd be down for that. Tired of sorting my stuff. You look thirsty, Griff. Gonna redeem a hydrate. I don't look that thirsty. Do I look thirsty, champ? I mean, y'all look thirsty, but I don't know about me, bro. I swear there was something in that water. Oh, I almost spilled it myself. Okay, chat. Fuck, I'm hydrating. God damn it. Let me drink it fucking peace. Got my sweet tea. Mm, maybe that little sweet tea. Uh, you got to make a Minecraft drink noise. <laughs> what? <laughs> Excuse me. A Twitch stream is not a YouTube video. All right. You don't get no fucking Minecraft sound bite. <laughs> Next to you know is like in this video. I don't I don't know how some people do it, Chet. 
I don't know how some people make every stream like a YouTube like a YouTube video. It's fucking crazy to me. I don't know if you actually drank. If we didn't hear Minecraft music, I don't know. Fucking trust me, bro. Source, soundboard, not catering to the ASMR crowd. If they, if no, I already did cater to my ASMR crowd. It's called my speed run. Uh, excuse me. You want idle on ASMR? Just watch when I'm sleeping. <laughs> Listen to those sheepies. Hold our time. That's the ASMR. Griffy bit. I'm 70% the way through World 3. When do I start pushing single characters through the world to rush endgame, or should I just keep buying food and push everyone? Uh, I mean, you can push right away with one character if you want, Fish. Uh, just, you're, you want to get, you want to get everybody elite classes, though, before you continue with pushing World 4. You want, you want everybody elite class before you push World 5. I wish we uh we could get a skill where we grow a pet in town and make it bigger and bigger. I think it was DK daggering is so fun, but it keeps because it keeps getting bigger. I mean, yeah, that'd be kind of cool until it pops. Thank you very much. You're welcome, dude. Welcome on in, by the way. Griffy try to watch a Thai TikTok YouTube and nothing but bleep blop. Bro, that shit's so crazy, dude. It's always like the it's always like the minion laughing shit, and all of a sudden the uh, Bro, it's it's just it's literally sound bites every two seconds. It blows my fucking mind. I it, it fucking I hate it. I hate it so much, dude. I watch a lot of I watch a lot of the uh, the YouTuber August the Duck. I'm actually a big August the Duck enjoyer, and he covers a lot of those a lot of the the Thai YouTubers. And it's just how how fucking bad they are, man. I mean, the West have shit, but we aren't that bad. No, you know what we have instead. Here's the difference. Uh, like the like the Thai YouTubers or 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 the like the Korean YouTubers, they have a lot of like gifts and sound bites, and it's usually like minion laughs, ooh, stuff like that. What we do is we have two second scene changes. We we change scenes every two seconds, consistently. That that's that's how we do it, and it's just if if not if only it's I would consider it's more intrusive. I fucking, I can't stand watching a video and it changes every two seconds. Like if you're trying to get a point across, like every two seconds is, is fine if it's like only for a segment, but like you need to like put in some like five to 10 seconds of them just talking so it's not a constant scene change. You know, let people's brains catch up before you start dinging them with more shit. Because that's what it's for. It's like over overloading just like kids' brains, man. We also do the face zoom in and look for a camera for one second. No, so that's different, kitten. Uh that is a that is a um that is a technique used for when you uh are looking at a camera and you say something and and you have to stop and then get your script, remember that part of the script, then read it again. Instead of having that rough cut, you do that quick little zoom in to uh to make it look like it's a more smoother transition so that so the the this face super zoom is actually a uh actually a technique that i actually use quite a bit we'll soon unlock goat god put everyone but you have to do something like grinding during this time do you have something that i could be grinding for this time soon unlock goat god put everyone to wait um It'd be a good thing to work on. Start working on skilling. Get your skilling up. Does, does all your characters have uh, tools? Wait, what the fuck? How does that person have two ramps? Oh, okay. I was about to say, I'm like, how the... F Bro, that guy was in literally the perfect position for two rams. That was the coolest thing I've ever seen. Lord of the fucking rams, bro. But yeah, definitely get your skilling up to start getting tools up. While you're waiting for Goat Goat. Because that's something you can do actively. If you have candy. Or or pearls. But yeah, I, th I think... Uh, but I mean... And you know who's mostly responsible for all those... Uh, all those crazy fucking two seconds and all that. All that like basically trying to overload people's minds. It's Minecrafters. Minecrafters are the fucking worst for it. They're so bad, dude. 
That's why I could never be a Minecraft uh, content creator. I, I hate the editing. I can't stand the fucking editing. Yeah, so start off with getting all iron tools. And then once you get all iron tools for all your characters, you can move up to like gold and shit. Or go as far as you want to go. Because all they're used is for stat sticks, right? More stats. And it's and, and once you get to that level two, it's better for it's that'll be much easier to farm cards. Because the higher tools you have when you actually get into card farming, you don't really need efficiency, you need drop rate. And don't forget to use your pearls. Yeah, absolutely. Because there'll be more drop rate and AFK gains rather than efficiency, so they are they're great to help you card farm. What do you prefer to upgrade stones? Uh, as high as you can get. If I'm pushing, if I'm pushing, say like if I'm pushing to world five, um, I prefer world three stones over world four. But I mean, well, at the same time, I still prefer the best of the best, but that was only for my Iron Man. For, for pushing just normal, what I like to do to make my life easier when pushing through the worlds is I like to say, for instance, if I'm trying to push my Divine Knight, I will, I will, and I, he gets a new piece of, he gets new gear. I will put all the upgrade stones on my wizard. So then the upgrade stones prioritize wisdom. So then when I put them onto my, onto my warrior, he gets accuracy instead of damage. Because accuracy is more important when you're at that point in time because you don't have enough accuracy to kill everything, so you're getting a lot more accuracy from your substat over damage from your strength stat. Yeah, no problem, dude. What's the over under on drop chance versus card drop chance? Well, the nice thing is, is it doesn't really matter because you can snap them. You can snap card drop chance. So you can you can times yourself you can get like three times cards. I'll show you after this. I'll show you how to I'll show you how to snap card drop chance. It's super super bonkers. Well, it's not like super bonkers, but it gives you a lot more cards. And your best card farmer is elemental sorcerer, by the, by the way. Because the amount of drop chance that he gets from his uh, portal mobs, because his, the portal mobs count as the base mobs, so those drop cards. So you're getting a fuck ton of cards in a very small amount of time. Bow, 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 do, do. Didn't know that? Yeah, big brain. That's why I'm here. You know what I'm. You know what. You know what I'm mentally preparing for answering same questions over and over again for the next three months when world six releases that's what i'm preparing for my mental prep is gonna go fucking birded it's a perfect slow down bad after finishing world four cards yeah i mean that's that's normal for the common ones yeah we have 826 checkouts chat we only need about 400 more and then and then we could technically have enough book checkouts to max out the our 11th character as soon as it releases it's pretty good man that's pretty pretty good we have a lot of checkouts oh <sighs> Clips for commands for World 6. Hey, fish, just type new skill and leave me alone, dude. <laughs> and use 375. Just forgot. Yikes. All right, so let's uh, let's show you, okay? So, for instance, obviously, if you're actively farming, the best place to card farm is with your elemental, sor your elemental sorcerer uh, because of the portal kills, right? So what you do, okay, is you have two sets. So you see how I have my drop rate set, okay? Obviously, you want to build full drop rate. So you have your top left set, your bottom right to get the to get the the drop rate multiplier, correct? And then you want to have another set that is specifically for cards. Okay, so it's going to look something like this. Uh, where is it? So our stash. We can put Giga Frogs there. Uh, we can put the 
card. Do, 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 do. Where's the other card drop chance? Retley. There's another one. And then you can just throw whatever the fuck you want on here. Re the rest the rest of it doesn't really matter. Thank you, brother. Uh bro. Lavo is here today, okay? And then we have Snellby at the bottom. Well, well, you want Snellby at the bottom right for the doubler, right? That's why that's why I put in random shit, right? So now these two get doubled. Make sense? So now you have two sets. You have a drop rate set and you have a card drop set, okay? So let's go to somewhere, say... Say you wanna wanna farm... Well, I don't know. Um, let's, let's do a test here. Let's do... Somebody that doesn't have a shit ton of cards. Let's do... Sure, let's do frogs. Let's do frogs just for the hell of it. 28390, okay? 23890. Let's go to here. Let's go to frogs. So now I have these on, right? So I just do my normal farming, right? And these frogs will stop start dropping cards. Obviously, there's our first card there. It's going to keep on going even higher and higher. And then there's another card. And then this is how you farm normally on your on your elemental sorcerer. But this is only with card drop chance. So I'm actually running 18.28. But you can actually snapshot card drop chance. So you can see that I'm starting to get a fuck ton of cards now. Okay. That's because I have a lot of card drop chance. So what you do is there's two ways you can do this. Everything's preloaded, okay? So when you go into a map, it's going to preload everything before it adds on new stuff. So, for instance, if we have a card drop chance before we enter the map, it has now officially preloaded that I have card drop chance. This can snap. So then I can go over to my drop rate build, and, and, my, and my card drop chance is already snapped. So I get that on top of all my drop rate, which is an extra three times drop rate. So now what I can do is when I wait wait 40 seconds, obviously, is I can farm more cards because drop drop chance actually affects card drop chance as well. So so now we have two bonuses applying to it, which is card drop chance and, and drop chance. HP, MP, and card drop chance are the only stats that are able to be snapshotted. Everything else can't be snapshotted. Mob respawn used to be snapshotted, but you can't anymore. You can do it, but you only have about a two second window to actually do the said snapshot. But everything else is basically not snapshotable at that point in time. So once this uh, teleport finishes up, we're going to press auto here. We're going to let this roll off. And literally within the first second, I got another card. Look how much more cards I'm instantly getting. Look at that. Just just, just simply just the sole fact if I did that snap and gave myself another three times drop rate, I'm already getting way more cards than I was originally. So, oh, and, and you got to realize this is, this is only within like a 30 second time variable, okay? If you do this for like three hours or two hours on what you're farming, comparing the difference between the two, it is, it is approximately you get three times the amount of cards that you would if you didn't snap cards. I will be showing this in my next video. Because, because since, I'm, since I'm going to be releasing a drop rate video, my next is going to be a card farming video. And I'm going to show how to specifically do this. So that, that's, uh, that, that, that's coming up. Uh, Elemental Sorcerer is a World 4 card, uh, World 4 subclass, yes, correct. But you can just see the amount of extra cards I got. So just remember, for next time, okay? If you're going into a map, you can also just do this by going to the gem shop, okay? This is also possible. You can, you can basically just gem shop this and the exact same as loading into a new world. Or even changing server counts as well. As long as they're, in lo as long as you initiate the load screen. So if I want to go farm cards at G Mushrooms, I just make sure that I have this preset. Okay, I got my card drop chance preset. 
I go into the next map, and then all I do is swap. And now I'm good. Now I'm good, but as soon as I leave that map, I have to redo it. Because it's all about the preload. And then that's 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 how you get three times more cards. That's that's what I had to do in order to get all of these fuckers to five star. I I literally pre-snapped every single resource. This oh, by the way, this also works for resources as well. BT dubs. So for instance, here let's 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 actually this is a perfect way to do a test here. Uh, let's do let's do this. Let's see if let's see if this works. Okay, I'll take a I'll take a two hour time candy. Okay. I'll take a two-hour candy and I won't snap. Let's see how many cards I get. I don't know if AFK really changes it, to be honest. Snap this. I will get 153 cards without a snap. Okay? 153 cards without snap. Okay. Now let's go back in. Let's swap to drop rate. Two hours. 183. This is much more of a different variable uh, when you're when you're doing this with uh, with active. Active and AFK are different. It's been like that for this game for practically everything. No matter what you do, active and AFK will always have different outputs. But it's it's about three times if you're actively farming. That's why it's so important to actively farm cards on ES. Because if you if you how did you discover this? Uh, I didn't discover this. This is uh, this is this is the whole benefit of having a giant community, right? Is because people people theory craft and figure this shit out and like people you know. But this this was not discovered by me. Now the reason why this is a thing, why snapshotting is a thing, chat, is because it's already a, it's already a legit mechanic in the game. And you know what legit mechanic that is? Trapping, because what does trapping do? Trapping takes your character setup of all your efficiencies to place a trap. And then once you collect the trap, having stats doesn't matter because it snapshotted what you had as stats for when you placed it. So snapshotting is already a mechanic in said game. So it just it just so happens that it works for other things. It's maybe not be 100% intentional, but at the same time, it's not like it... it uh, lava cares enough to fix it so we use it as a fair game mechanic because it's been around for quite a long time so that's uh that's uh and then and then there and then when you do 3d prints there's a thing called an mp snap and an hp snap which gives you anywhere from like two percent to twenty percent increase on your 3d prints but i mean that's uh that's that's a whole nother ball game and that that just confuses people. It's much easier to tr to teach somebody be like, "Hey, if you want more cards, do this. Go here, then do this, and you're done." And be like, "Pasha," instead of telling them how to do the fucking snapshot because the snapshot is way different because it's gear, it's star signs, it's fucking this, it's fucking that. Like, there's multiple things that you have to snap. So it's basically the easiest snap in the game. Love the oh yeah girthy bit yeah thanks Todd. Is the Maestro worth active farming, or should I just use Divine Knight or Elemental Sorcerer? Uh, so Maestro is good for crystal farming, like early game crystal farming, uh, until until your Divine Knight gets enough uh, ch uh, crystal chance. But other than that, he's he's basically your boss farmer. That's 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 why you use Maestro because Maestro it uses the power of Gimme Gimme, which basically to to put it in perspective, uh, Gimme Gimme is uh fake drop rate same as the divine orb okay so if you have so the reason why he's so good at boss farming okay is say for instance you have a 67 percent chance to drop two times loot that doesn't mean you get two times drop rate that means you have a 67 percent chance for one boss to equal two kills okay so say if you're farming say say if you proc this every single time and you kill 100 bosses you would actually get the equivalent of loot of 200 bosses because of the sole fact of it, it just counts as an extra kill. That's why Maestro is so strong. Is because you get double the boss time in half. You get more boss loot in half the time. And that's why mini bosses are best done with uh, Divine Knight. Because Divine Knight, if you can get to up to like 400 orb, that means each kill is actually five kills. 
because it's the same thing as the the fake drop rate. You don't have chocolate chip? Is still worth cross farming with them? Yeah, yeah. I mean, if you don't have chocolate chip, it's still fine. You still should chalk. You should still farm. What the fuck do you have? Two ninety eight talents. Well, there's things like um, rift slug, which is an extra twenty five on top of that. Uh, you also have elemental sorcerer, which is also another like thirteen. I remember I didn't know about crystals until the end of World Three back in the day, dude. Yeah, but 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 back in the day as well, though it was so hard for us to summon crystals. Because crystals were like one in like 200 to summon back in the day. Because boring bricks were almost impossible to craft for the stamp. Not to mention our shrines were super low level. Imagine not having chocolate chips two weeks after it was in the shop. I mean, that's fine. That's understandable. But yeah, so that that's 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 just that's just some more uh some more food for thought, chat. So if I hope I hope that answered your questions. Another chocolate chip coming to rotation. February, if you can get the material saved up. Yeah, true. Um, I believe there's Shimmer Island that we have to take care of as well. I don't have cheese for Chaco. Do everything in your power to farm cheese, bro. Oh, by the way, did my eagle eye... I don't think I checked construction today, did I? Sure did not, dude. Surely did not check my construction. Cool. So you could snap drop rate and then swap to damage cards? No, only card drop chance. Not not normal drop chance. Only cards. That would be that'd be overpowered if it did. Yeah, so you can snap cards and then swap to drop chance. You can't use drop chance and swap to swaps the damage because that'd be OP as fuck because then everything would be a snap right you would literally snap every time you turn on the game and that'd just be too confusing you know the, I, I see I see snapping as like the same as like prayer flicking in runescape right it's not necessarily an intended mechanic but it, it's a mechanic that uh, that will reward people for doing a little bit extra but it's not like it's the d definitive difference whether you can play the game or not you know what I mean it's not it's not like the V Man thing that you can do where you can where you can just like log into another character, save V Man timer, and then log back in until you have your have your uh, void radius back up. I don't I don't agree with that one. But I but I but I have no I, I'm totally okay with the card snap. Can you snap card drop when you switch to like mining and farm that? Yes. All card snaps can be done. And that's with resources and, and combat. Wish me luck and good night. Yeah, good night, dude. Yo, Volps Von Fox, thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome on in. Um, didn't he fix the V-Man thing? Not to my knowledge, no. Didn't the V-Man stuff get fixed right away after the Reddit thread? Did it? I'm I'm unaware. I don't know. I don't know if it got shadow fixed or not. I never I never used it, so I never know. I I chose I chose not to use it just to stay safe. I didn't I didn't want to take the potential risk. If, if you ever feel like there's a risk to what you're doing, it's probably not worth it. What's my shinies at? Uh, we're working on quenchies right now. We're 3.93k, 4.1. What's your PR portals on V-Man? 60. I could probably get it higher, but I'm going to wait until World 6 buffs happen before I start pushing more. But yes, I will. I will eventually uh, push that. Oh, oh, that's right. Uh, I was doing. I was doing shimmer. What do I need for shimmer? Catching efficiency. I need catching efficiency. Okay. Ooh, times two. I crank. Too bad I have literally both the things I need for here, bro. I got. I gotta stop doing my fucking rando islands. On fuck on my fucking Beastmaster, dude. I always make this mistake, dude. Lavican artifact rolls again is something like that. Yeah, exactly, dude. Yo, what's up, Aries, dude?
he uh, he also needs to eventually fix this bug. This is a pretty bad bug, where archers can't really attack properly on the on the meteors, logs or whatever for the troll boots. Hell yeah, dude. And what did I get? A whole lot of nothing. Huge. Huge. I love getting nothing. Just missing boots, hell yeah. Royal Worm Quest 2. The Royal Worm Quest? Bad boss is straight up untargable for auto attacks. Oh yeah, if it's if it's on a rope or something, yeah. Oh yeah, what what do we have for the Royal Worm Quest? TD one. Oh yeah, we can skip Maestro too. I got two. What do I have on ES? ES need two or need four? Sounds good, boy. Have a good one. Yeah, I need I need one more. Okay. Yeah, we won't fuck with that just yet. Uh, I need catching efficiency. So let's swap over to our siege breaker. Gotta get our shimmer, dude. Oh, uh, let's see here. He needs... I don't know, maybe we'll do... Four hundred seems fine with me. Hundred percent, hundred on that. Ooh. Twenty point four. Yeah, that should seem good for now. I need more star talents, man. I don't have enough star talents. Where's my efficiency? Efficiency build? There it is. Boom, boom, but What am I at at skilling? I'm at... Oh, that's really... Why is that fucking so low, dude? Oh, right, because I got... Okay, never mind. I, it's because I have the prayer. So let's take this prayer off. Let's throw this prayer on. What are we looking at now? Skills. We are looking at a... 426 billion. 426 billion. It's pretty good. Uh, are you going to sample before World 6? No. No, definitely not. I'm just going to let... I think I think I can't hit a trill, unfortunately. So need the Star Town, so don't we all, dude? Yeah, true. I don't think I'm going to get any higher than this. Coney. Thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome on in. And Gabriel did. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Bay Army. What we all need are plunderous kills. Ain't that the fucking truth, bro? Catch efficiency, number of digits as you can. I don't think we can get up to another digit, unfortunately. Pretty sure we can't. Close, though, but I don't think we can. I mean, gold watches and storage, like none. Is the auto skiller in here? No, I think it's on my Beastmaster. One tab into star, star skill points? Yeah, I did. Still not enough. Hey, I'm new to the game and watch your speedrun vids. Thanks for a lot. Helping me so much. Hell yeah, dude. Welcome on in, bro. Welcome on in, dog. I think we're fine with this. I'm cool accepting 12. 12 school. That still means plus one skill efficiency. 46%. Look at that. Woo. 46% chat. <sighs> all skill. I'm just going straight skill efficiency. Nothing else, dude. Nothing else at all. More skill efficiency, the better. This is gonna this is gonna get to like a hundred percent eventually. And then it's just going to be so much extra skilling for no reason. 
I think total damage percent's pointless at this point. <laughs> if it's not free, it's not worth, is at least how I'm saying it, because I can build more from Quick Slap. Good, good stuff, man. Good stuff. All right. Now that we got that done, we need to go here, throw him back. I don't need to sweep any of his, switch any of his stuff out. And we need to go here. Put that in. And I think we're looking at uh, Shkukum. Oh, yeah. I should probably throw that back on here. Nice. Huge. All right. So let's go over the things. The start of snow where you're at, dude. Hey, man, that's the way we like it, bro. Don't we like snow? All right. So. That's all good. So let's see here. We've done. Oh, wait. You know, I, you know what I think we're missing? I think we're missing one thing here, chat. We're missing our free doot. There it is, chat. Our free doot. Snow sucks after two seconds. We got snow, and then it rained, and then it turned into slush. And then it was just ugly. Ugly, ugly, ugly. Crystal custard or higher. Here we go, chat. Two minutes on the clock. In a country we don't have snow. I was going to take a picture for you guys for snow. I want I want to take a big old picture for you guys to see what snow looks like. And then, uh, yeah, by the time I got outside, it was gone. It was terrible. Not a good time. Not a good a time. Terrible, if you will. Da, 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 da. You know what I'm excited for, though? I'm excited to do more uh, patch note recaps. You know how long it's been since we've had an update chat? I haven't been able to do patch note recaps. I mean, to be fair, the last couple of patch note recaps, I just decided to do a quick guide. But I mean, even still, man. Even still. My six bean in a row this week, dude. Bro, I'm going to probably get beamed. Let's be honest here. I got beamed last week. Must be in East Coast because I had the same weather as you. No, I'm West Coast. No, I live in that West Coast, dude. West side. Somehow, a slime is just as rare as a foot for me, dude. Hey, there's Retley. Rare as a dude? You click and craft 10 million peanuts for me? Sure. How much is it for me? What's in it for me, dog? Here we go. Bada bing, bada boom. No bean. No, what's up, Tarden? You know what? It's been a while since I got a multi chat. It's been a hot fucking minute since I got a multi. You know what? I'm gonna buy one for the lol. See if I get beamed. Beans black this morning was deleted my account. Damn, dude. Even worse, I got sheepied. Even fucking worse. I got fucking sheepy, bro. Got three beans back to back. Almost deleted my account, dude. That'd be aggravating. How much How much would I be getting? 150, 150, 450. I mean, I'd rather just give these away. Through chat 2000 to erase dude. I should do it. I should erase dude. I'll buy a dude right now. 
Your luck sucks? I mean, my luck's pretty good. My luck's pretty insane. Got dude on my last T3 treat. No green gems bought. That's pretty good, man. Dude it. Grifty, is there any way to get F Forg companion after getting tier 5 treat? Sold my last one. Nope. Take my bank card. Selling like dude is big brain move, dude. Uh, no, it's not. That's how, you, that's how you get your account fucking banned because it's called RMT. <laughs> hey, you know what's a good idea? RMT. Oh, what a great fucking fucking idea that is. Fucking Jesus. Only noobs use dude. Only noobs use dude. Oh, wait. No, you're talking about me selling my dude for 2,000 gems. Never mind. RMT. Real money trading. Real money trading. Is what I thought he was saying. But I was just being dumb. Don't worry about me. I'm just a big fucking idiot. Because I literally just did something. Sorry. Please forgive me. I like licking walls. It's my favorite pastime. Reset my TV. I'll send you some in-game currency for dude. Yeah, sounds good, Bill. Sounds good. I got you. Easy peasy. I can't wait to have all Dreadlow boats again, chat. You are forgiven. G the Gamba. Oh yeah, we got it, right, chat? Yeah, we got it, right? Yeah, yeah, we totally did, dude. We totally did. You know what's crazy? On both the Gambas, we didn't get it. It's fucking Garbo. What a Garbo game. This game's made for babies. Actually, I would be genuinely impressed if a baby could understand the concept of Eidolon. Fuck, even middle-aged men have a problem understanding the concept of Eidolon, let alone. Fuck, even middle-aged individuals. Just everybody in general can barely understand the fuck's going on in Eidolon. Hell, I don't even think Eidolon understands what it's going on about, dude. You have all achievements? I'm missing two, I believe. Oh, I'm missing three. I'm missing... These two. And this one. I'm at, I need 50 more and I have this achievement. I don't know what luck god I sucked up. I had three artifacts yesterday. Probably Lila. Oh, it was more likely lava. Game with the Guac Guac 3000, dude. That's how you fucking got it, bro. There's no possible other way. <laughs> That's so corrupt. All right. Play Pong. No, I'm f we're fucking done. We're playing some Pixel Thursday, Chet. The fuck? It's Pixel Thursday time, bro. We'll test the theory. Walk, walk 3000, dude. Well, not walk, walk. Test that theory. I'll marry, have a child, or make it play out alone, and get some milk, tell you the results, dude. Yeah, I mean, I, I, that's what I would do, honestly. And Dot Age has overwhelmingly positive reviews. Is a shovel gaming, uh, shovel and gaming tied? Like, does the nugget get bigger the longer you leave the shovel alone? No. You just get more, you just get more, uh, nuggets. One sec, chat. I gotta buy a game. You know, playing these Pixel Thursdays are expensive, chat. It's like 30 bucks. This game better be fucking worth it. It's 265 megabytes, bro. It's less than a less than a fucking mobile game. The only reason I'm about to have another baby is to have another resampler. That's the big brain play. That's the that's the real true play time. So yeah, what's the Steam input? The native Steam input translates physical. Okay. Bro, I don't fucking care. Let me play. Okay. Sure. <laughs> if you want Bubby to love you, don't fucking forget to snap HP when you resample. You're grounded, dude. Oh my god, bro. That's 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 fuck. That's that's the big brain play. All right, so if you guys don't know what's happening, we do a uh, Pixel Thursday chat where we try out a game, see if we like it. If we like it, we continue to play it. So, I mean, right now we're playing a thing called Dot Age. Actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold off to make sure that this isn't just fucking blaring in my ears. 
So basically what Dodd Age is, is it's a city builder roguelike where basically catastrophes happen consistently. One fucking catastrophe after another. This has overwhelmingly positive. Overwhelmingly positive. We're going to take a look here. It is very good. So let's make sure that I'm just going to mute that for a sec. Let's go to this screen here. Let's go to games. Let's add dot age, add executable. Okay. Actual screen. About 90 are lightly gated. That's okay, dude. Let's pause this bad boy. All right. Dot age, chat. It's actually not too loud. I'm actually surprised. All right. Let's take a look here. This one's looking pretty good, dude. All right, so choose your elder. We have Mattis. Let me tell you the stories of how our very own village was born. I was so young back then. This is a tale of curse that we were destined to face and somehow we overcame it through cooperation. Terrain is the valley. He's grumpy, so short temp, okay. Short temper, known signpost, known forager. Starting resources, 16 wood, 20 berries. Normal, a survival experience suited for most players. Difficulty multiplier. What is this? Harder. Events are relentless. Prepare to die. Difficulty multiplier 200%. Suggested for... Okay, well, let's try. Let's try. Let's try normal, chat. Let's... Let, let, let's... Let's... Let's see. Let's see how we can... Let's see how we go. Probably... You could probably... No, we're gonna play fucking normal. No, no, no. Easy mode is easy mode. Okay? Normal mode is fucking normal mode. Dot H is a long and merciless game. By choosing the normal difficulty, you acknowledge the risk of losing multiple ties unless you're experienced with strategy games. Are you are you sure you want to play this difficulty? Man, you 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 know that this game is hard when they have a disclo disclaimer for fucking normal. Okay, this is gonna be like the Dark Souls of fucking roguelikes, bro. Sure, let's do it. Let me tell you a story. It begins before any time you were born. Okay. We had been traveling for days in strange lands. This is the story of how our village was born. The story of how we defeated the prophecy. All right, I'm ready. It all began in lush, secluded valley that we found after several days of traveling. Ooh. A few more steps, the slackers were almost there. My feet hurt. All right, dude. Hey, look, there's us. Was last week's game? I missed it. Nova Lands. Is this Cloud Meadows? Yes. I was so young that I convinced some pips to follow me into the valley. Well, well, they're convincing. Though. This is it. This is the place I told you about. We have to stop here. You better not be lying about this new life, Elder. Impertinent! Follow my example and it'll be well to get to work. Shall I work straight away in construction or a village? Okay. All right. So it looks like everything's in the bottom. So what do we need to do here? You better pay attention because it's not going to repeat it twice. Well, actually, you should have to repeat it twice. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take... I have to do this for every game. Boom, boom. Take this chat. Put that chat up here. Okay. We got that there. Text. And we go down to uh, uh, game, which is this one. We go here and we put this up here. Sounds like a cult. I think this is just basically a cult game. All right, there we go. And then it is, and we will go, wait, wait, we're not done yet. Almost done. And then we have to do, well, I mean, I guess we'll just fucking hide this shit here. Left side banner. Boom, there it goes. All right, there we go, chat. Better pay attention because I'm not going to repeat this twice. You can always click the button, skip tutorial. All right. Village was secluded far away valley. Use was pan the edges of the screen and hold right click to move the view to zoom in. A village elder new village. Let me tell you why I did not make to thrive. Ooh, 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 ooh. 
It was our first structure to find the boundaries of a village where it could be safely built, place on any available terrain. Near Barry. Okay, so I think we should go probably near Barry. I would say probably go near the water, eh? Or maybe near. Oh, I mean, there's two berry bushes right here, so I think we cook right here. We pips used to live in dwelling like this one. Hover the dwells and see what see what's full of pips. Okay, there's four people in one hut. That's a little that's a little dirty. My father villagers used to play and tell them what to do every day. Hmm. I remember the first time I said a pip to get food. Assigned a pip to a building and structure to plant to activate it. Okay. Okay. Pips follow wise advice without questions. Pips are not work. Okay, so it's it's a, it's a base builder. Produce resources daily. Hover over the building and see what produces the top right corner. We found some bushes full of berries. Have limited uses. Number of top left shows how many uses are left. Collect resources. Produce each day. Common of the pool in the village. Each pip ate a piece of food every day. Available is automatically allocated. Make sure earned pip was assigned to the daily. Okay, so we just have to... How many are aisle? Reminds me of a castle story. Also recorded the current day and season. Okay. Once it's satisfied with the daily task, we get right to work. Press the turn key by clicking on the sun. I don't fucking want to, though. Okay, so then I get my berries, and then we lose said berries. Because they have to eat. Okay, that makes sense. Ah, yes. Sleeping. Of course. It's like 40 days per season. Okay. Hold on, there was more. I remember it now. My memories! My old age, a little forgetful, will tell you a story. Okay, I mean, cool. D d memories retrieved! Build! Yay! Okay, I can build. Services? What the fuck is this? Knowledge? What is... Thinker's post. A thinker's post. Each structure has a different cost to build. This one took a day if you would... Oh, it's science? Science! Bro, what am I playing, Dr. Stone? Okay, so thinker post is two wood plus a day. Building pips, knowledge produces one knowledge in a day. Okay. Those have special requirements. Post could be immediately next to another building. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. There we go. Pick one day to build. See how many turns are left. Made a decision. I've collected my wisdom. Access it here. Okay, my agepedia went at question mark. Oh my god, this is so much fucking reading, dude. Take a look at the village and go back and start building. Okay, so now we got the berry shrubs, forager, wood pile, cabin, biovac, biv bivouac, biv thinker's post, and sign post. So the piss poor sense of direction, they can get lost over a few steps. Oh my fucking god, I have to have sign post before they don't get lost, dude. I could have a wild full resources. Okay, I'm sure we'll figure out as that goes. Okay, so we ready? All right, so let's start off with uh, this guy. There's four pips. Okay, what is everybody doing? Three pips available for work. So, yep, so okay, so you're gonna get some more berries. Berries, berries. I like how the little old man yells at people to get to work. Uh, let's wait, let's. Okay. There we go. So he's gonna he's gonna get to work, and that's gonna take a day. Oh, well, this place is kind of big. All right. So then, food. We can make a forager, which requires wood terrain, raw. Can we get a lumber mill happening? We'll put a lumber mill right here, and then we're gonna actually gonna take one guy off the berry. We're gonna throw him on the wood pile here. So now we got, so we got somebody working on the wood pile, somebody working on the thinker's post, and we have people collecting berries, so we get plus eight berries, so that'll be 28 minus four, so we'll be at 24 near the end of the day. Sound pretty good? All right, next. Let's do next. Nice. And now we have that stuff, so now we can start collecting wood. Pretty good. Now, let me guess. Disaster happens. Research, huge. Pips of lands with a little knowledge, okay. Some pips are focused on harvesting knowledge we can use to discover new buildings. Huge. Activate the research button to see what you can do. Oh my god, dude. This is this is actually crazy. Then activate it. Okay. 
Discover a new building, gain access, more brilliant ideas. Can't remember them now. Different ideas, sure they come later. New research is okay. So we can't do that right yet, but we can during two water during event. Okay, so we're gonna need water. Okay, so we can't get that yet. Okay, can we build that now? Tasks, okay. Building, raw, can we, food. Okay, so we're learning how to. So I would need four fucking, we need four people. To get to to get enough knowledge for in order to learn that, so that'll take us four days. Okay, so that's a cabin. Road holds two commoners. Well, I don't think we really need that just yet. Thinker's post, signpost. There ain't no way people. Are, so this guy's thinking. This guy's harvesting. Let's get this ship building. We might need a forager here to get some more food supply happening. Uh, so let's take. Uh, Barry, get him building that. Okay, we need more people now. So there's some full there. So we can't fence those yard out yet. Okay, well, that seems fine. All right, next. There we go. Let's see what we got here. So now, now that we got the, now we got that going, I bet you anything, this is gonna start getting real bad really fast. So Billy's could take in different inputs to produce different resources well. Okay, so we can rotate. Okay, cool. Sounds good. So now we can start getting hemp, and we can start getting seeds. Even better. Alright. So how do I get more people? Wait, how the- wait, why didn't I fucking get any research? Is there- is there just one person? Okay, get that. Nothing can be produced? What the- what do you mean? What the- what the fuck? I thought I got the well. Uh, hello? Some pips have found the way to collect water, drink from the sea, won't talk about them. Oh, you build... Oh, you build next to the thinking post. You get minus one research per turn. Oh, what? Wait, do I need to be by water? No, I don't think so. So I need to, in the building description, every adjacent minus one. Oh, it's because I put the forager there, right? So since I put the forager there, I get minus one. Oh, fuck. So I'm gonna have to bomb this shit. I'm gonna have to demolish it, I'm gonna have to build it somewhere over here. Uh, every playthrough will change, yeah, okay, okay. And this tells you my action log here. Build thinker's pose, blah 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 blah, okay, okay, okay. Oh shit, somebody's idling. Uh, you go back to foraging. All right. So we should get like hemp and stuff. Yeah, we got some hemp. Nice. We blew that shit up. Cool. So now we need to put the thinker's post the fuck the way over here. And that will give us that will give us lots of good stuff here. Okay, build thinker's post. There it is. So that should give us. A good amount. So we have... So we're losing two wood. We're getting our wood good. Now if we take... That guy... Nope, that doesn't matter. So we just need to basically keep on going until we have enough... Until disaster fucking strikes here. Remember, oh, right, it's fucking signposts. Okay, we gotta start building more signposts. Okay, uh, signposts. That extends our range here. Okay, so we're gonna take this guy off wood, this guy, boom. And then boom. 
And then we have this guy thinking, okay, so he's getting plus one now. Perfect. All right, that makes more sense. Okay, bring on the catastrophe. I'm ready. Okay, so now we can get the birds. I feel like we should probably just keep on extending, I would assume, then. What, what do these mean? Busy pips? Pips that cannot work? Oh god, pips can get damaged? Even better, dude. Love that. So good. Put that there. Just gonna extend this shit, dude. There we go. Boom. Done. Next day. I think we'll extend those two for now, and then uh, we're going to start getting uh, back onto the wood grinding. We need more pips. That's what we really need. Okay, so he's got the signpost. Now we can go get this stuff. Uh, I guess we can't do anything with it just quite yet. So forager. We need leather for that. Let's build a house. Let's build, let's build, let's build a house. That will take two days. So we got one guy there. We got one guy there. One guy can be farming there. And we need two two more days and we can get a well. Man, it, my, my guys are probably pretty fucking thirsty at this point, to be honest. They're probably pretty, pretty messed up. Feels like this game might be a little bit of a slow burner. Okay, that's nice. All right. Next day, that'll be done. Same with that. Does that give me... So that means I get two more, but that means I also need to be another person on catching, getting berries. Can't do anything with the full just quite yet. So we still have another day on that while that guy's still gathering wood. Okay, cool. Increase animation time and enter turn once you know what people are doing. Oh, okay. Oh, so it can be quicker. All right, word. All right, now we got the well. The well is officially procreation. Power of love. Dwelling has enough to empty space. Pips can make babies. You want your village to thrive? Okay, so we need houses for 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 banging. Some terrains have special properties. Affect the buildings. Take advantage of the terrain on top of it. Output will increase. All right. Told me fill the pips to bird the bees talk. Quite simple. All you need is a happy couple and some food. And two free pips will do. Need at least two free pips to for this to work. Free some pips. Okay. Alright, so I need two pips to bang. Make some love! We'll spend the next day making the baby. Nice. Smash. Fucking smash. Okay, so that's gonna be- we're gonna be losing one berry. So now this is done though. So now we have a well officially. We can- Tomato field, pog, tomatoes, tilt soil, herb picker, medicinal herb. Nice. Okay, so... We are going to go with gain resources, no gain crops. I think we're going to go with maybe hunting, hunting tent, raw white meat. Ooh. Chicken den. Chicken den is what we want. Or that's a hunting tent. No, we want chicken pen. Holds three chickens. Tracks wild events, though. We're gonna need a we're, If we're gonna do that, we need a hunting. So once we have that, okay. So we got that going. We got okay. We're ready. Make a baby. They're they're smashing. Now, is it instantly a bigger pip? 
No, no, so I can't, in so can I put the child to work? I'm allowed to put the child instantly to work, right? Five days, but that's fucking bullshit. Should be five days to grow. The fuck is this? The apocalyptic vision. I remember it vividly. Right. Child is born and becomes adult after a few days. It's strong enough discipline to work. Remember to feed them too. Village just curse many events. Okay, sick. So this is where shit starts getting wild. Decker Kane had a vision. Vision came to me. You brought us here too to die? Don't be stupid. We're here for the reason we could stop this. My prophecy. Today. According to what it says, events in the near future. No, all the days of the current year. What the fuck? Wrote down all the visions, each one coming on a certain day, the one was the first few days. So, as usual, all is well until the kids are brought into this world. Yeah, fuck, apparently, dude. And Doom event awaits us, we must prepare for it. What the fuck is this? Doom? Or see Doom event that'll be stronger than usual, still could be influenced? It will tie to the heat domain? Bro, that's some bullshit. What is this? Foresee an omen? An unknown? A season? A doom. Alright, cool. Sick. So there's a nice new life here. Disrespectful fool, you call me a liar, work hard, the dooms can be defeated. All about the prophecy, you need to rework to survive. Fear. Oh, 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 and fear is a mechanic. Okay, cool, cool. I'm... It's my vision. I was warning people to happen. Future events will appear here. Vision is tied to the domains, forces this one was sleeping. Fear domain. Difficult at times, howling wind, harshness of the people, pips mad, fear domain fiends on the inner struggles, a threat is high, people atrocious acts controlled by fear. What the? Bro, I thought we were playing video games not to experience real life. Prophecy, nothing can be done about the omen, the event will arrive, make things worse as predicted. Cool. Alright, so, so bullshit is what I'm saying, what I'm hearing from this. Okay, so four more days until he's fully grown here. Still useless. Can we make another baby? Child is already- okay, we cannot make another baby just quite yet. So let's build another house for another baby. And then we need to make a water supply. Our supply can go right there. We have everybody working. Sleep time! Sleep time! We're fucking kicking. The omen arrives in four days. Oh great, I can't wait for that shit to happen. Four people are still working. You still need time to research? Yeah, it looks like it. We're running out of wood. And we're running out of food. So we definitely need this to hurry the fuck up. Can I- can I change the- here, hold on. Uh, I don't know why. This should not need to be at, uh... Should be 1920 by 1080 on fucking- what is these fucking resolutions? Give me fucking 60 hertz. Sure, window. Yeah, that works fine with me. Alright. Oh, here. Uh, fast pass turn. There we go. Yes, perfect. Real world simulator. It's actually just real world simulator. Okay, see, now, now we're nice and fast. Okay, this is a little bit better now. Okay, so. Now we have one person doing a literally a jack shit. So now they got doing that. Can I... Can we, can we, can we bang? Not enough free... Oh, true. There we go. Alright, go bang again. Get that going. Okay, okay. The omens here in three days. We need some more... We need more smashy smash. More pips equals more time. We're gonna definitely have to get people to start working on their food supply, though. Nice. Huge. Growing. Love it. We have two more berry pickers soon. Not to mention a hunting tent's coming out soon as well. Just need a free house, dude. Yeah, true. True and real, bro. 
Okay, well now they, they smashy smash. That's good. We need more people on Barry's ASAP arena. Ailments? What do you mean, fucking ailments? Oh, oh, villagers? No, we're fine. Animals? 15 chickens. Busy pips, pips available to work? Yeah, go fucking... Go farm some fucking berries, bro. There we go. Okay, so now we're getting 12 berries to 6. Okay, so now we can build up our resources. Actually, let's let's do 8 and 6, and we need some more wood for more, more, more stuff. Our omen's arriving in two days, dude. Bro, that old guy's running a goddamn marathon, bro. He's actually a fucking legend. What is this? Oh shit, are we actually just straight up running out of berries? That's not good. What are you what are you crying about? Are you sick? Oh no, you're an adult now. Okay, cool. Um I don't know, go fucking pick more berries, I guess. Sounds like a good fucking start. So tomorrow. Yeah, I wouldn't expect an old man to work either. So tomorrow. Actually, you know what? Fuck you and your berries. Go fucking get us some goddamn water. There we go. So tomorrow, we will be able to... Oh, God. So tomorrow, we get a hunting tent and a fucking omen? All right, here we go. Let's see what the omen's all about. See what's so bad about this omen? A crow sighting? Are you sick? That actually happened to me, dude. Bro, imagine. Imagine a fucking fear threat crease permanently by one. Oh my god, a crow sighting? That's what's gonna scare people? Crow. Well. Well, new crow. There's a hunting tent. Woo! Okay, cool. We can make a hunting tent now. Increase the bar reach domain, measure its threat, reach its maximum. Domain, however, generate fear every day. Higher the threat, the higher generate. Roll's not lost, we can fear by creating hope. Wake, accumulate fear, bad events. Some abilities also help events. Okay, okay, okay. So we need to create that ASAP. Community. Four fucking days for that? God damn it! I wanted to make So G, how are you liking the game so far? I mean it's a very, very slow burn. I haven't I haven't seen how I felt about it just quite yet, but we'll see how it goes. I, I just I just don't think we've uh, gotten I, I I think we haven't gotten anywhere yet, personally. We have hit just the cusp. Um, I think, uh, you got two water. Okay, you don't need to do any more water. Let's, uh, I think it's time to build another smash post. Let's, let's do another smashy smash. That's only going to take four. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. More houses equal better. Okay, everybody's still working. Great, we can just do that again. So now that we got the tutorials and everything down, now everything's going to be start being a lot faster. So this is this is one out of two. Okay, so these can wait. Can these guys? Oh, these guys can mate again. Uh, I don't know about that, but okay, okay. Uh, I think to save everybody, uh, everybody needs to procreate. Uh, everybody should be smashing, except for the scientist, because scientist doesn't get to smash. We all know this. If you're a scientist, no smashing. Your life is dedicated to science. That's it. Hey, man. There's only this. Yeah! Woo! Two more babies! Can we smash again? More smash! Not enough smashing! Child is already growing up here. Oh, okay, facts. All right. Uh, okay. Well, now that everybody's going for the smishy smash, uh, we still need... 
We're gonna need a lot. We're oh, you know what I just realized? We don't have a steady food supply. Oh shit! I probably should have thought of that before I started building all the uh, building all the people. We're gonna we're gonna die out real fucking quick if we don't get our shit together. We're fine. Everything's fine. We probably should have made another baby, to be honest. We probably could have survived without an extra kid. Meeting point! Okay. Shared tables. Fantastic. Relaxing stand. Watcher. Great. Don't care. Distressed. Who cares? We need fucking chicken pen. That's what matters right now is a chicken pen. A meeting point. Plus one dwelling if it's a building within one. Oh, okay. So, so we can build our house all around here. Perfect. Beautiful. Beautiful. So good. Yum wow. Culture. We need, we need, we need more. Okay. We need that. And then we need... We need to get to every chicken before the chicken posts are over. Build away! Build away! I see! Unknown event is coming- oh fuck. Oh, we got five days. Here's a prophecy, could be bad, could be good. All right. Could be dangerous. Somewhat dangerous. Fortunately, we have several days to prep. Vision's waking. Better produce some hope. Trying to produce some fucking hope, dude. Okay, alright, so the domain's threat. Okay, so we just basically want to have to have to. Okay, so we have three pips available, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna create this. And we're gonna fucking just all these meeting posters. So, so good. Yeah, look, look at all that friendly meeting. Look at look at that. So nice. And then somebody else needs to, I don't know, cook on fucking berries, I guess. He fails like meta XP, so still good. All right, we're cooking. We're fucking hefty cooking. New resource, fear, sick. Doesn't matter, we got fucking meeting posts, bro. Look at that, look at that. Look at that plus one, baby. Everybody take the day off and meet. Let's have a good old meet and greet, except for the fucking scientist. Scientist, you don't get to. Plus four to plus one. Smash and hippie commune? Yeah, exactly, dude. Nerd, nerd needs to gain hard, bro. That's that's his only job. All right, so it's it's uh, four to two right now. Okay, let's do let's do another let's do another. Oh wait, two people can commune more. Look at that. Look at that. Look at all the look at the hippie meetup right there, bro. So now we get plus six. Six to two, six to three. We're fucking cooking, dude. Ain't no way I'm getting beat by the fear in two days. Poor scientist. Hey, bro, I, I, I just fucking watched so much Dr. Stone that it just doesn't even matter anymore, okay? It, do, it, just do, it just doesn't matter. Where the fuck is my hunting outpost? Hello? Hunting outpost? Where are you? Okay, we can build another one here. Uh, and then... We, we're we definitely gonna need... I'm gonna do one more day. It's under food. Oh, is it? Oh, oh, there it is. We need two wood. So one chicken equals three meat. Okay. What's this? This is called Dot Age, bro. They're like a city builder that's filled with a bunch of bullshit that happens. Basically, the game is meant to screw you over as quickly as possible. No if ands, or buts. Uh, you know, all is good and everything with the hippie commune, but like, can we get like back to work? Like, we need- we need some fucking berries, bro. Holy shit, do we ever need berries. And we need wood. We need wood so bad. 
success on the event. A hundred percent. Garen fucking teed. It's all our chicken coops. We get we get some wood here. What fuck? Oh, it has to hunt critters within two. But then that means I doesn't that mean I lose my I lose chickens? I guess we'll I guess we'll place it, sure. Oh yeah, look at all that, dude. You know that Here it goes. Alright, what is it? Aliens. Efficiency! Woo! I became efficient for five days. Let's fucking go. That's plus one logs, dude. After our event, buildings can sometimes be affected by conditions. Huge. Building condition turn. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm glad I did. Glad we all did our hippie shit. Got a chick. Oh, we got raising animals. Huge. Luring animals. So now our now we get four logs instead of two logs. That's double the action right there. Wait, how come how come nobody's building? Hello, hello. Get to f get to fucking building. Uh, you can knock it off with the berries. We have more than enough berries now. You can start building. Okay, that works. We're out of berries. Holy shit, we need a chicken coop. Did we craft? Did we not? Res did we fail the research on the chicken pen? Did we fail the research? You're fucking serious. You can't fail it? Then how the fuck? You need to build it. Oh. I knew that. I knew that! Holds three chickens. Oh, we have to- Oh, and then we have to lure them in. Oh, okay, okay, bet, 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 bet. Bet, alright. Alright, so everybody's doing something? Okay, we're gonna cook. What the fuck? Oh. Um, let's do... Oh, the kids can go play in the puddle. Relaxing stand. Let's, let's do shared table so nobody decides to try to, I don't know, stab each other, maybe? Barbecue? Oh, wait, no, that, no, we want that. No, we definitely want barbecue. We definitely want fucking barbecue. We, nobody, nobody wants to eat raw chicken. That's a definitely no-go zone. That's definitely a big bad. Resource cap. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm not hitting resource cap. You will lose berries as they are over capped. Well, yeah, of course. I need to stock up on all the fucking berries. Because I don't want to run out of berries before time fucking runs out. Because we got a goddamn... Shit's getting scary, man. Alright? Shit's getting scary. Well, I hear it about your... I'm having a food crisis, and you're telling me that that I'm gonna be running out of fucking berries? I don't want to hear it. I want to hear your blasphemous bullshit. All right, nice. Next, give me more berries. Wait, why did I lose eleven berries? That's kind of horseshit. Okay, so now he's farming. Okay, so now he's farming chickens for three chicken meat. That's good. Chicken coop chickens are entirely independent of chickens on the map. Those are one. one uh, oh. Oh, your cap is 40. Oh, my cap is 40. Oh, okay, so you fuckers shouldn't even be building. Okay, so what you're saying is I need to log more. Is what is what I'm hearing from this is I need more logging. Aha! Logging. That's right. That's right. And then you guys can go smash. Yeah, that's right. You smash. Um. You know what? Not even gonna question it. You know, it's, it's, yeah, it's whatever you want it to be. Sure. That's what you want it to be. Absolutely. 
Also, your storage cap is dry rate to your buildings. You currently have one billion per buying storage, 40 town hall. Uh, okay. I see. I see. So now we have 10 wood coming on in. It's a new World 6 farming mechanic. Yep. Yeah, dude. 100%. 110% my dude you know it oh you know I just realized uh I this chat is totally in the way chat is completely in the way to see what's happening there now chat can see what's going on okay so I, I'm gonna need some berries those guys are going to do that these guys are all getting more logs those two smashed. Hunting caps looking good. We're gonna get uh we're gonna get some chicken happening tomorrow. So now that everybody's hunting logs, let's uh let's go for uh hunting ground. Let's do another hunting ground. What is just chatting, dude? Yeah, right. Green arrows, the chickens, how many days to hunt? It's okay. There it is. There it is. More hunting. Where's our next catastrophe? I'm ready. I'm ready for our next catastrophe, bro. Hit us up. So we're gonna lose ten, so we can take so we can take about twelve, so we're gonna get another eight here. We have four more days. Wait, do I do I get so if I have wait, if I have two scientists? Wait. Oh no! I lost a scientist! Fuck! There you go. So I need that. All those scientists. All right. No, it's because I it's because I put that shit there. Okay, so now we have another. Okay, so now we're now we're billing two science per day. Oh fuck! Season's coming in. Bonds get ready for it. Heat domain beats the rising temperatures throughout the village. Hot seasons. Cold domain. Dangerous heat becomes your main. Okay, so we need water to survive, is what I'm taking, I guess. Okay, so we have one guy going there. We have two scientists. So now we get two per day, right? Should be, should be, why is it not two per day? Lumberjack, so nice of Griffey, dude. Hey, bro, it is what it is, all right? Wait, why aren't they, why, why do I get two thinking points? Uh, you stop picking berries and you go build that shit. Do we have, did we get, yeah, we did. Okay, cool. We got, we got some chickens. Okay, that's nice. It's real good, real nice. I, I like this. This is, this is going, this is going swimmingly. Do, do we really, we don't really need more logs right now. So you can go ahead and, uh, you can go ahead and pick those berries. And then we can go ahead and, uh, God, I don't, there's raw material buildings. So, I'm gonna need fucking leather. It's definitely something that's gonna have to happen. Do we want more smashy smash? Probably not. Relaxing stand isn't happening. And then herb picker. Wait a minute. Wait a minute! Is hemp meant to make the other shit? Remember the chicken coop you built? Yeah. Yeah, we gotta get f fuckers to lure it. Lure it. Uh, lure animal. Lure one of the wild creatures that inhabits this. Oh, it's- oh, it's- oh, I need seeds. I need potential chance at seeds. Alright, hot season's right around the corner, chat. Right around the corner! Did I get any seeds? I did not get any seeds. Sick. Oh, change production. Oh, I need... Oh, I need... Oh. 
Okay. This probably would make a little bit more sense. I knew that. I knew that. So we get plus three next round. And we can barbecue our chicken. Oh, hallelujah. Our food is going to be popping the fuck off, dude. Ain't going to need no berries. Tired of eating berries. Barbecue. No, I don't care about education. I prefer my people to be illiterate, so then I can tell them what to do without them questioning my existence. Sometimes all you need is just to be illiterate. There's the barbecue. Can't put it there. I can put it right there, though. Barbecue. Okay, so we got that going. So now we got we got the barbecue. I mean, so far, I think we're looking pretty good. I'm liking, liking where this is going. We're running out of fucking berries real quick, though. Okay, stop foraging. Lure animal. Okay, so now that we got the barbecue, we need a hunter's lodge. We need egg farm. Okay, chill. Chill, dude. Butcher's table. It's kind of fucked up. Skinning rack. Oh, it's kind of fucked up. Edumacation. What is this for? Remedy rug. Health. Retreat. Thinker. Altar. Are you joining Dot Age? That's all right. Clearing. Stone gatherer. Holy shit. I get it. Stone gathering, clearing. Don't know if I really want clearing right away. You got all that, right? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, a hundred percent. Yeah, that was easy. It's just five head. It just takes. Just remember it, idiot. Uh, we're probably gonna want. Uh, Skinning rack gets us leather, but we haven't gone to that point yet. Village hall. That's what I want. What am I? I need stone. Okay, so I'm going to need to get a stone gathering happening. Or a bigger wood stack. Let's grab, let's grab stone gathering here. That'll be done in three, six, nine, tw four days. We'll have it, we'll have it in four days. Okay. Season arrives, you cannot influence this outcome. Event level depends on the current year. Oh, fuck, it's gonna be hot as shit, isn't it? Usually says it's production as an icon, upper right picture. Okay. Got our stone. Really like if our berries would have replenished. That'd be kind of nice, not gonna lie. Okay, let's lure another chick. Fuck, I need more berries. Okay, that guy's still crafting. Let's get the barbecue going. That guy's still getting the barbecue going. So we'll have two more pips tomorrow for availability. Holy shit, we're losing an insane amount of berries at an insanely rapid rate. They need to hurry up and cook that fucking food, bro. We are, we are getting to a point where this is starting to turn real bad. We got like two days of survival. Oh, and then the chickens need seed in order to survive. Oh, okay. All right. Good to know. Glad, glad we, uh, uh, why did I think that we didn't need to feed the chickens? That wasn't very smart of me. Now, was it? I was kind of dumb thinking chickens don't need food. All right, well, at least we're, you know, we're getting some cooked food happening. All right. Okay, cool. Is everybody doing their own shit? You know, we got people... Cl oh, my God, we're out of berries. Oh, fuck. Uh... Uh. Hmm. All right. 
Everyone is like, nah, no, let's smash, dude. I thought, you know, smashing would be fine. Okay, everything's gonna replenish. Everything's gonna replenish. Guaranteed, I, I, I did big brain about this. Rhett to plus one year, all right. Summer is the heat, harsher during summer, at least to fend off for the domain. Season starts, restock. Left on check. Okay. So we got our berries back. Boom. Big brain play, dude. Insane brain. God, I'm so fucking good at this game. I am a fucking crazy at this game, dude. Um, these guys are farming chickens and shit, and they're doing their barbecue. Um, these guys are farming seeds. Oh shit, this guy should be farming hemp. Why are you not farming hemp? Or, or seeds. So, you know what? Let's uh let's get you to pick berries today though. You're gonna be You're gonna get perfect time just because I, I planned it. I totally planned it. I was being fucking huge brain. Where the fuck is the rest of my guys? What are my other guys doing? So this guy's doing this, this guy's picking berries, this guy's picking berries, this guy's building our food supply up. We're still gonna lose two and two. Why are we losing two and two? Okay, so we we have I, we have a lot of that for now. So you should go pick berries. I don't want to lose any of our raw meat. So that should be enough that we're not going to lose any raw meat, right? What the fuck? Okay, it looks like we're going to lose raw meat regardless. Okay, well we need to get some water. It's summertime. It's fine. Oh, oh, right, right, because I'm cooking two meat. That's correct. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Stone gathering. Food supplies going fucking burr. Food supplies going burr. Why am I losing three now? Oh, three is food. Plus around the automation, forbid pips eating stuff the threshold, otherwise they'll try to keep food even. Oh. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, I guess it's not a huge deal, I guess. Because at least if we have some, like, somewhat of a reusable resource, it's not a big deal. Just, man, hunting takes fucking forever. Okay, so you don't need the water right away. You're gonna go back to the hunting den. Um, you still need to pick a fuck ton of berries. You're picking a fuck ton of berries. That's enough chickens for now. This is the thinking tank. We need some new thinking going on here. We do- oh my god. We need- we need more- we need a bang again. That's what we really need. Ah, uh, fuck. 17 chance to take a good vent based on the current threat. You'll need five more cold to get a- HOW DO I GET A HUNDRED COLDS?! How do I make shit cold? Under community? Oh, fuck. Oh, well. Oh, god damn it. A fucking puddle. Yeah, put it in the fridge, bro. I need a fucking puddle, dog. I need a fucking puddle. It's fine. I lose two wood. It's gonna take two days to learn. We have our cooking coming in two days. It's level Wyoming blood. <laughs> Thanks, Wally. Keep that, keep that in mind for next time, man. Thanks, man. It's apocalypse, go lay in a mud paddle. Bro, it's, you know, it's all about the puddles, bro. All about the puddles. So, I mean, I mean, we're still, we're still cooking. Like, we're still making good amounts of food here. But, like, do I want to go more smashy smash, or... Do I need to farm more seeds? I mean, he could probably not farm seeds for a couple of days. You go farm some berries. 
Yeah, that, that looks pretty good. I, I like that. We need it. We need to get a nice cooking white meat food supply. Predators is your apocalypse, apparently. Probably. Can I make a fucking puddle now? All right. Let's make the puddle. 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 Pond. If water maker within one heals one burning pip with water. Okay, well we're gonna we're gonna fucking we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna do We're just gonna do three fucking pawns here, dude. Here we go, three pawns. Or two pawns. Two pawns is fine. Two pawns. Coupon, two pawns. So if I take those guys off and build, build. Alright, alright, that look that look yeah, uh, we're looking good. Yeah, two pawns, yeah, yeah, yeah. One seed per chicken every day. Really producing one, not two. I mean, oh shit. We're fine. We're fine. We're, we're, we got we got seeds cooking. It's fine. We're gonna use a lot of food today. It's going to be a mighty amount of food. Okay, it's looking good. Well, they don't need to be on there. Because they are not burning. Oh wait, no. Do we do we need it? Oh, that will give me plus three. Oh shit! Are we gonna burn? I think we might burn. I think I think I think we're gonna fucking burn here. Everything's everything's looking bad. This game's this game is stressful. Come on, baby! 17% chance! We got this. This is easy. We, we This is fucking easy mode. Fuck. Oh, no. Yikes, dude. That's some bullshit. Some events are damaged. Bill, shut the f- I don't- No, no! Shut the fuck up. Don't tell me about what I'm losing at. I'm winning. I'm a fucking winner. Alright. Bro, it did touch the berries. This is- this is all sorts of kinds of bad right now. We are not in a good spot. Actually, I'm gonna be honest, we're not in a terrible spot. You guys can not fucking touch the water anymore. That'd be fantastic. You can touch the water. Um, you can, you can touch that. Uh, how are we doing? Oh, fuck. We have no wood. Oh, because we've been burning all our wood. Don't go touch. Go farm some wood. The torch people would have been getting dick, dude. Now, fuck those guys, bro. Those guys can GTFO. Those guys can be losers. Okay, we're looking pretty good. And now we're officially out of raw meat. So that guy can go to the hunting grounds. That guy doesn't need to farm that anymore. This guy can go to farming more water for, their, for our next fucking inferno. You just had a baby chicken too. I think my baby chicken's fine. Baby chicken's fine. He's got the fucking seeds and everything. Fucking good. It's fucking cooking. We're not losing. We're actually pretty solid on resources. Our wood supply needs to build up again since we're not cooking anymore. So that will slowly be building up. Um, we still need our berries going fine. We got those hunting for meat. Perfect. I mean, basically, we're just waiting for the bigger pond. Stone? Fuck. Beware! Doom event is coming! It may end the village! Oh, fuck me. Each page of prophecy and vision of doom will appear.
We don't even have the wood to build uh, a stone area anyways. We need six wood, man. We don't even have, we don't even have enough wood. We'll, we'll have it by tomorrow. We're so fucking dead, bro. We're so dead, dog. We are so fucking boned. That's just for fucking... Just for feathers. Times do water. Okay, that's kind of pog. Okay, let's grab herb. Alright, so now we can build our stone. You know, I, you know what I think my problem is? I think I fucked too early. I think I went the smashy smash a little too early. I should have calmed down. Current hunting two, three days. Solid air minus one chicken per day. Yeah, I think I think if I didn't I, I think if I didn't have a smash zone too much, we would have been fine. Damn, bro. Eidolon World 6, dude. I'll be okay with that, hug. Herb! Can we upgrade? I hug. Well, that was a waste. It's only seasonal, bro. Fuck. The whole sorts of kinds of bad here. Oh! Oh no! I didn't even realize the heat was heating up. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. Oh no. Oh god. I made a big boo boo. I made a big boo boo. Um, he's gathering. I, I think the rocks were fucking pointless at this point, dude. You know, I've, we need to halt all construction. We need to. We need to fucking get this shit together here. I need. We we need another small pond. Build that shit. Skill issue. It is a fucking skill issue. You're not wrong. Let's build another pond. Now we're getting plus five to plus three. We have an 11% chance not to get dicked. I'm liking that. That's a good, that's a good chance. It's a good chance of not getting dicked. Okay, well, since you're doing that, you can do that now. Same with you, you can do that now. Start cooking. Just make sure our food supply is going up nicely. 50-50 chance. Oh, uh, that's, that's, not, that's not what I'm worried about. There is a fucking 100% chance I'm gonna get dicked in the next three. Oh, there's a 22% chance. I'm just trying to see if I can survive this doom, bro. Oh god, I need to be- oh god, I need somebody to be in the fucking water. Uh... This is- oh god. Okay, start fucking getting water. Would you like to hear it? After I get dicked. We have a 33% chance of living.
I see. Curse Omen. Oh, you gotta be fucking serious. We have a 33% chance of living. We leave it- we leave it to the RNG gods. RNG gods, chat. I'm not ready. A 33 fucking percent chance of getting dicked. Here we go. Yes! Ah! Ah! Fuck you, game! My RNG is insane! That's right. That's right. Ain't no thing but a chicken wang. Never a doubt. Boom! We survived our first try, chat. First try, first doom. Easy. Easiest game of my fucking life. The game, the village gains 30 knowledge. Crops allow two more activations before depleting. Territory expands one tile more. I would say, wait, does that mean, does crops mean like berry bushes as well? So does that mean I get two more activations from the berry bushes? Territory expands one plus one. Is that better? Stands three instead of two. I mean, that doesn't really matter all that much. But doesn't this give me, doesn't this give me more berry bushes activations? Or not? What, I, I, I feel like I'm wrong on this, but I feel like more food would be better, right? I think it's crops only. Fuck. All right, let's make crops. Wait-ho! We're gonna make crops. We gotta make crops. Gotta make crops. What is that? What is that? What? Fuck. What the? Nice! Woo! We survived, chat! We fought the doom brought upon us, but I sense this is not the end. I see it now, new and stronger challenges are coming. Prophecy clear in mind, let me tell you. Oh, what the fuck? Omen, omen, doom event, omen, bro, that's so, that's so much worse. What is this? Puzzles. Mini events. Sometimes mini events, usually good. Nice! So now we have 29 events with a new mechanic. It's pretty big. Uh, two uses, five uses, four uses, five uses, five uses. I think it's the same. Easiest game of my life, chat. That wasn't even fucking hard, dude. Anybody said this game's hard, obviously has never played this game well before. Yeah, plus is actually huge when you have crops. Yeah, that, we need to hard focus crops. Uh, you guys don't need to be... You guys don't need to be cooking anymore. Omen's fine for now. There's an omen's coming up, so we want to make sure that you have at least the plus two. Go back to this, because we do need this for crops. For fuck, fuck it, man. We're ready. No, we're fucking not. We're not even close to ready. I ain't starting a new run right now. Are you fucking kidding me? What a nightmare. This game's already hard enough. Tilt soil, tasks. Nice. Let's build a farm! Yo, send me to Sam! Build a farm! Cow farm, because there's gonna be cows outside. 
No cost. Add soil. I want soil. Give me two soil. Hell yeah, brother. Out of raw meat. That's okay. That's all right. We don't need any more raw meat. Barley field. Barley. Hemp field. Wait. Wait. Can I not? I thought I could put tomatoes on... Oh. Hey, I was, I was, I was, I was, I was not, that is, that, that, that does not help for, for, does that help for tomato plants? I feel like that just straight up just doesn't help for tomato plants. Go collect some fucking seeds then, I guess. Uh, you can go back hunting. Please, please, please. Hunt. So we'll let that research in two days. Now we're now we're now we're getting now we're getting lots of seeds. We need our tomato we need our tomato plants like instantly, dude. We're running out of food real quickly. I would know I'm a farmer. We don't have any stone, by the way. Just wanna just wanna make that apparent that we are stoneless. And uh these guys do not need to be here anymore. Okay, uh let's uh I mean he can go you can go farm. My toaster, absolutely. I love my toaster. What game is this? It's called Dot Age, my dude. You need to put a worker in the stone hut to get stone. I think. I think. I'm. I'm almost positive. I might. I might have seen the tutorial that said something about me having to put a character on a set area in order to collect the resources. I'm not 100 percent sure, but it might be what it is. Planting. Okay, so now that we have tomato trees, nice, nice, five days, not enough water, oh fuck me, I need water, fuck, I gotta build another water supply, god damn it. Yo, Wiseception, thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome on in. We have two days until the omen. I think I'm fine. Alright, next thing we want to craft is probably a well? That'll take us four days. More water. Give us more water. Looks fun. It's, uh, it's stressful. We need to make fucking tomatoes ASAP. Almost just prediction, not a test event. Oh, shit. Bem Bombo game the criminal. Can I kill him? Main threat increases, presents more power. Uh, can we can we just coward? Okay. Can I just assassinate? Is she? Cross an omen coming for us. Something bad is about to happen. Memory tree sickness domain. This is what happens when you don't let the scientist bang. <laughs> you know? <laughs> hey. <laughs> I think you might be onto something. Maybe, maybe that's uh, truly what the problem was. Maybe that was my problem all along. Okay, so COVID? We can't have COVID. Well, they were too busy making me too busy making me stuff. All right, all right. So, uh, can I like destroy this guy? Can I like put him into the like ozone layer or some shit? 
Oh, fuck. I need to do... Can I skip... Don't do any more production? Can I just start producing on, uh... That, what was that? That hemp bed? Where's the hemp bed? Shared table, bonfire, edumacation. That's what I want. I want that. Give me that. Give me that instead. That's what I really need. No buildings that cure ailments? Yeah, but we can also make it so it, they don't get sick. That's the big brain. Wait, so will this just... I will just get a random damage to each building a day? Is that was that my understanding? That's kind of horse. That's kind of boo shitty -o, dude. Well, these guys don't get water anymore, so you guys need to go back to your theory crafting here. Uh, oh, there's one person idling. Well, okay, then you can get water. Right? We should be good. Yeah, old berries. Berries are fine. We got our food. Our food is not terrible. We got some seeds cooking away. We got our plants, our crops going, dude. We're going to have tomatoes here pretty soon. We're going to be able to survive everything. Almost survive the apocalypse. What the fuck is happening now? What the fuck was that? Oh, hey, thumbs up. Hey, thumbs up. Ah, uh, bro, probably skibbity enjoyers. This is fucking. Oh, all oh, right. Oh, random event. I forgot we unlocked random events. I totally, I totally fucking forgot about that. I knew that. I knew that. No luck getting Fury Relic again. You'll get it, dude. Watch out for snakes. Had it. These motherfucking snakes on this motherfucking plane. Are we running out of food? No, I... I yeah. Yeah, we really are. It's only three more days. There's an 83% chance that I will get sick. Okay, let's keep it cranking. Okay, there's our remedy rug. That's exactly what we needed. Healing. One hemp is one HP. You need to build that for two days. Three or four weeks from now. Uh, we're probably thinking January. I mean, I mean, Lava said January. I don't know why I said that. I don't know why- I don't know why we said we're thinking. Uh, that had nothing to do with me. Lava's thinking fe Lava's thinking February. I don't- I don't- I- I- yeah, I don't know why I said that. Lava, shut the fuck up. No, I didn't- It was a complete, utter accident! It's not fucking confirmed. Shut up, it's not confirmed! You're cooking on nothing. So what's the what's the point of the chicken coop, by the way? Doesn't really seem like there's anything really, really good about it. Okay, so you have picked enough berries. And you can go we need more wood. Go chop some more wood. Actually, you know what? You can go water you can get more get us more water. We need way more water. Egg building or butcher with it. Oh. Yeah, I yeah, I knew that. Yeah, I do that. Yeah, yeah, I do that. Easy, bro. I, I was testing you. That was a that was a, that was a trick test. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that was a trick. You passed. It is what it is. Can I fucking upgrade this shit yet? No, not yet. Yo, tomatoes. Yo, those are kind of those are kind of sussy ass tomatoes, dude. Not gonna lie. So, chill off the berries for a minute. Wait, that's not fucking worth it! You get two tomatoes? Over berries that give you fucking four? There's another resource? Yeah, you're right. So, Lava wins World 6? I don't know, man. It's fucking... 
Eventually, hopefully. So you can stockpile. Oh, stockpiling for winter. Right of it. Light bulb. Cool. Thanks. Thanks, dude. Real, real fucking nice. Villagers lose one water. We gain two gold. Act like it. I have no idea, bro. I have literally no idea. You're getting lucky with these vents. Good XP. I see an unknown event coming. Oh, it's fear. Plus three per day? You're fucking with me. You serious right now? You serious? Okay, let's, uh, we're gonna, we have to counteract that. Um, third Bob Joe Pickle. Huge, bro. Let's take these guys out. Stop doing science for the day. No more science! Oh, we have a 100% chance to not get any ailments. Fucking killing it. So we're getting a 4 to 3 ratio right now. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing pretty freaking good, man. Is anybody getting sick? What the fuck? There should have been a 0% chance. It's called, uh, dot age, my dude. Gry is stunned for three days. Sickness threat is incredibly begins a symptomatic perk. What the fuck? Disease? Pips are not immune to sickness. Okay. Belly. Sp ready for some explosive spell. Okay, so we're just gonna shit himself. Yeah, hit me up, Wally. So that means, that means the pip's useless for three days. So what, you're just gonna, you're just gonna sleep, not even bother sleeping? What the farmer say to the DJ? I don't know, you let me, what, what bro? Huh? Let me know. What, what do you say? Okay, yeah, that's three days stunned. All right, well, that's not a big deal. It is what it is. It is what it is. All right, so what are we struggling with right now? We are fucking out of berries. Are we out of berries? Oh shit, we are out of berries. Oh no. Uh, we need to we need to build. We need a we need a hefty build. Gonna go now, thanks for the stream. Will the stream be an account to clip or a vod? It'll just be on the vod. Just watch the vid. The vood. Okay, alright, alright, okay, okay, alright. So now we will unlock two more berry bushes. And then this guy, I mean, he's probably gonna have to go... Probably more hunting. I would think. And then since we survived, we don't really need the remedy, so... Oh, because this guy got stunned. Oh, that's right. Okay, that's fucking dumb. Thanks for giving us. We, you don't have any proof. Let us turn up the beat. I. <sighs> Let us turn up the beat. I. I am. I am so upset. I am. I am so. So upset. I can't. I can't believe. You're also losing herbs with the rug. Oh, am I? Well, he can farm. He can farm some hemp then. We have three days for that to happen. Uh, he's picking berries. We don't need to pick that many berries. Go commune for happiness, so that doesn't get any stronger. Um, this guy's picking berries. How are we doing for wood? Oh, we are so good on wood right now. Go pick some berries. I know, I think we're actually doing pretty good today. 
I think overall, we're doing good. Bigger Tau Hall, still need more stone. Eh. I still have to, I still have to upgrade my Town Hall first. I stopped production on science, so we didn't have the manpower. Bro, it totally feels like I'm playing fucking Dr. Stone right now. It's kind of crazy, not gonna lie. Waiting for this two days to go over. Okay, last day. We have a 100% chance of winning this. We can go get some stone, Doug. Go get some stone, homie. Oh, we're out of berries! Nice. Easy game. Meta progression. I found out today that you can play video games without pants. I mean, I don't wear pants. I'm not wearing pants right now, bro. Basic tools. I think I'm wearing pants right now, bro. I can feel it in my bones. Get ready for it. Let's get healthy, baby. Bro, this game's for fucking babies. What an easy game. Uh, okay, so we're getting... Okay, so we got a little bit of berries to, to keep us going for just a tad. Um, do we need any more health? No, we don't really need any more health. So these guys can stop commuting for now. Uh, seasonal event revives in uh, a few days. So let's go ahead and get some cold happening here. A little bit of cold snap action. This guy really doesn't need to build any more hemp. Uh, let's go back to, I guess, science, maybe? I would think, yeah, science. Or, actually, no, we need a build-up for the winter. I feel like winter is coming. Or, wait, no, it's autumn. Autumn's on the next next time. There we go. All right, all right. Now we're picking tomatoes. Smashing? No, we don't need to... We need to build a food supply first before we start thinking about fucking smashing. Unknown event coming! I mean, good thing we farmed up all that hemp. Good thing we actually, that's, that's freaking huge, dude. We got seven stacks on this. Thank you for the stream. But before I go, we review my account to be a clipper. No, it's just going to be on the VOD. Like I said, I already said that. It's going to be on the VOD, bro. It wasn't even a review. What, what? Okay, shake those hips. Nice. What the fuck is that? Meditation for nature? There, there's another one? Cataclysmic domain. Bro, how many problems are we going to have? Why don't you add some more? Yeah, peace out, dude. Let's get more tomatoes. Let's stockpile this shit. We need more tomatoes. So we are losing some food, but we are gaining a sh that's like seven days worth in tomatoes. That's big. That's big. But I noticed our science has not been advancing. But we need we need to build up enough water supply for the upcoming event. Wait, if the next season's autumn, I don't think it really matters, but we do- we are gonna have to start getting to a point where we're gonna have to deal with fire. Because fire is the thing. So we're gonna have to do edumacation on fire. Where is it? Where's my fire edumacation, bro? So if there's uh oh there's- oh here it is. Bonfire. Consumed by water events, heal one with wood. Okay, okay, that's what we need. That's what we fucking need. Edumacate him? Yep, yeah, edumacate. I need to edumacate, dude. Bad, big time. Fucking Deckard Kane looking ass, dude. He's doing pretty good. Alright, now we got tomatoes, 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 potatoes, tomatoes. Get some water. 
Keep that solid. Our food supply. Holy shit, our food supply is looking really bad right now. We're almost in the next season, so we'll we'll we're really close to getting some our berries re re replanted. The unused water pits just look like my pips are going to fall in the death of them. Dude, this it's the quickest way. Quickest way of travel. Um they don't really need to be doing that anymore. They need to be go back to science. Go get your ass. We got we got three science points we need to do here. Autumn, baby! Bro, this guy's fucking ha always has issues. Cold domain is enabled. Seasonal threat this year. Oh, we have cold now? This ain't Eidolon? Yes, it is. Look at the top right corner. It is Eidolon. What you mean? That oh, was Eidolon's against. Yeah, this is World 6. This is, the, the, yeah, welcome, welcome to World 6. Know what I'm saying? So tomorrow we'll have bonfire. So it's gonna get plus one cold every single day. We need to get wood chopping ASAP Arena. Start chop. We need we need wood chop big time. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to get a bunch of fire just to keep this just to keep everything cooking here. We have five days before we start freezing. Yeah, we're good. 100%. Easy. Easy game. Bro, this game this game's too too easy. New mechanic or happiness? Uh, I rather unlock happiness personally. Plus 2 becomes efficient for 5 days. Love it. Did I get efficiency on my Oh! Nice! Efficiency on my alchemy! What a gaming efficiency, bro. Okay, so we need bonfire. That's only six wood. That's not too bad. You a bruggy, dude. Yo, thank you, dude. Thank you for the primer, man. Appreciate it. Big preach. Okay, so we need that. Hope you're enjoying the content, my dude. We can do one day without this guy. Ah. Uh, next up, we got alchemy, baby. Now, next up, we got drop rate. Okay, what are we cooking up next? We got the large bonfire. Don't care just quite yet. We're fine with this. Relaxing stand. Don't know what that does. Growth. Um, we need we need more cultivation here. Uh, this is herb. Seasonal autumn herb picking. Don't really need that right now. Um, wait, what? Two, seven each building within tracks thunder events retreat gives you plus it gives you two hold up that's kind of that's kind of fire paper maker suspect susceptible susceptible sus susceptible oh this one oh wait we need this this heals this heals sickness definitely big need that bro okay so those are going to be built tomorrow right Okay. 12 wood for that, chat. 12 fucking wood for that, dude. Big price. We're gonna have to get our- We're gonna have to get our freaking cold snap cooking here real soon. Alright. Alright, so now we got plus four on that. Huge. So now we're gonna save ourselves. It's gonna go all the way to 60%. We got three days for an unknown event to happen. Doesn't even matter. We got six days on each of those. We're looking great. We're cooking with those plus four a day. Man, we are a zooming right now. But uh we are we are running out of resources slowly here.
Pharmacist stand, huge. Quite, we don't need that quite yet because no one's getting sick. We just need to survive this next event. That is four wood per. Um, the tomatoes are this, this is, man, maybe I should create more smashing. Like, like I should be smashing more ass here pretty quick. Uh, let's take one guy off here. Let's throw him on here just for, just so we're staying in the, just, just so we're just breaking even. Uh, healer's hut. Don't, that takes 12. Uh, probably, probably wood stack, right? I would assume, no, woods, no, that doesn't really fucking matter. We don't, we've been burning through our wood super easy. I'm thinking that we need to start, yeah, egg farm. Egg farm is the next thing. And what's this? What happened to this? What's going on with this? Light bulb? Doing a dance? Meditation? Oh, just, just, okay. Just three knowledge out of left field. Sick, thanks. Real, real appreciate that one. It's real sick. Hey, ooh, and that got me egg farm. Produce required tool. You're able to train your pip using that tool. Oh, sick. Okay. I mean, I have six basic tools, so I can, I can, almost all the higher pips give you more production per pip. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. We're, I'm not, I'm not, not quite there yet. We need the village hall, actually. Village hall for storage is going to be our, especially for next season. Wait, no, that's, wait, no, we have winter next season. Oh, fuck. Um, I don't know if we want to do that. I think we want to, um... Paper maker? I don't know if we want to do... I don't know if we want to do that. Wood stack? Does this make my guy into a lumberjack? No, this guy... Oh, this is to make basic tools. So let's, I want to try to see if I can get, you know what, let's, let's build this to see if we can get into the basic tool gain. Start getting higher pips happening, get farmers rolling, all that good stuff. Okay, well, we definitely survive the next upcoming. Easy. Bing bong, Beasel, there it is. Ba, 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 ba. Seeds! So That's a lot of fucking seeds, man. Lucky harvest, baby! God damn, I'm good at this game, dude. We survived up to day 76. Day 76, chat, and we're still cooking. Current score for the survey. I mean, that's not bad. But chat. Dot age. I think it. I think it might be that time. It might be that time, chat. I mean, the game's all right. Game's not too bad. I wouldn't say it's. Is it? Is it? Is it kind of the game for me? I don't. I don't know if I'm gonna play it again. But I mean, it's all right. I enjoyed my time playing it, but am I going to ref refund it? Yeah, probably. But with that being said, chat, it's not as good as Nova Lance. That is the end of the stream. I hope you guys enjoyed. It's definitely a slow burn. It's definitely 100% a slow burn, but it's it's not a bad game. I I can understand why it's overwhelmingly positive. It's a it's a it's a good it's a good game. Just take your time, you know, strategize, get it going, get it rolling. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys had fun. Thank you for all the follows today. Appreciate it. We'll be back at it at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time tomorrow for the beautiful, beautiful Friday. You gotta love it. Gotta love to see it. You know it. I know it. We all know it. Maybe we will check out a few things, do some more idle on stuff, get that going. But thank you for all the subscribers today. Thank you for the biddies. Thank you for the resubs, the primers, guys. Keeps the dream a reality. Keeps your brother off the streets. Keeps the IBA rations nice and high. We're working on the brand new video coming out, chat. Hopefully we can get it done as soon as possible. So if you haven't, make sure to check out the YouTube. Wait, is it only Wednesday? Is, wait, is it Thursday today? Or is it Wednesday? No, it's Thursday. Yeah, it's Thursday. Also, if you haven't, make sure to check out the Discord. I'm hopefully, hopefully going to have the video done by... Uh, 
by Saturday. Uh, Sunday is going to be the latest. Sunday will be the latest. So I'm going to be as soon as I'm hopping off stream right now to go work on it. Uh, so hopefully we can have it done by, hopefully I can release it by Saturday and then we can uh, start working on the next video. And I think the next video is going to be uh, how to, how to, how to, how to proficiently card farm. I think that's going to be the next video. It's going to be a much shorter guide, but you know, it's still a guide on the list, but at least we got that. Wait, you do videos? Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Fucking hilarious. Fucking hilarious, Nick. But with that being said, I've been your guild master for today. My name is Griffy Bit, proud owner and leader of this beautiful, dedicated, hardworking Giga Chad dot age enjoying shiny farming itty bitty army. And I'll see you guys tomorrow at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Hope you guys stay safe, happy grinding, and peace out. Good night, chat. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. See you later. Bye. Have fun. Okay, bye. See ya. Go watch somebody else. Okay, bye. See ya. Have fun.